And we are live. What's up, guys? Welcome to Fresh Air Podcast. After our edition, we're joined with a bunch of lovely ladies. Let's get into it. Let's go. All the night is my world. You want to get off? If you want to leave, you you could, you're more than welcome. To I leave. asked you to stop with the question, and you didn't. Do you get want out, me to leave? Serious, go. Put your shoes on outside. You don't got to put them on in here. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to Fresh Air Podcast. Do me a quick favor, guys. On your way, and go ahead and. Like the video and uh quick announcement before we get into the show. Number one, patreon.com slash fresh fit. As you guys know, it's the beginning of the month. So go ahead and get on Patreon so you don't get double charged. Get get in now so you can get the most out of it, guys. Okay, patreon.com slash fresh fit, where we do a monthly Zoom call. We help you guys out with the telegram chat. All we the help you guys tips on girls, dating, yeah, behind the scenes of Frank Castles. Actually, no, we gotta post the one of the crazy feminists from yesterday. Yeah, yeah, we, do. yeah we gotta post that one. We'll post the triggered <laughs> feminist from yesterday on Patreon, guys. Check that out. As you guys know. We had a debate, and she got mad, and she walked out, and yeah, she just started, you know, I just was going to put this. Yeah, pretty much, bro, I was just, the whole time she was complaining, oh my god, I got bullied in math class. Uh, like, <laughs> oh right. my god. So, uh, <laughs> anyway, yeah. but yeah, check that out on patreon.com slash fresh fit. It was a good show, though. It went four hours long. I don't think today's show was going to go that long, hopefully. Uh, but regardless, check us out over there. Also, we talk about real estate, making money, crypto. Uh, I just got into stocks, guys. I made a Vanguard mm-hmm. account and I got a Webull account. I'm going to tell you guys about some of the stocks that I've, uh, I've been buying uh, mm-hmm. and index funds, ETFs, etc. And I did invest in Chewy. Yes, I did. So that's going to probably go up. So uh, shout out to everyone that needs to buy dog food. Also, check us out on Spotify, Google, and Apple Podcasts. Every single platform you listen to podcasts, we are there. Click that anchor link, link below and it'll take you to a destination of your choice where you like to listen to podcasts. Also, Fresh Fit Podcast Store. <laughs> What's so funny? But... <laughs> yeah, the chat is ruthless. <laughs> oh, I said Jimmy I'm no fresh. Try. Jimmy. Oh, <laughs> oh no. <laughs> 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 it's Spike, baby. Spike. Spike, Spike look <laughs> slim. Follow me on Instagram. You feel me? <laughs> um, and her Instagram is below, guys, if you want to check her out. Um, yeah, yeah, Freshfitpodcaststore.com, guys. Uh, get the merch, get the t shirts, hoodies, etc. They're all there. Also, we got another YouTube channel. It's called Fresh Fit Clips, guys. If you don't got time to watch the full on podcast, and see me lose my hair follicles in slow time, <laughs> go ahead and check out the Clips channel where you can see me lose my hair follicles in fast time. Check us out over there. Fresh and Fit Clips is the YouTube channel. Also, Fresh and Chris also have YouTube channels. So guys, for behind the scenes, man, if you want to see the vlog channel, check it out. 100K on the way. Let's go. I'm sorry, but where Shout out to the Merce gang, coming? by the way. We did a lit pre-show. You guys showed up. Uh, we just hit 3K subs on Twitch. So down the market for you guys. <laughs> Follow my gaming channel on YT. Uh, first video is going up. I finished editing the video, so I will post it. Make sure you guys know about that. Uh, celebrating 3K. And ladies, if you want to call on to our show, make sure you DM me and Aaron C. Poxon on your IG. Uh, please don't bring any men with you. You know, two of your girls would want to bring girls, uh, men tonight. One girl actually bought a, a guy tonight. I had to tell her no. She went back home. Shout out to her. Much love for her. But um, no guys in the studio, guys. So let's make it happen. Uh yeah, and then also guys, um uh oh, oh yeah, you already did that. Okay, and then oh yeah, and then you talked about your vlog. Yep. Okay, yeah, we're good. And then last thing, guys, I got a YouTube channel as well. It's called Fed It. I break down criminal cases on there. As you guys know, I used to work in law enforcement, and every week I break down a case. Last week I did O Block, the week before that I did Casanova. Um, and I did K Flock as well and Wind W Melly, whatever. So if you guys want to kind of see how those cases are gonna go, check me out on over there, man. I read the court documents with you guys and walk you through because you know I kind of give you guys another perspective because I don't know anyone else on YouTube that was a former Fed that can break down cases to that level because I used to do those cases. So, you know, now I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> get hated on by everybody. So uh, so check us out. Check me out over there, guys. Fed it is a YouTube channel. It's growing really quick. So check me out over there. But also, without further ado, man, let's uh, introduce the girls. You guys, real quick. By the way, we came late because we were at oh, yeah. Jordan Peterson's event. Shout yeah. out to him, man. Shout out to Jordan Peterson. Uh, awesome event, guys. So go check it out. We have tomorrow. Uh, Michaela Michaela's Peterson. coming tomorrow night. Uh, yeah. She's going to be on tomorrow at 7.30 p.m., guys. So it'll be lit. Shout out to her. Shout out to her dad. All right. um, but yeah, so ladies, give us your name, your age, what you do for a living, current dating, dating status, and then your highest education level currently. We'll start right here. And your body count. 
<laughs> that was Chris. That was not me. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm Jen Star. I'm 21. I'm an esthetician. And yeah, that was my highest level of education and okay. esthetician. And dating status? But you graduated I'm single. high school, right? You yes. High school. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And then you went to beauty school probably for that. Okay. Cool. Yes. Okay. And you? Your dating status? Uh, I'm single. Ah, you men want to know because you bad. Yeah. <laughs> I'm single. Single, single. 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 Okay. <laughs> what about you? I'm Spike. On Instagram, Spike Lil Slim, L I L the hood way. Oh, Spike Lil Slim. Okay. Um, I'm 27. I'm a rapper. Well, not even a rapper. I'm a musician. I'm an artist. I'm an entertainer. Uh, my highest level of education. I got my GED, but I'm a business owner, a homeowner. So, uh, mm. um, and, you know, I'm dating. Ooh. Okay, so she's single, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there you cool. go. <laughs> okay, my name is Gabriela. I'm from Venezuela. I'm 21. Um, I'm a waitress, and I'm currently single. And then highest education, some college, high school? High school. Okay, cool. cool. Welcome back. All right, it's me. Hello, everyone. Um, my name is Queen. I am a model as well as entrepreneur. I own a lingerie and sleepwear boutique. Okay. Um, I am 23 years old. I am single. And my highest level of education is um, I have a bachelor's degree in communications with a concentration in television broadcasting. Cool. cool. At the illustrious Florida Memorial University. Okay. So. Okay. Um, okay, cool. Um, and you said, uh, okay. All right. We'll continue on. <laughs> I, I, it'll come back to me. All right. All right. I'm single. <laughs> in case anyone wants to know. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm Lena. I'm 20. Um, I'm in school right now, so I have my associates. I'm getting my bachelor's in business. Um, what's that? It? Okay. <laughs> your status. And your status. status. Oh, yeah. I got hoes. So. <laughs> go. uh, are, are we talking about uh, male hoes or female hoes? Both of them. Okay. Mm. So, so, so all right. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Not like 2022. Oh. All right, cool. All right, that's you got guys. So you go both ways. Fantastic. All right. And then uh and then you're in school right now, you're in college. Yes. Undergrad. Okay, cool. Welcome. Dope, dope. Type of hey guys, um, I'm Hortine. I'm 25 years old from Miami, Florida. Um, I am in school right now for fashion merchandising and I own my own swimmer line. I'll be relaunching this year. I I do a little YouTube, like just for fun, nothing crazy. And I just take pictures just for fun on the side. But aside from that, my swimmer is my my baby. Hold on. <laughs> Your name is Hortine? Hortine, yeah. Hortine. <laughs> Parents from Jamaica. <laughs> oh, what a a whole uh, different level. Uh, what a uh, oh, oh, that's what I was going to say. Is your, is your government name actually Queen? No, so oh. my government name is not actually Queen. Oh, okay. okay. But I go by Queen. Yes, okay. yes. All right, all right. I was like in my head, like, what the? I'm about to just name myself King. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my sure, lord, like... my lord. Yeah. Right. Uh, How do you spell yes. your name? H O R T E N E. Okay, guys, it's not whore as in whore. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> you pronounce okay. it whore teen. Okay. Whore teen. Sure, sure like like oval teen. Whore teen. Whore teen. Like oval teen. Like, like whore chata. Like you're Jamaican, like, right? Yes. Oval team. You, you I know, know I don't is? know. What? I never did. Don't, 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 don't do that. Okay, don't okay, do that. Okay, okay. Don't do that. I don't know thing. what's going on. Here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What about you? Um, yo, my name is LQ. Real name Laquanda. My artist Damn. name is LQ. I, I'm a singer. It, so. It's Laquanda. Laquanda, yes. Okay. Right. I am from Georgia, and I've been living down here for a year in Pompano. So. You know, I'm liking it. I, my highest education is I graduated from college to be a welder. But, you know. Oh, wow. That haven't wow. been That's amazing. A welder. sticking okay. to me. So oh, shit. I, How'd you I, like that? I love welding. You, really, you like it? Okay. Yes, I really love it. But, you know, I had to, since I got down here, I was like, you know, let me get my singing right. Let me get my artist, mm -hmm. you know, out there. Because okay. that's what I really want to do. Do you still weld now? No, I haven't welded in a year. Damn. A year and a half. Okay. Well, why, why'd, mm. you, why'd you stop? Well, since I got down here, I was like, yeah, let me go and do this music. Bump okay. Uh, and she bang. Bang. I mean, you're, yeah. you're in Miami, so might as well. Music. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. So wait, but wait. So if you're not well, like, do you, do you have like, a, you're just like living off savings or something? Are you still working? Or another oh, yes. Or? I'm sorry. Yes, I do work. I work at Meineke at a car place. Okay. I'm the service writer at the desk, you know. Okay. 
So uh, when you were going, because this is just interesting because we were, we had a whole discussion about this. Um, not many women are in welding. Were you like the only girl that, that did it? Yeah, I was the school? only girl that graduated in my class. He has the only black girl at that too. Yeah. So Amazing. I was just the only one. Shout like, out to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. so yeah, that's really good. yeah, I'm on the school's um, paper and everything. They they put me on the paper and all. Did, did they bully the you in there? One. And did you cry about it? <laughs> oh, no, because I was actually the best one. I was the best welder. Oh, 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 hey. 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 so, so hold on. So yeah. your, your male counterparts respected you then? Yes, they respected me. They called me for help. Okay. Like yeah, because they're women. Ain't no just, bimbos you know, at this yeah, table. Yeah, I like that, bro. Because a girl, we had a girl yesterday, bro, and she was complaining like, "Oh, I was in, I was in math in college, and they, they treated me bad. My professor, they were bully, bullying me and picking on me, and I, I had to leave for my mental health, all this other uh, fucking pussy for shit. For math? Yeah, yeah, for math. Yeah, yeah I know, bro. And in my head, I, yeah, she was just salty. Hey. She was one of those girls that has a victim mindset. And you come mm. from welding, I'm like, oh, really? And it's like, you know, those. You, a woman can definitely thrive in a male space. It's yeah. just that, yeah. you know, a lot yeah, of girls sure. don't want to do that shit. They don't want to do welding. So, like, that's, hey. It's and it's not you. easy, but kudos yeah, to you. Yeah, it ain't easy. Yeah, kudos yeah, to you. I have all my cert- certifications on every, every Good. process. Yeah. Kudos to you for not being up. a pussy. And then, finally, <laughs> dating status. Oh, I'm single. All right, cool. All right, awesome. So, uh, I'll read these chats real quick, now we'll get into the first question. Uh, all right, one second. Refresh. Uh... And yeah, guys, do me a quick favor while Chris pulls this up. Like the video. Like the goddamn video right now because man, we've been going all day, man. I, bro, I was I was watching back that video from yesterday and I was losing hair follicles just listening to it, bro. <laughs> uh 10 bucks, Jay from an OG. Love the show. Fresh. Wear the merch. Myron Key Frank Castle War Journal going strong. Chris, you're the ultimate savage. Put the delusional calc on yourselves and show them how common they are. Oh shit. Oh, okay. Damn. Ricky Webster. I love my French Fit family. French Toast Brothers do. Thank you so much. Ricky, man. Cigar right. Man, 85. Damn, she looks like she's Rocksteady Sidekick Bebop. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> what? <laughs> Cigar yeah. Man, 85. Uh, Jacob Richer, 10 bucks. Thank you so much. Uh, Pill Cosby. Woke up in the morning with wood today. First time in 60 years and almost shot my own penis. Where's my arena when you need her? Okay, Pill <laughs> what Cosby. <the> fuck? <laughs> Five bucks, Mark Me Stroke, number one podcast in the world. Facts. Facts. Little King. Please don't bring back no more AOCs. My head, head still hurts. Yeah, bro, I know. Uh, two bucks, Justin West Coast. Myron, what is your podcast recovery routine? Post podcast. After. Oh, post pod. <laughs> to be honest, there is none, really. I just like kind of just, uh, yeah, I just do more research. Uh, Angel Canonis, Chris <clears throat> is mad funny. Okay. I don't think he is, but that's fine. M4 Pierre, Myron, four, six, four, oh. four, four. Oh, y'all are hilarious. Fresh. Uh, greetings from Long Island. Uh, three, just a reminder, Fresh gives himself golden showers to treat acne. What? Okay. Wait. Nigga, how's not acne, bro? What you, what you talking about? He's trying to say that's how you stay acne yeah, free. That's how you stay. That you stay <laughs> <on yourself. laughs> All right. Now we know. Uh, you know it's funny. Like in like high school, that's what they said it works, but like that shit doesn't does not work, bro. How do you know? Nigga, I tried it. Uh, okay. <laughs> all right. Uh, Dwayne Holmes second. Hail to the three hundred fours. All right. Five bucks. Beats by ISO. Pressure fam. Pray for W. VVS VVS finance. finance for me down 75 70% SMH crypto. But everything is on sale, so I'm going to keep buying. Bro, yeah. this is why I tell y'all, man, don't buy these weird ass coins, man. Ethereum and Bitcoin. Just keep it simple, man. Mm-hmm. Uh Desmond Montgomery, 10 bucks. As a mathematics degree, that was a sorry excuse for a mathematics major. She had zero logic and bad victim. Glad she didn't get the degree and doesn't deserve the econ <laughs> degree. Even my girlfriend had a headache. Yeah, bro, it is what it is. One of three. Here's some dough for Myron's Hair Foundation. Last night was brutal with that victim mindset trick. Damn. Yeah, I know it was bad. Two bucks. Robert Sinanis, are the ladies who said they're single celibate? Oh. Yes. yes no. I yes, am. I'm pre- yes, I am. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We'll just go around the table real fast. <laughs> okay. We guys all try to defend yourself. All right. We'll start here. since you. So it's going to always go back and forth this way. And, so, and please define celibate. Yes. We may not know what you mean. Just yeah. tell us what you mean. Are you I've celibate been, right now since you're single? Yes, I've been practicing since November last year. Amen. So you haven't smashed this last year? <laughs> I haven't smashed this last year, and I'm straight. Stop I'm fine. Cap. Ah. No cap. <laughs> I don't cap in my rap. Mm. So how do you get off? Mm, toys. Oh shit. <laughs> okay. Hey, that works. What about you? Yeah, oh, he put uh, on a whole yeah. bunch of cats. I've been, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But why you got on three? <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, yeah. But so, why you got on three? <laughs> <laughs> listen, listen. <laughs> I did, I did. I When's the last time you smashed? Last year. <sighs> this is okay. It is last year. <laughs> he just I'm keep on honest. putting on the cat. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, okay. So she, so she's celibate. She's celibate. What about you? No. <laughs> All right. What about you? Yes, I am celibate. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Don't you put that on. <laughs> <laughs> When's the last time you smashed? The last time? Yeah. 
July. What? Someone send an asteroid. July? 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 Yeah. July. Oh, 2021? Oh, 2021. No, July. Come on now. <laughs> July. Y'all can't do that. <laughs> Damn. All right. Get it? July. Mm-hmm. What about you? Uh, what do you think? Yes. Next. Okay. <laughs> yes, what? <laughs> All right. <laughs> I didn't say I was single. I said I was dating. Next. So are you celibate? <laughs> No. Okay. Yeah. Right. Okay. Awesome. Obviously not. And then what about you? Okay. Um, I want to say yes. Oh gosh. Started this year. <laughs> okay. Started yesterday. No, started this year. Kidding. This year. It's a I'm total working of how many? You know. I mean, it's only no month. head, no, no nothing. Just, we're at, we're at no. seven, I think. Seven strong. Wait. So when's the last time you smashed? Okay. Um, like the beginning of. January this year. What the, did, did you <laughs> Come just on say now. Like you, did, you were you were celibate this That's year. Okay, okay. I'm already first. I'm working. This month Bro. is clear. Let's we're good. Like this weekend. <laughs> no, no, not at all. <laughs> this weekend. No. It's only three days yeah. into the end of the month. <laughs> this segment always has. A lot of hats. It's, it's, it's only three days into the month. <laughs> all right. So. Um, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah. All right. It's only the third uh, of the next? month. Okay. Moving on. Yeah. Moving. Yeah. Moving on. Um. Concert Caucasian. Yeah. Regarding the fembot on the last show, I would have liked to know exactly how her math professor wronged her. Next time girls claim such, can you please ask for specifics? We want proof that is valid. Bro, she'll say some dumb shit like, I don't know, verbal violence or something. I don't know. Smart ass social media inc. Five bucks. Thank you so much. Uh hundred bucks from Chris Haley. Thank you so much. Glad to be back wow. in the trap with y'all. Yeah, yeah. Last night's show was crazy. Girls are delusional, even when you provide a fact. Sign language, shame, insults, guilt, and need to be right. Appreciate that, bro. Thanks, Chris. Uh, smart ass social media again. Ten bucks. Bladed. Happy birthday to Frank Castle, not I.E. El Mayron. Oh, thank you. Your take on why not to have platonic girlfriends was reaffirming to me. I've always said if you get benched to this friend zone, never show it off. Yeah, bro. Uh, there's. I think. Real quick. Do you think men and women could be platonic friends? Yes or no? Oh wow. If you don't find them attractive, yes. Platonic means non-sexual. On okay, both exactly. On both sides. So he still yes. wants to smash. Oh. Oh. What was the question? Can you say that again? Uh, yeah, Can men uh, and women be platonic friends, which means non-sexual mm. friends, like no. real oh, friends? Yes. No, yeah. I don't think so. So you think, well, hold on, one at a time. Yes, no? I say no, unless they're ugly. Okay, fair. <laughs> For real. What about you? I could be friends with a nigga, but niggas be liking me under, niggas be liking me, so, so that I guess it's not. not platonic, yeah. Yeah. Okay. No. No? No. Okay. I don't think it's possible. It is. Do you have guys in the friend zone? <laughs> so funny. Huh? Do you have guys in the friend zone right now? A lot of them. Okay. But they probably like you. So, they, yeah. if, so, so then so, it, therefore. But if there's two ugly motherfuckers, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the whole premise of platonic is like, y- y- y'all are not, like, he doesn't see you sexual. So that's what I'm trying to say. Like, oh my what God. if he gay? Then what? That's different. You, we yeah. not talking about sexuality. We're talking about gender. Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, there you go. We be best friends. Yeah, yep. You, okay, there that's. I guess that's one exception you could say. But even I've heard from girls, even when their gay guys get get uh, drunk, they want to try. They be want. They be want. But sure. That ain't gonna lie. Ain't gonna lie. I never heard of So that. that doesn't work either. I so you think lie. many women can be platonic no, friends? Then I don't think so. No. Nah, no. 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 All depends. All depends on your situation. I don't think so. A lot of bad hoes can't have that though. So that's the problem. But. What was that? The, a lot of bad hoes can't have that because a lot of niggas just want to fuck. Whoa, you. Yeah. I'm so sorry. So that proves our point. I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. I'm so sorry. Friends. I oh, have a can. friend that Shit. I don't think wants to fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> if you want, we can put it to the test. You, you want to find out? Right never now? Put it to the test. If you really you, call, you could call him and say I'm horny right hey, now. Let's horny. see what happens. Uh, I don't think he. Ooh. I don't think he would go. <laughs> Let's test it out. Let's test it out right now. Do you ain't about it. it out. You I don't mind. It. Let's, we could try, but I really don't. Yeah, do it. Do it. Do I it. really Let's don't think he will do it. Right. Live. And I just we, had we to think about it. Right now. He's like, oh my, he's like my brother. No, on, 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 on God, he's like my brother. Yeah, he's brother, nah. all right. Brother <laughs> and <laughs> Nah, no, no. Yeah, once, I don't think mm-hmm. so. I don't right. think so. So here's the test, right? All right. So, so give him a phone call. Say, hey, I'm a little bit lit. He knows that I'm here. Okay, oh, perfect. Oh, yeah. it. Does no, he watch the show? It's not going to work. I don't know if he's watching the show, but he knows that I'm here. Fuck. All right. Never mind. Yeah. Damn, Tell man. him you ain't here. Damn it, man. This like, is hey, the kind I'm of the bad part about being famous a little or, bit. Or, <laughs> you know, hold on. Hold on. Say, hey, I'm a little lit. I went home from the show. It already finished. Uh, where you at? I'm horny. Fresh. If he's watching the show, he knows. But he, he might not be. <laughs> I don't know, but. You don't think he's watching? Is he watching? I have no clue. We can send a text out and then, and then check an hour. We can send a text out. 
Darn it. But, uh, All right, it's fine. No, he's probably, he's probably, he's probably watching. watching. Yeah. Right, cool. Damn it, man. The girls say, look to me. They do the cell phone test. Make sure to say you're not going to come and fuck. All right. Uh, what hey, Steve, I'll be here. Um, okay. Ask Lena about the dude named I Love Memphis. People are hating on Lena like crazy because she's allegedly a homewrecker. Love y'all. <laughs> are they really doing that right now? No. Like, <laughs> bro, are we going to give them a moment right now? No. Oh, is it I Love are Memphis? You- um. Hit the I heard Memphis and, and oh, yeah. Shorty, yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, hey, how you doing? Uh, 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 hey, apparently, apparently. I mean, so, if you want to answer, you want to answer. Sammy soulmate. I'm lost. Uh, okay. <laughs> yeah. That Georgia Peach must have amazing hand skills. Bless her. <laughs> okay. Five bucks, Francisco Trinidad. Lena, 20 year old girl, is a baddie. Is she looking for a partner? I think it means partner. Asking, Asking for, for a friend. Maybe. All right. You want to drop your Instagram then? Yeah. What is uh, it? C A R O L I N A that oh. 2X6. All right, send your dick pics there, guys. Carolina that 2X6. Uh, I'm trying to figure out the plant, who the plant is tonight. I hope not. My friend, me too. Is the name Laquanda the new Shaniqua? Let me hand on my name. That's from King Kareem. What? LQ. Free hey, thinker. Man, weld me a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> I weld your fingers together. <laughs> weld me a sandwich. Fresh BBC. God damn it. No snub bunnies this time. Sorry, Fresh. You on your own, brother, but I trust your judgment. <laughs> but can you pick a girl who can actually handle me, though? The last three are still in wheelchairs. Communication is key. And what's that? Oh, shit. Look at that. What is that picture? Uh, I, I, I don't want to see it, man. I don't want to put it on the screen. Oh, man. Please. All right. Put it on the screen. So, but he like so though. Last three in the wheelchair for real, though. Uh, uh, oh, man. Oh, it's amazing shit. that your dick is donating to the show. I appreciate it. Toho 2X. With a superpowered mind, a mechanical canine, he rescues a day for sure, uh, from sure destruction. This is the same song for LaQuisha Jimmy Neutron. Okay. And then how many more do we got, Chris? Okay. okay, and then guys, from this point forward, we're gonna go to 20 and up. up. Yep. Thank you guys so much for donations. All right, buy one BBL, amazing, <laughs> fresh and fit. We're able to keep uh the Shea Proud family, keep the celebs coming. Oh, the Proud family. Who? Uh the girl who has a spike. Oh, okay. Wait, oh I, missed it. Uh, I missed it. I missed it. I missed it. Proud yeah. family? Uh, yeah, Proud I never family. heard of it. Yeah, it's one of the I girls. missed it. I missed it. It's just like you. Okay. Oh, oh. wait, what? All right, bougie, right. 10 bucks. It's like oh. every woman trying to be a singer but sound like deep cat meow. Mm-hmm. Not this one. I don't sound like no mm-hmm. deep cat, baby. I can sing. Oh, Wait. shit. Now nah, she going to hit y'all with Who said that? Who said Me, that? LQ. Said, you want to do a, a bar? Yeah, sure. Oh, All right, with name from the Let's hear it. He's that bad. Because you made me feel. You made me feel. You made me feel like a natural woman. Y'all have a girl messed up. She she well. okay. Thank you. All right, and then what can't uh, you do? and then and then you sing too, or you just rap? You rap, right? Or you said you're a musician? I'm a musician. Okay, so you do both. You rap and you sing. I sing really good with in the studio. Okay, okay, that's fine. In the that's studio, fine. sorry, in the studio. Right, she needs that auto tune. All right. No, I, no, 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 no. I don't need auto tune, but I sing good in the studio. Gotcha. Uh, yeah, this is you. um. The yeah. Family. Yeah. Oh, okay. This is what they're talking about. Okay. Yeah. All right. I look nothing like her, but she's oh. dope. Oh. <laughs> Dark pill Cosby, Cosby clan. Oh, I'm a man. spiker. Drink then enjoy a certain spiked hair lady. Zippity doo dah. Oh my god. Ah. Your mom. Five bucks. <laughs> Hold up. Is I heart Memphis's chick? <laughs> Hold up. Is that I heart Memphis's chick? Oh shit. Who? Wait, who is it? It's sticky? Wow. Wait, wait. Give us the 411. What's going on here, bro? You got a mic there? Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Mo, Mo, is it on? No, it's on. Chris, Chris. I don't know. Yeah, bullshit. Yeah, it's on. Go ahead. Tell us what's going on here, bro, because we, we're clueless. All right, so look. Homegirl in the white. I yeah. invited her to come. Yeah. She brought Shorty in the black. All right? Yeah. Next thing I know, she knows I have Memphis. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Chris, help him out, bro. Or so Mo, help they him out. both when you... know I Heart Memphis. Yes, they both know I Heart Memphis. But how? She did a song with I Heart Memphis the other day. So then what happened next? So what happened next? Let her tell you what happened next. <laughs> Yo. Y'all crazy. I ain't finna talk about that shit. <laughs> <laughs> she, she not talking about it. <laughs> hey, just know they lying. <laughs> Who's say. I Heart Memphis? I don't know. He's like a TikToker. The, like the guy that's right the singer, the Hit the Quan. 
Hit the, the corn. corn. Yeah. He, go, he yeah. went viral on TikTok. I pretty much collab with him. Shorty mad. And all her haters on my dick. That's a lot of people. They even deem oh. me. They and I don't even know. No, they came on my page. And let me just say something. Don't come on my page with that mess. Because you will get blocked. <laughs> okay, right. I'm confused. I'm uh, yeah. so. <laughs> so I don't know what's I going collab, on. I don't I care about, about that. I heart Memphis because I was okay. at his music video type shit. We, okay. we started doing TikToks. Next thing you know, everybody on my dick about some bitch. So all her fans on my dick because I'm fucking her man. I'm a homewrecker. Whole time I didn't even know him until the fact that I just met him. But did y'all really smash though? No. Really? Hell no. Nah. We just we, we collabing. We collabing. Damn. And how do you know? Great TikToks. How do she I know him the, the same? Video. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Also on the video. So, so just off of being in his video, they thought like you were home wrecking off of that. Yeah, because he left Shorty and we started collabing together. They met. Oh. They big met. And it's crazy. I didn't even talk on the situation. They'd be on my dick for like five days. So this is the first <laughs> everybody going to hear about this situation. Because wow. he, so he ain't ever speak on it either. It's just Shorty blowing this shit up. Everybody think I hacking her accounts, like taking her shit, like. Thinking all type of shit. But I ain't so why uh, didn't he speak up on it? Because they running my shit up. Mm. Uh, Man, that's wow. smart. They having a lot of fun hey, in the comments. I, 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 it's free engagement. So why free, not? It's yeah. free clout. They, I don't got a paper promo. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Damn. Show them my boy detox, man. man. All right. All right. Um, mm. Did you at least give him a blowjob? No. Nothing. <laughs> all right. We got Marcus that's Gomez. my dude, though. Don't play with him. That's my dude, though. <laughs> ah. my own. All right. uh, okay, why Spike looks so aerodynamic? She getting ready to be shot out of a cannon. What the fuck? <laughs> Marcus Gomez, Mason Force with a cap in. I asked politely. Okay, Laquana can get the anaconda. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Martin, the logic yesterday was unmatched. Two bucks from Enig uh, enigmatic. What's your Instagram? Underscore LQ Yolanda. So, would you break your celibacy? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you, you're thinking about it, so Think probably. About it. It's, hmm. you said, well, nah. well, some stay um, celibacy. I gotta stay. You said no. I gotta stay with it. If the price is right, it's important. It's, yeah, it's, it's very right, important. Sure. Uh, pretty lady, uh, two seventy nine. Myron, can you please fuck me? Um, okay. Uh, okay. Right, okay. That was pretty forward. All right. Should we have DM unplug fan if you're hot? Oh, so <laughs> hey, just your type. Brother. No, she's, wait, what is it? Uh, no, oh, she, but she's dark, Myron. Oh. Nah, never mind. All right. Right Eric. <laughs> <laughs> Canceled. Uh, hey, man, I only like Mexican chicks. You see the hat, motherfuckers. All right, Rod Eric, uh, 10 bucks. F and F. We uh, snow ice in Dallas, Texas. Dope set up fresh uh, with your fresh channel 100K up next. Thanks, okay? bro. Yeah, actually, Myron built the studio for me, so there you go. There you go. Uh, King Chris, white dress. We see you looking. Go get them. <laughs> what you looking at? Oh. What? <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm hearing. If possible, I'd be a brief introduction to Christina, the cute and uh, the cutie in the kitchen behind Chris. Lil Ba, leave her alone, bro. Because <laughs> <laughs> like, who is that in the back? Hey, Lil Ba, uh, Twitch stream, do it, all right? Oh uh, man, I'll do it for you guys. Uh, Jonathan Castillo, happy belated Myron. Shout out to the rest of the crew. I was watching yesterday's show, and as a progressive person myself, that chick was the type of progressive that I had disdain for. Yeah, it is what it is, man. Thank you so much for that, Andrew uh, Washington. After a workout, I'm not always hungry. Should I force myself to eat anyway, or just listen to my body and eat? And should I eat before a 5 a.m. workout? If so, what should I eat? Uh, listen, mealtime and frequency doesn't really make a difference on your body composition, bro. Just eat when you're hungry. But if you're not getting enough calories to build muscle, then you got to eat more often. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then one thing you could do, put olive oil in your protein shake. It'll help you add in calories without necessarily feeling it. Uh, Anton Daniels, the girl in the white dress is going to have to pay for the cleaning bill for that chair. She want fit. Put me on the show. I want the smart girl by fit. Okay. What? So what's your IG? No, the girl in white dress. No, no. What that no, no, mean no, no, no. though? He's, he's hitting on he's hitting on oh, her though. Oh, oh. What, what's your IG? Underscore LQ Yolanda. No. All right. Why? Um, what are you saying, Chris? No, the girl and oh never mind. Yeah, I I saw that. I saw that. Right. I saw that. Uh, Boy, then, I don't understand. I don't understand. <laughs> don't worry. He's saying that like you don't, don't need get to it understand. <laughs> okay, now. Yeah. yeah, you don't, I don't get it. It's okay. I'm sucking. Roy Barnes, 10 bucks. My investment strategy is pretty simple. I invest every month 40% of my yearly income, 90% goes to S P five hundred for eight to twelve percent compounding interest. And 5% of BTC and 5% ETH. I'm a long-time investor. Good. Smart. Yeah, that's a good strategy. That's smart. And we got Tommy Sotomayor in the fucking house. Oh, Lord. Yeah. Dumb, dumb, uncle. Oh, I dare oh, y'all to play my song and let the ladies rack. No, Nick, you're going to get us canceled. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the song is pretty good, though. What song like, is like, it? The beat is hard. The lyrics, it might be a little bit extreme. We're going to get canceled. You know what? Y'all want to... Oh, wait, no? Fresh. No. Okay, no. Damn, Tommy. Tommy, you're going to get us in trouble, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, we need you back on the show, Tommy. Uh... Shaquille Ahmed, uh, Queen and Hortin, uh, Hortin, two peng 
uh, things in the ch- uh, scene. I'd let them keep my pipes clean and pristine. Devil in the dark, you know what I mean. I mean, okay. Wait. <laughs> All right. And uh, guys, do me a quick favor. Like the video, and then uh, did you want to do a question uh, first? Tommy got one more. Oh, oh one Tommy. More time, I just went to LQ channel. How's she dark skin with no ass? <laughs> <laughs> LMAO. Amazing. I was so Amazing. disappointed. She's really beautiful, though. Who? Uh, her body is beautiful. He yeah, goes, I'm, I'm slim. No, no booty, but it's okay. It's coming. He it's said, coming. I was so disappointed. It must be a, uh, I'm, it must be a thief in Miami because her ass been stolen. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? You got anything oh. you want to say back to Tommy? I mean, you can help me get one. Ooh, oh, cool. yeah. Okay, Tommy. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Dallas, Tommy. And uh, Tommy's in Atlanta too, so yeah. Uh, all right, cool. cool. So, first uh, night. yeah, first question, go ahead. This on the panel. In your humble opinion, who cheats more, men or women? We'll start here. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's all the, I'm gonna say both, like, I'm gonna say both because I don't know, like, all depends on the situation in your relationship. From your experience. My experience, the niggas was cheating on me. I ain't gonna cap. It's the niggas. <laughs> yeah, the niggas was cheating on me. <laughs> I had to learn. I had to, had to learn that niggas play me. So you know what I'm saying? Now it's time for me to do the bossing up. Now. So you. So now you gonna play? So them? do them how they do me. Yeah, it's time to do them how they do me. I'm tired. Mm-mm. So how you gonna play them when you're celibate though? <laughs> exactly. I'm celibate. That's why I'm finna play you. Get what I need, and you ain't finna fuck me. Oh. 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 Okay. Yeah. See. Let me see. Yeah, men cheat more for sure. They cheat more. Just natural. They're what biology. What, what they call it? Biology. Well, that, yeah, it's just yeah. how men are. The no, class you didn't pass. It's just how you guys are. You gotta accept it, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. I got a lot of thought ass girlfriends, shorty, but I gotta say I've been cheated on by dudes more than I cheated on a dude. Actually. Yeah. You know. So you think it's yeah. dudes that cheat more? I think it's dudes. Yeah. I think yeah. women holds like a more loyalty. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. But girls on that bad. Oh yeah, we know. <laughs> we know that over here. No cap, no lie. Yeah. So I want to say men cheat more, but I do got some friends that you know. Cheap and all those types of tricks. But I mean, I personally, from my own experience, I can say men cheat more, like for sure. Yeah. Okay. Question: Do you know Decon? Say it again. Do you know Decon? I do. I, think. I don't know why she. She's like family. I don't know why. All right, never mind. Me? Yeah, you. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. That name sounds real familiar. Okay. What about you? Um, guys cheat more. Yeah, sure. All right. Men. Mm-hmm. <laughs> One word. That's very strong, man. <laughs> what about you? Men cheat more. Okay. Definitely. Back around. Who lies more? Men. <laughs> okay, and why? Yeah. Why? Mm. Um, I don't know. I don't think they even have a reason. I think they just they're selfish. They just think about themselves. Mm. You know? Okay. They're just lying. What about you? <laughs> She said it. Oh, she said it. All right. I want to say man, but I think women are the best in lying. Wow. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What about you? Men, but like she said, it's some woman that could literally tell a lie and you won't even notice. So, bow. <laughs> Had to throw it back. A bow. <laughs> okay. Dying. What about you? So it's easier for a female to lie, but I think dudes have to lie more because they always do some shady shit. Yeah. Mm, yeah. They All lie right. for I think, no reason. I think it's 50-50. I think women do lie. Poor some child. women, not all. Mm. Some women do lie. Some men do lie. I think it's 50-50. Like me personally, I don't lie. I'm genuine and I actually am telling the truth. Stop the crap. Why the fuck are you lying? I'm so serious. Oh I'm so serious. But it's, it's hard out here. No way, girl. Girl. So you never girl. Any of your niggas. I'm so she truthful. So I'm probably too truthful. That's probably my issue. Because then I, I, I get people that are not the same way. I get the liars. So then okay. it's like, why would I be so honest with someone that's not honest with me? <laughs> but I have home. to be honest because to be honest, you have to be true. Yes, yourself. <laughs> I think so. 50 50. I say 50 50. Yeah. The spirits tell me that you're lying right now. <laughs> <laughs> Don't disrespect they the tribe. The week. <laughs> Don't disrespect the Indian tribe. Right? Mm. <laughs> All right. <laughs> My opinion, I, I believe, like, 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 like my girl said, it's, it's women too, but men, like, 
It's like, yeah, it's like they just be, you can tell they lying. Like, you could tell they lying. You could tell he doing something. You could just tell. I ain't got time for that. Like, what's women, the one thing? Like, okay, what you doing? I'm with the guy. You was not with the guys. Quit saying you with the niggas. Quit and saying stop with saying your boys. you at the gym. Stop we know you at the gym. Girl, girl. Girl. We know you at the gym. We know you all working out, though. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, it's like, quit saying no, you're not. you at the you, I, I know you probably with that girl. Like, you probably hanging out with her at the mall or something. It's I fine. honestly like, think we some friends, though. I genuinely, yeah. not. Uh, I genuinely think guys are guys super can't be simple. Friends with girls. They're, they're not that involved that guys we think they are. Mm. And it's like almost as an insecurity thing that we have as women. Like we just automatically think probably based on our past, whatever we've been through, we probably think the next person is doing the same thing. That's not something good to carry on. Mm. You can't think like that for everyone. So hold you on really real quick. Tell us the story of a time that guy lied to you and he got one on you. As in like he lied to you and you believed it. We'll start here. Baby, I yeah. love you. Okay, that he lied to me and I believed it. Fuck. Mm-hmm. Um, only one thing is coming into my mind. I'm going to say that he's not fucking with that girl. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That certain girl. Mm-hmm. So you asked him about a girl. He said, nah, she's just a friend. No, not even nah. I don't fuck with her. Nah, nah, nah. Why would you ever bring that up? Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know what so I mean? So strong on it. Yeah, yeah. But they're lying. Yeah. <laughs> they fuck with her. Okay. What about you? Um. Okay. So I was engaged. Oh. Oh wow. Um. Uh, to a. Oh, he just lies about everything. Mm. Oh my god, he just lied about everything. But I never believed him, and I don't believe niggas. Niggas be lying, and even if they is telling, the... even if they are telling the truth. Mm. I still don't believe him, and I don't care. <laughs> Damn. Okay. I don't, so uh, hard. So wait, you bro- you uh, did you break up? Uh, did you? I guess end Ain't the no ring wedding. On my finger. Yeah, but but I'm saying you ended it, right? Yeah, that's done. Okay. What was the main reason for the line? Lying and cheating. Oh. Okay. Especially with with people that just wasn't up to par, and mm-hmm. it, people that wasn't up to par, and I had to realize he didn't love himself, mm-hmm. and the things that he yes. was doing, he didn't love himself, and you know. Niggas want me back, and that's just how it is. Mm-hmm. And um, was he a musician too? No, he's a businessman. Uh, Very, you know, rich okay. man. About his business, so he man. had his, he had a lot of money. A lot of money, a lot of bitches. Is it mm. fair enough to say that that kind of comes with the territory? Not all the time. It came with him because he didn't love himself and he didn't value himself, and that's why he fucked with girls and bitches that just wasn't really nothing. Mm. What if I were to be honest with you and told you that guys that have money are just going to fuck other chicks and that's the way it is. Nine not, ten times. not all. And even if they are, and even if they are, they do it to where they don't get caught. Yeah. So if you're getting caught, you don't give a fuck. Yeah. So that's, that's the thing. So if you're, you're cheating and you don't get caught and I never know about it, I'm happy. What if he told you from the very beginning? Yeah. Would that change anything or no? Yeah. Like, told say, me that he. Like, you know was, what? I want to exercise options. Then we could have fucked them hoes together. Okay. okay. He he actually so one time. It was time, the line that pissed you off. It wasn't. It was the line okay. because I don't give a fuck. He actually one time actually like brought a girl for us to have sex with. I ended up only having sex with her and he didn't. <laughs> and, <laughs> and and like it was just like Treggy. And it just was like um. Was he watching? No. Chris. We, we went into we went into <laughs> we went into another room or whatever like, like that. But he's it's like, like Chris. I'm he's like, honest. I can cheat, I mean, but you can't. That's how he feel. Yeah, but most <laughs> men with money do feel like that. They do feel like um merch. They can do whatever they want. I think that's a proper you know? response though, personally. What? I think I think he should be able to tell you you can't have sex with other men. Yeah. Yeah. If he's taking care of everything, yeah. Yeah, but that doesn't mean be a disrespectful cheater. <laughs> So okay, so your issue isn't is was with that he didn't tell you. All right, fair enough. We tell guys like yo, yeah. you, you, if you want to, you know, smash other girls, your girl needs, you should be honest yeah. about it. Yeah, most exactly. Guys, but you exactly. want to know why though? Most guys can't do it though because most women can't handle the truth. Exactly. I can. No. But see, it's hard. You say that. It's I hard. just told you now that dudes. <laughs> I just told you the truth now that dudes have, that have money are gonna fuck other chicks. And you don't like that. No, I said if you can be, if you can do it and not let me find out, I'm still happy. So you don't want it in your face. Okay. I don't. I don't want. You getting caught. Right, you shouldn't be getting you shouldn't be getting caught. Mm, right. You okay. shouldn't be getting caught. Fair enough. All right. And if you're if you're gonna live like that, let me know so I can mm. make a decision. Mm, okay. I'll say this real quick. Um, because we talked about this yesterday. I, I tell girls all the time the piece of advice I give them is if, if you deal with a guy of a certain socioeconomic status that's attractive, just a- accept the fact that he's probably gonna step out and have sex with other girls. Like just mm-hmm. assume it 
and then just like nip it in the butt early. Yeah. But going in and thinking that he's going to be exclusive to you and, you know, loyal to you from a sexual standpoint only is, is ridiculous right. because mm-hmm. men work really hard to make that kind of money. And I don't mm-hmm. think women understand how difficult it is for men to get sexual access. Mm-hmm. And when they finally do, they're going to go crazy. You know, whereas mm-hmm. like for you guys, you guys are born with value. 21 years old, bam, world's, you know, your oyster. You didn't have to earn that. 20. No disrespect to you guys, but women are born with their looks. So it's like, you're just going to get it. Men, we're not born with our value. We got to create it. So if dude creates it, he's going to want to enact on that. So that's good. Yeah. I know men with money that value them, themselves, though, and they don't lay with a whole bunch of women. <laughs> I mean, you just, just you just don't, don't know about it. No, 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 no. no. Trust me when no. I say when doors are closed. Yeah, when doors are closed, they change, man. I'm telling you. Sure, like, <laughs> if a dude has the means and op- ability to have sex with other girls, he's yeah. gonna exercise that option. It's just that women are just not gonna know about it. Mm-hmm. I think that's but one that's, of the biggest lies good, we tell women. That's good enough, though. I All don't right, want to know. Yeah, you just want to know. All right. Exactly. You Mario Winans. She, she's the one in her face. I don't want to know. If you blame me, keep it on the low. <laughs> Thank but you. My heart yeah. can't take it anymore. anymore. Uh, so, okay. She just wants you guys to pull the Mario Winans on her. All right. Fair enough. Okay. Uh, I will say two things. Oh, she's my best friend. And the second one. Oh, no. She's like my cousin. Ah. Uh, still thinks. The family... Switch family, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, works every time. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, my situation was when I was dating this guy in college. Um, I still to this day, I don't know if it was like a party or something, but he had something going on in his dorm room or whatever, and, and I was really cool with his friends. Um, he played basketball at the time, so of course, uh, <laughs> I mean, y'all, I'm like five eleven. Yeah, I'm not gonna date anybody tall. shorter than me. I'm sorry. Okay, wow. So. Um, I guess they had a little party or whatever was going on in the dorm room and I seen something on someone's close friend story and it was basically a girl like giving him like a lap dance. I don't know what it was like a lap dance or ah. something. So I confronted him about it and I actually went to the actual dorm room. They didn't open the door for me. Nothing. So I confronted him about it and I'm just like, okay, what's going on? Come to find out he ended up effing the girl. Wait, so, oh, uh, he, he told you that? Um, no, he didn't tell me. I actually found out because the girl came to me personally oh, and wow. she showed me receipts. So, so it was kind of, oh. <laughs> she showed you the porn video. Uh, she, uh, oh Lord. she, she, she showed me something. So and, it was real. Yeah. <laughs> Why would you do that though? You said what? Why would she show you that? She wanted, I kind of like, I kind of wanted your man. Yeah, she I, did. No, yeah. I'm not going to lie. He, yeah. he was fine. Y'all I'm not going to sit up here. I don't, I don't date every man. Like, he was fine. He was, you know, a little known or whatever. So I feel like most of the people at the school wanted to date him, talk to him. And they actually did. You know, they, you know, they. she See, had him. So She took him. You know what she did, bro? Did so you, you take him what? back? Did you get mad and break up with him or no? I took him back. Smart. Oh, well, okay. 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 <laughs> because she's playing like the, um, what do you call it? Bait and switch. Like, for example, oh, yeah, he fucked me, da, 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 to show you. Right. Truly. In fact, she just wanted him for, for herself. Yeah. Basically. Yeah, yeah. So. she's trying to get you out the picture. I took Back. him back. We was together for a little bit after that, but I just couldn't deal with too much. You, when you're dating a guy that's damn near seven foot, y'all, it's it's just too much, y'all. Like, it's a lot of women that you know see that and they're just like, oh, I see money. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So it was kind of just it was it was hard for me to be with somebody like that. Question: Would you settle enough for somebody like shorter than you? Hell no. <laughs> After all that. I'm just gonna so I'll, I'll, I'll just I'll just make this uh this because this is very funny. Like I always laugh like when taller girls like say oh, I'm not gonna accept cheating or this is fucked up or whatever. Like you do realize that like only like 15 percent of the male population is over six feet tall. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And then on top of that, trust me, I know to be it's yeah, hard to find a man. So, so six foot three <laughs> is like three percent of the U.S. population or less. So it's like. You got to kind of pick like, all right, if I'm going to date a tall guy, what comes with it is he's going to fuck other chicks. Am I willing yeah. to accept that? Because mm-hmm. unfortunately, supply and demand, he's the prize in that situation, not necessarily you, because he could go ahead and date a girl that's five foot. You can't date a man that's five foot. So he right. has the leverage. And I know women hate hearing that. I right? see you buckling when I said that. <laughs> but it's the truth. Like once you sit, date, date a certain caliber of guy, you no longer have leverage. And I know women don't like to hear that. But that's the truth. No, it is the truth. The truth. Yeah. But I, see, like, let, let me like tell you leverage something. as in what do you mean exactly? Like what as type of offense. leverage? Leverage as in he can replace you. You yeah. can't necessarily replace him. Yeah. And the thing yeah. is, is that women make the mistake of thinking I can replace him because I got a bunch of dudes in my DMs. Incorrect. Those guys all just want to have sex with you. They yeah. don't want to necessarily right. give you a relationship. You're absolutely right. right. So, yeah. so I always laugh when girls say, I got a lot of options. All these dudes are hitting me up. That's the equivalent to me saying, oh, well, I got all these girls that friends on me and they're never going to let me smash. It yeah. doesn't matter. <laughs> 
You know what I'm saying? Because okay. if you're getting a bunch of attention from dudes that you would never take seriously anyway, who cares? It's irrelevant. So I, what I always say is if you got a guy that's a top tier guy, he goes and fucks another chick. We went into uh, detail with this on the Britney, Britney Runner podcast. Because yeah. well, you guys know she had PJ Washington, whatever. And I told her, listen, you make your own money, you're successful, and you're famous. You don't have the same dating pool he does. You need to just make it work with him. You don't have a choice. And she didn't like hearing that, but you know, women don't like hearing that they don't have as many options because the internet cons consistently tells them that they actually do, when in reality they don't. So, mm -hmm. you know, the, the the reality is, how many suitable men do you have that actually are willing to take you seriously for a long term relationship? When you actually use that phrase, it, it's way less than women think. Yeah. Are, right. Can I it ask is. a question? Yeah. Are there men out there that don't cheat? Yes. I yeah. ain't gonna lie, because uh, we talk about the negative side about men and women. Men are as only faithful as their options. What do you mean by that? Yeah, Like whatever they have in front of them? If a man has the ability to, to exercise his options without getting caught, there's a 95% chance he's going to do it. I think if regardless of how good his wife is yeah. and how uh, good of a woman she is. Wow. So she could be the greatest woman anyway. Like he can still love you. A guy, go see another girl and I come and, back to you. Okay. A guy, he can literally be in love with you and he's going to cheat. Yeah. So, and and then that's why they say, I just cheated. I didn't make love to her. Because that's why, uh, I mean, it's so like I didn't make love. To her. I just example, cheated. That's like normal. But for okay, so sex for men is like just taking a piss. Like it's not like that intimate. Mm -hmm. for women is more emotional and more like okay, cool. You know what? I'm invested in this guy, so I'm, I'm gonna take it there. But for guys, like okay, you know what? She's hot. I'll smash back to my wife. I know it's a difficult concept for women to grab because for you guys, you need an emotional connection before you have well, sex with a yes. man. You don't. You don't need emotional connection. No, mm -hmm. I think you, you do. Just, you just I think you do. Mm -hmm. I, I we all have. Listen, listen, listen. I had a girlfriend for three years. Listen, <laughs> I just smashed to smash, shorty. Like after Bruh, that, that's a girl, a guy. <laughs> but I fucked the dude, right? Like you know what I'm saying? Cheated on my bitch type shit with a dude. Excuse me. <laughs> you know, I was fucking with a dude when I was fucking with my girlfriend, and there was no type of emotional for that. I just needed some dick. Okay. Well, see, see. Here's, so here's the yeah. yeah I, okay, uh, here's the thing, man. You can't use exceptions to rules. If if I lined up 100 women, most of them are going to want something in return for sex. Like, m not many girls, like, just like, I'm just going to fuck this guy randomly one time because I need to get my nut. That's cool that you could do it, but most girls can't. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're going to want something in return for some with some kind of stability. I'm so, not like that. Uh, you're not? Okay. No. Well, fantastic. I mean, you're able to detach sex from emotion. A lot of girls aren't able to do that, though. Well, here's yeah. the scary part. So, if you're at that point where you can do that, that says a lot of boats. At you 22. Yeah. Dude, dude, 20, most girls can't do that. Because it... It's just the fact that you definitely smash you... that TikToker. Stop capping. Uh... Get out of here with that. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. You just stop being. You just stop being goofy. You know what I'm saying? You stop fucking with dudes. You, you fucking with dudes with status. You know you're gonna get cheated on. So you might as well do what the fuck you need to do to get your nut off. Get you whatever the fuck you need to do to do it. You know what I'm saying? You just gotta know your place. So you accept mm -hmm. it and say, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna get it anyway. Because yeah, because okay. at the end of the day, it's like you live for yourself. Fuck but but here's shit. the thing. See that? The, notice how you said rich dude. He still had to bring something to the table to fuck with you. Yeah. You know not what I'm saying? Yeah. Not necessarily. Because I, I fuck with somebody who don't give me shit. It's literally just based on personality. Yeah, but you know? but the person, the, the guy maybe had some status, maybe had some clout, maybe had a certain lifestyle, whatever it is. He doesn't have to maybe necessarily give you give something physically. Me, but it has but to he definitely has to, have some. He can't be because, a loser. Yeah. yeah. Because if you got something, okay. you got to have somebody match your energy. Okay, well, here's the thing. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. You just proved my point even further. Okay, a yeah, man has to period. bring something to the table to deal with you sexually. Yeah. Yes. The woman does not. Yeah, we'll fuck a mom. So that's what I'm trying. That's what I'm trying to say. So for uh -huh. men, we do not need to invest. We do not need to invest in a person to have sex with them. Whereas you guys do to some degree. Yeah. Even if that man hasn't necessarily invested in you, you are still selecting him for the possibility that he could invest in the future. Yeah. Yeah, one thousand. I level. only fuck with dudes so who invest in my yeah. future. Okay, Thank you, you got to show me point. something from the jump. God damn it! Hold yeah. on, that's, yeah. not, that's just show me yeah. something from the jump, baby. Hold on. So I'm bossed up. Show me so, something from the jump. So we got a special uh, instrument here. We want to put on the on the podcast. Oh shit! And just to add to, because definitely you know you give some very good points earlier. Uh, what's your name? Again? Me? Um, no, Miss Carolina. 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 <laughs> so we have a light detector test here. Oh, right. Is that so really? we're gonna see if I have Memphis and you actually did something. Hey. And this oh my god. Okay. Oh, so why are y'all doing that? Christina, you need to help us out with this. We don't know how to work so this. Is, the light, uh, is this for real? This for yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah Christina, put works. her hand on it and uh, so, do it. Christina, could you help us with yeah, this? Yeah, yeah, she's going to come. She's going to come. Cool. You so, do it? so we'll do it live yeah. on air. Okay. Uh, answer so, to uh, true questions. Hey, if you want to back up now, you can. Oh, yeah, that's good. Okay. Okay. All right, all right. We're going to do this. 
We need your magic. And I have a question. I want a camera after... that. Okay, so can you set up, please? Yeah, set it up. Uh, yeah, oh put. My gosh. Yeah, put it. Put. Uh, give her the uh, thing. Put it there. And uh, while she sets that up, so yeah, just just going back to what I was saying. Uh, while she sets it up with her, yeah, men, men are. We don't. We don't look at sex the same. So that's why yeah. it's not that big a deal. That's why I say. If you're a girl and you got like a dream man and he goes out and steps out and fucks another girl, it's really not that serious. It's like, really how do you, you, how do you not make it? Smash anything how do you pussy? make yourself not Essential. feel that that hurt you feel? How do you not feel that way? How it's do you not possible? Possible. Because you need to understand that men and women are extremely different and it's not personal when he cheats on you. If, like when you, if, if you cheat on a man, it's a problem. Yeah. Yeah. You, you have to you get cheat to cheat emotionally. Point emotionally. Women cheat emotionally. I sure. want my man to be able to be like, hey, I just fucked his badass bitch. Let me show you her picture. And I'm gonna be like, Oh my God, bitch, she fire like yeah. hook it but up. Most, yeah. Selfish. But most girls, most girls can't handle that. I'm though. not like that. This is why I'm we need to tell like, like that don't at lie all. to me. It cause yeah. you could say, babe, I just smashed and I'm gonna say, don't be selfish, bring her home. Baby. Nowadays I can but handle think about it. Playing. Think about it. You think he's gonna do it, that and then come tell you? I mean, it's gonna be why weird. not? Because no. we already be like, oh, this is a fine ass bitch. Like, why would you wanna keep that from me? Why would you wanna keep a bad bitch from me? Because Okay, here's my thing, right? Selfish. I get what you're saying. He should tell you because it's the right thing to do. However, it's like, okay, I don't know your tolerance level. I don't know how far how far you're gonna take it. Yeah. So you might be cool with it, but I'm a man. She might flip out. I don't know how far she's gonna take it. Man, but she see, might get that's, jealous. That's I don't why. Know. Yeah. That's why you don't lie. You see what happens. See if we're compatible. And if we're not, we move apart. This is this I is think, how I am. I feel like when if I'm in a relationship, and I feel like the guy is cheating, like he'll look at me and he'll know I can't tell you. Like he'll know, like oh, oh, you're gonna die. Like you're gonna, your heart's gonna be broken. My heart yeah. ain't gonna break. That, that's yeah. why I'm a little crazy. So I'm just trying to learn the part of how no, to no, accept no, you're it. Not, you're because... not crazy. You're realistic. A girl that accepts mm. a guy back after he cheats, especially someone that's like almost seven feet tall, that's intelligent in yeah. my eyes. That's mm. that's. Uh, a lot of people say that's stupid. What do you mean? Like, uh, are you gonna replace him? Yeah. No. <laughs> yeah. No way. He was. I mean, I mean, yeah. Girl. Yes. Like even further, right? The fact he chose you or the other girls. Says a lot because guess what? He can get any girl he wants. But he chose you. Oh no, I knew for sure. I knew yeah. for sure. I'm gonna be honest with you. I knew for sure he could have any girl he wanted on that right. campus. Like I knew. I was like, oh yeah. But he chose you. Seven. All right. So uh, okay. Right. So we're gonna try this. Damn. All right. So um. All right. So how, Christina, how are we gonna do this? So talking to micro fast and tell the people how it's gonna I'm go. I'm excited. I I really want to see this. Okay. Did she smash or not? Let's yeah. See. So. Do we got to phrase the question? So, are you guys going to be quiet, though, because of the fact that she starts laughing? It's oh, like, it'll give it a different reading? Okay. Yeah. okay. All right. So, we, we, you, done, we tried this. And it, like, all right. So, ask the question, Christina, and then hit the button. Go ahead. Tell, like, say it in the mic. Or pressure. Ask, like, what kind of question? Like, anything? What's so, did you smash I Heart Memphis? Well, ask her uh, two questions first. So, Actually, you know what? Ask something first before this one. Yeah. Okay. So, ask, okay. like... Okay, like, are you calm, though? Because, like, I don't want it to, like... Because everybody's like, okay, so she's, All right. Like, you got to be calm. Okay. Yeah. So, what is your Instagram handle? That That's a simple one. She ain't gonna lie about that. Yes and no question though. Yeah. Oh what fuck. The fuck? <laughs> is your, is, is, and you know what? Just say is your Instagram handle such and such. And then yeah. What's your Instagram? Is it Catalina 2XX? Car Catalina 2XX. All right. Ask her, is it is, your, it is that your Instagram? 2XX? Yes. I don't think. Oh wait, sorry, do it again. It, is it hold true? on, no, no, hold on. <laughs> it's calibrating. Okay. The truth. Is it Instagram Catalina XX? No. Two X X. Two X X. Yes. Okay. What the fuck? I think you should just ask. Are you single? Yep. Yes, sir. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. It works. Right. Okay. okay. All right. All right. So now we're gonna ask. Uh, so set it up for the next question. Is the no, question the you right. you just go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. So Wait, everyone, be quiet. Go ahead. Question is. Why don't you ask it and then I just fresh got it. Okay. Fresh got it. You gonna ask? Question is, Miss Lena. Did you smash our Memphis? No. Isn't that stuff already? She laughed. Hey. Oh! Hey. 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 All right, hold on, hold on, no, no. Did she give him a BJ? Put that hand back. Yeah. Up. Put that hand back. She got that blow no. <laughs> Did he get a blow job? Did anything sexual happen? All right, so uh, Fresh, you're gonna. So Christina, set it up, and then he'll ask the question. Go ahead. So okay. did anything sexual, Fresh? Did he get a blow job? Not for me. Yes or no? No. We were rooting for you. We were all we were She didn't get no blowjob. She didn't do it, Brad. She 
That's why the point. She ain't doing it. 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 She no, hell no. Nah, she's going like that. It, though. it did shock me a little bit. Maybe I did a little bit. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, yeah! I like her. 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 She still ain't doing it. She still ain't doing it. Yo. Yo. Sheesh. Oh, man. Um, All right. I like your honesty, man. Yeah, well, well, we have to pull it out. Of here, <laughs> hey, I'm scared of that lot of takes. I have a question. Yeah, she has sent it to the girl. Hey, no. you want to get more clothes? No, they're like, I should have sent it off. Got it. You know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, God. So, uh, Damn, the Gawk Gawk 3000. I have a question. You know, oh, the Gawk Gawk 3000. just the tip. Yeah, yeah. She probably looked at herself. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, you got something? Go ahead. Yes. You said he was seven <laughs> foot? Yes, he was. He was did like, well, like six, seven. Like, did yes. he have like a monster penis? Yeah. How tall was the dick? Oh, my God. <laughs> was it a monster cock? A monster <laughs> cock is different from a monster dick. I think that's why I stayed so long. <laughs> Because I'm gonna be honest with you, his personality. I mean, his person. He had a very, you know, okay personality. But <laughs> <laughs> I, it, y'all, I was. You gotta think. I was in love with the hype. You know what I'm saying? Like he was a ball player. He was all right. Yeah, yeah. I was in love with the hype. But so did I he have like, a monster cock? He did. Yeah. <laughs> you can take some dick. Girl. <laughs> damn. Wait, wait. Or so God, so damn. Because I can't. All right. So, uh, <laughs> y'all don't do this. Hey, don't do this to me. Sex, the girls could take it. Would you have sex with a shorter guy? No. No. At all. No, no, no sex. Mm-mm. And yeah, I have you know people, what? I have people in my DMs all the time saying I can climb that tree. And I'm just like, <laughs> she's super you tall. You're gonna go tr- so climb another tree. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, yeah. No. We're the, these girls that said they're celibate. I'm about to put you guys on the lie detector too. <laughs> no, <laughs> right, yeah. uh, Let's set up go. three Let's of those go. things. Uh, Let's go. Them. I'm ready. Let's uh, go. How many girls said they're celibate? I think I, I, see, I, 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 and I stand tall and proud. I think besides me and Shorty being I stole time and yeah. proud. Oh, yeah, you're celibate too. No, allegedly. one, two, three. <laughs> we, we, we not suck. Okay. We not. Right. I'm sucking need, and fucking. We need four. <laughs> okay. We need four. Um, okay, so, all right. While Christina gets that going, uh, I'll read some of these chats. Do, do you have anything else that you want to add? No. You asked, okay, you just want to see if you had a big day. All right, yeah. good. <laughs> no, you too as well. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay, what in the God of Blast site? No, oh, reading oh, well, 20, before, Chris. I came before. Oh, uh, yes. dichotomy. Yes, what in the God of Blast site, but Jimmy Neutron hairstyle is that? Shorty looked like a whippy dip. <laughs> <laughs> you got something you want to say back to dichotomy? Who, who me? Yeah. I look good. Mm-hmm. And um, y'all know what's going on. I'm an artist. Y'all don't see all these other artists coming out. They ain't creative. Stop playing with me. Okay. All right. Lums907. If she put me in the friend zone, she gonna see me in her friend's phone. <laughs> 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 Official MBM gang. Uh, showed up the pink glasses looking like she about to get the Grinch back in the Christmas spirit. Oh, I shit. do look like a Whoville. I really do. Like, uh, I so love hate. that. Oh, wow. The real new Jimmy Neutron. Stealing Steal my, my whole damn floor. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. I love that. That's hilarious. Wow. Um, and then we got uh, Giovanni. Giovanni Dansby. There, are, there's only three types of women. I uh, is, was, or will be. Uh, where do the ladies place themselves today? Okay, huh? that was difficult. Time to yeah. Yeah. Is, was, or will be. Jay Martin. I'm confused on that one. Uh, Giovanni, help us out. All right, Jay Martin. Tell us what's up, Martin, with the little cutie behind the scenes. You dipping that pen in company ink? You could pull on work. Put a. <laughs> Pull on out worse. Oh, wait, you have. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Hey, listen, I didn't get that girl pregnant. God damn it. I'm not the pappy. Uh, nine either crown. Um, 20 bucks. Decent panel tonight, fellas. Take notes. All right. Yeah, no bimbo. Cage Jackson, 25 bucks. Just stop by to l- l- like the video. When did you guys when did you guys let Guile from Street Fighter join the show? <laughs> oh, shit. What? Sonic Boom. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> uh, Women spend all day lying. Look at all the weave and makeup. Their whole lives are lives. Look at their IG pages. God that's damn. Tommy. Oh, that's Tommy. Uh, <laughs> Tommy Santamaria again. Says the woman who everything on her is fake. She obviously doesn't love herself. Okay, I'm done. Hold oh, I have something to say to that. Go ahead, sure. Check my Instagram, baby. I'm always natural. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Stop playing with me. Okay. I actually look better naturally. But I'm Spike. I'm a character today. Love it. Enjoy yeah, it. Yeah, Jimmy Neutron. Mm. <laughs> All right. Okay. Kedra, Atlanta, 1994. Or 94. Shardy next to Fresh Prince CEO is A1. Let's go with you. Uh, What's your Instagram? Hey, your oh, I'm Jen. Jen Starred. Jen Starred, three R's. All right. All right. Send All your right. dick pic there, my friend. <laughs> uh, are you accepting applications? Four. I don't men? know. For men? Oh, yes. Okay. I'll send some. I'll see you. Hey, man, I'll review it. Out oh. <laughs> <laughs> of Miami to Atlanta. <laughs> Tropical. <laughs> Uh, wielding purple, Sonic the Hedgehog. C blocked her fiance, so her doctor willied her and took them rings back. Little Alicia Keys in the back is a super freak. IG, well, he wants your Instagram. 
No, he wants he wants, he wants her IG. Oh, oh, and then also, uh, and then he was think... making fun of her hair. Oh, so some about uh, what? What's, well, you dropped it before. What was it again? C a r o l i n a w i n e e. All right, cool. Carolina Wine. Lord Honesty's wrath. Twenty bucks. B v v refused to believe this. This the slave master would grape the female slaves. You're not even like or care about them in any way, and go to bed with the miss. Yet B v v act like the slave master actually liked them. B v v are delusional. I think what he's saying is that the dude smashed their... Okay. B -V -V. I'm a little, I'm, was so B -V -V. I'm a little yeah, confused. Yeah, you paid money to say that? You like, paid money to say that? What? That's I'm a little weird, confused. Bro. And then, I mean, Daniel, lie detector finally. Yeah, we got y'all, man. Uh, nine, uh, either crown. Th these women always say we can smash chicks together. Point is, <laughs> it's not about you. <laughs> 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 that's a fact. That's yeah, a fact. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a fact. Uh, I'll keep it a thousand. Uh, smashing a girl with your girl is gonna probably it's be different. more problematic than any, no, it's not. Yeah, like, oh, you. I've, I've done, done it. I've really done it. And I'm jealous. telling you that it's not. If I'd be like, fuck that bitch. Yeah, and, then, and, then, and then what if he? And then what if he jizzes with her, not you? That is the care. problem with cheating. This is what I'm because, trying to say. Because that's care. the problem with cheating. Because now girls think they can share a bed with Stop you. Stop talking about, yeah, sure. I no. know. No they want to come in the bed. Oh, bring her. Uh, let me join. Let me join. If you're going to let me join. Guys, guys don't know how far is too far. For example, right? Let's say I'm smashing you. And we do side to side a certain way, right? That's like just us. Yeah. I do with this girl. That's the next girl. You might say, oh, fuck this nigga. He's doing it with this, this chick too. That's too far. Yeah. So we don't know how far is too far. That's a problem. So if you do it with you, you're like, man. I messed up because I went too far. Yeah. We don't know. You got to ask. All right. So I'll we're going to strap in this. the ladies right now. I wish uh, I wish hoes it's, would it's keep it more right? G. Wait. No, no, no. Start with four. me first. You can start four with me first. girls are allegedly <laughs> celibate. Okay. We got four. All right. Cool. And then so Let's go. her, her, uh, what was that? Go uh, yeah. I'll read the chats while Christina does this. Go ahead. Get, the, right, cool. get them going. Uh, Mississippi man, KO. Do women realize they are lowering their options by when they want a HD? Average <laughs> D size in America is six <laughs> inches. So why even lower your chances? I think, yeah. Um. Hey man, every girl has different preferences yeah, on, on, on dick I think size. Yeah, preference, a preference is a preference. You can't preference. change nobody's preference. Yeah. At the end of the day, size really don't matter. It's about the motion of the yep. ocean, baby. Yep, really? yep, 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 yep. You tell me so three cow. inches. Do okay. Like Three inches. I don't know. I never had nothing that small, so I don't know. <laughs> That's what I said. That's what I said. I've had something small <laughs> before. Oh, I've had something small before, and he worked that shit like, whoa. Like, it felt whoa. like some yeah. Yeah. Yo, Ow. Yeah. Ow. 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 Well, you, you, you are celibate, so. Hey, I got to say something. If you like it in the ass, you can't fuck a long dick, nigga. You just can't. That's, that's a fact. Okay? That's if you fact. don't like it in the ass, you can fuck what you want. Wait, but, how do you know? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> Molly fans, yo. Yeah. <laughs> she she lit. I yeah. love her. Yeah, so All right. If you fuck with with a long dick, yeah, you can't do that. Dude, yeah, you can't do ain't that. Ain't no way you, get, you, can, you can fuck with yeah. her. You gotta go. I smaller. think big. Sometimes I think I think guys with big penis definitely cheat for sure. Okay. Yeah, because sometimes it gets too big and I can't handle that. <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> uh -uh. Mm -mm. Okay, so real quick. By the way, shout out to uh, Dope Dragon Bros. Uh, on the panel, we'll you prefer thickness or length? Thickness. Yeah. Thickness? Well, yes. Thickness for sure. Thickness? Yeah. There gotta be a combo. <laughs> you need bow. both? Yo. Bow, 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 bow. Combo, straight up. Thickness. Uh -huh. Thickness. Combo. Combo? But I prefer no thickness. Okay. Yeah, I'll real. take the combo because if this thick is probably short. You just bang okay. my hand up. Yeah. Goddamn. I mean, sometimes... All right. so, we're gonna, so we're gonna start with a control question. We're just gonna say... Are you a girl or are you a female? Yeah. Yes or no. And then uh, for the light tester for the light. So I'm going to. Uh, so uh, you ask the question while me and Christina are going to fire the things up. OK, turn them all on. Yeah. Turn them on. OK. All right. All right. Wait, give it a second. Uh, give it a second. Are y'all girls? You don't use it, Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. He's going to ask the question. Everybody else be silent. Everybody else be silent. Question. Are you a girl? No, not yet. Not yet. Well, oh. Okay. No. Go ahead. Ask. Question. Are you a girl? Yes. 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 What? <laughs> That's crazy. She got a yeah. Yo, this is wild. How do you know this? Wait, how do you know this, 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 you know this true? Okay. Okay. Somebody just said that explains your height. Yeah. I can't. This is wild. Yeah, okay. So you gotta be calm. You can't be like, like you can't uh, be moving and yeah. moving. you gotta do it at the same time. Hers so, turn on early. But okay, uh, so. okay, so what we're gonna do now is now we're just gonna ask: Have you had sex in the past two weeks? Okay, okay. perfect. All right. Oh no, you know what, mom. <laughs> 
We'll give them some leeway. Okay. Actually, you know what? Okay. I'm going to ask the question. They don't know what I'm going to ask. Okay. okay, perfect. All right. The other button, that one. So when that do we one? hit no, no, no. it? That one. This one? This one. All right, Christine, do we hit start right now? Yeah. All of them? The thing that's the one, one, two, three. Two, three, hit them. All right. You missed Everybody it. be quiet. Uh, did it turn off? No, she messed up hers. God damn it, man. I'm sorry. That's twice. <laughs> Fucking. All right. Uh, all right. We're just going to restart it again. Sorry, guys. Give us a, give us a second here. We're going to restart right. it again. You have to fuck that one up. Do God damn it. I'm sorry. Women always messing things up. All right. So do I just turn it off? Did you... Okay. I don't know what I did. You just turned it on. Oh. Uh, no, okay. No, no. You just okay. Hold on. So we got to do this in sync. Yeah, we got to do it in sync. So is, is it the right one? Yeah. Christina, okay. Can you explain yeah, it clearly? Like... What? Can you explain it clearly? Okay. So ready? Cool. But at the same time, the, and it has like that little like the black little... one. The, this one right here on the not not, not the other way. side. The other side. Cool. Yeah. All right. So um, and then Christina, you got that one on three. We're gonna hit them all. One, two, two three. three. All right. Now everybody, shut the hell up. I'm gonna ask the question. All right. Once it gets clear. Okay. Why don't you ask the question? Have you had sex no. with a man in the past three weeks? Oh wait, you have no. to do it in the meantime. Then the thing you press it, the button. Yeah, oh, while it's in the dun 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 dun. So we gotta press it. That's why it's like a shark. You know it's coming. So you gotta ask yeah. Yeah. with the. You, you press the button and then you ask. Sorry guys, it's our first time doing this shit. Okay. So we we. Okay. Sorry. 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 So one, two. Wait, hold on. Whoa, 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 Because this shit right here is still red on the side. Yeah, we do that. Is she so, like, are you like, relax, I'm, I'm like let relax. go, don't hit this. No, no, just relax. Okay. okay. Maybe I should move it. Should I not move it? No, yeah, don't, don't move. You want to stay relaxed as okay. much as you can. Yeah, you right. good? Yeah, yeah she said, she okay. knows she, she capping. She knows she's had sex yesterday, right before the show, <laughs> goddamn no, it. Not, yes uh, not, not yesterday. Not oh, yesterday. Yeah, not yesterday. Last week, though. Um, <laughs> Christina, why is this thing red here? I'm like crazy. Yeah, yeah Kassan. Uh, you're another one? All right, we're going to grab another one for her. You were spared. Let me read these chats real quick, Chris, while we do this. Yeah, the girls are nervous right now. This is like, oh, shit, what the hell? <laughs> I'm waiting. I'm just like... Let's see. We'll see if you guys are really celibate, man. Because I, I honestly think it's a girl's never not fucking somebody. She's always smashing somebody. You or it's a That's toy. a lie. But even, then, even then, That's not true. it's can always a toy. You? That's not true. It's, you know what? <laughs> That's not true. Women women can stay celibate. Yeah, like, Very true. I think so. Yeah, no, it's they can't. But do they? Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. We do. We yeah. do. Okay. All right. So, um, all right. So we're gonna strap her, strap her in. So why is it still red on this side, though? It's fine. All right. So when it has the shark sound, that's when I ask the question. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right then. All right. On three. Are y'all all ready? Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Fresh, you gotta hit her button. All right. One, two, three. Have you had sex with a man? In the past three weeks, yes or no? No. I heard yes. <laughs> All right, who lied? Somebody no, lied? No, no one lied. Damn. Okay. No, someone said yes. Someone said yes. I said yes. I heard yes. I said yes. Also, so you lied. So it said I'm lying. That's good. <laughs> no, 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 no. I know I'm telling you lied the truth. Earlier, but you still truth now. No, I you told you guys. A month. Not this year. A month. They said three weeks. This is three I weeks. Said, three We're in February, so this is the three-week month. I said a month ago, and three weeks is a month ago, so it still <laughs> calculates. In her head. Yeah. 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 In her head, <laughs> okay. All right. If we if we get another um uh, another need for to ask a question, we will. Okay. Now we understand. I gotta we gotta ask a question True. when it's shark time. Now yeah. I know. Yeah. Uh, all right. We good on, on chats. Uh, yeah, we good on chats. Yeah. Okay. All right, we got video to play. Video. Let's play the video. So um, this video is from our boy Daquan Wiltshire talking about basically why men have to lie. I oh, can take your hands off in relationships. Okay. So y'all said earlier who lies more men talking yeah. about cheat more men basically. Now look, I why men have to lie. Right in Chris. Okay, yeah. So Chris, double play, Chris. I know. All right. Thank you, sir. All right. Yeah. So this video talks about basically like why guys actually lie to girls because obviously speaking like they want to tell the truth but they can't because if they do, you know, you guys might flip out. So. Yeah. Here we go. All right. Let me show okay. the screen. Shout out to our boy Daquan, DSG gang in the building. All right back. But before but we get into the video, y'all wouldn't mind doing me. And before we play this thing, oh yeah, fast forward it, guys. Before we play this thing, guys, seconds. like the goddamn video. What are, what are the likes at, Mo? 28 seconds, Chris. 28 seconds on the clock. Thanks. Cool. Mo, what are we 2. at, Mo? 2.4. Guys, there's almost 7,000 of you guys in here. Like the goddamn video right now. All right? 
Help us with the engagement. Get the likes up. Get us 7,000. Uh, let's hit this thing. Proud to be here. Hmm? If you really love my videos, why aren't you subscribed yet, bro? That's what we have to deal with. Why do you think you see people with a million views, 100,000 likes, and 1,000 comments? So if y'all could please mm -hmm. like the video. Yeah. Guys, Drop pause it real comments. quick. When you get a chance, go, go to his channel, like the video, and also like his channel as well. Of course. Cool. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video. <laughs> All right, that's at least 45 seconds. All right, but now that we got monetized, let's get into this video. All right, y'all. Now, peep game. Okay, so I'm scrolling through Twitter, right? On this wonderful Teddy Tuesday. And this tweet comes across my timeline. And it reads, men be dating just to have sex. And wonder why shit goes left every time. Mm. So I looked through the quotes, and this one tweet stuck out to me. This woman says, "You know how down bad and demented you gotta be to pretend you want a relationship just for sex, <laughs> like, lol." Yeah. Ladies, <laughs> I'm here to give you a harsh truth. We have to lie to get the pussy. Y'all bitches got to lie to get the pussy. What the fuck make you think I ain't going to lie to get it? We got to lie to get some pussy we already had. Like, say, for instance, when it comes down to fucking your ex, you got to text us some stupid shit like, you know, come over so, so we can talk face to face. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're a missionary. Fuck out of here. I'm just coming over to talk. You were coming over to do a four letter word, but I guarantee you it ain't talk. That's if I need somebody to just talk to. I'll go to a therapist. And and even then, that all depends on how the therapist look. I may fuck on her. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Y'all be making them some dumb ass excuses as to why y'all can't give it up. Like, bro, I ain't even gonna hold y'all. What time my ex, she gonna tell me, I don't think you deserve my energy anymore. Shut the fuck up, Vegeta. <laughs> 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 Man, we was laughing at me. Energy well, Vegeta, don't give a fuck about your energy in the first place. <laughs> as long as you got the energy to fuck. As long as you got the energy to fuck. Give me the girl. You tell her. I'm trying to get to know you. She'll be like, no, you're just trying to get to fuck me. What do you think's gonna happen when I get to know you? Huh? What do you, you think? We're gonna have a sleepover or something? Bitch, I'm gonna fuck you regardless. <laughs> Let's just say I am just trying to get to know you. How do you think it's gonna happen? Huh? I'm gonna get to know you in and out. In that exact yeah. order. <laughs> me, myself, I have no problem lying to get some pussy. Y'all remember that one time when I told y'all you should tell a woman your true intentions when you're trying to pursue her. Like, say, for instance, if you just want sex, then you should let her know. <laughs> man, I was lying when I said that bullshit. <laughs> I mean, that shit that I don't know what the fuck to tell you. Bro, I was lying so I can give me some pussy. And guess what? I got the pussy. Bro, this girl was like, oh my God, I've never met a man as real as you. Bitch, there are sex dolls that are realer than me. Yeah. <laughs> you know Gil was a realer boy than me. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Prime example said? of me lying to get some pussy. Y'all remember when I was on a Fresh and Fit podcast, right? Hey. 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 Raw sex, basically saying, you know, I, I'm not wearing a condom. Blah, blah, blah. Then all of a sudden, you know, this girl next to me was like, oh my God, like that's just disgusting. You should wear one. Blah, blah. And I was like, I'm, I'm just joking. <laughs> but I ain't bought a condom since 2012. Oh, no. no. Oh, that's so nasty. I don't like condoms. All of y'all women that's are like, so oh, I love a real nigga. You love a real liar. I guarantee you the only reason why you love that nigga is because of the lies he told you. What y'all women be saying? Oh, I can't tell a man the type of man that I like because he'll just pretend to be that until he gets what he wants. <laughs> <laughs> well, how about you tell me that you're a whore? Huh? How about some of you got Eiffel tired before we get in the fucking relationship? Y'all want us to be real with y'all just to get the pussy, but y'all don't want to be real with us to get in a relationship. Prime example, Brittany Renner. Look at her and PJ Washington. If she would have told that nigga her true intentions, then she would have gotten her ass left. Nigga, look at Colin Kaepernick, nigga. She already knew she couldn't pull that shit with that nigga when that nigga made her pay for a flight. Ladies, if y'all really wanted us men to be real with y'all, y'all wouldn't ask us dumb ass questions. Like, say, for instance, you dating a big girl. She coming to you, babe, do I look fat in this dress? Uh... <laughs> but you are fat in that dress. Yeah. What the fuck you a fat nigga? You wear You know what? But if we tell y'all that, then you ain't gonna give us the pussy anymore. Ladies, trust <laughs> me. I love y'all. You know what I'm saying? But like, <laughs> y'all gonna lie again. Look, I, don't, I love the ones that I'm trying to fuck. But plain and simple, <laughs> yo, I encourage That's niggas so to lie. Funny. Bro, lie to get that box. Because look at all of the bullshit we gotta deal with from y'all women mm -hmm. just to even get it in the first place. Mm -hmm. Yes, men do lie to get pussy, which is obviously a bad thing. But y'all bitches lie to get money. Look at $200,000 a month. Ooh. And child support from this nigga, which is worse, <laughs> her giving up a box or this nigga giving up $200,000 a month for 18 years. And 
Hey, one more money. Just be lying just to get free That's meals tough. out of niggas. Yeah, we That's know fact. about that Thanks. too. Y'all really be going out on dates with niggas that y'all have no interest in just to get a free meal. Like, bitch, and then y'all got the nerve to get on Twitter and be like, if you broke the bitch, if you homeless, just, <laughs> <laughs> if you homeless, just go to the show. Uh-huh. Like, what, if, what if we start saying shit like that? The fuck you know about this? Can't say, like, y'all women Yo. really don't want men to lie to y'all to get the pussy, but then y'all don't even give us room to actually tell y'all the truth. Like, say, yeah. <laughs> who runs dating apps? Women. You know how I know that? Mm-hmm. I have no statistic behind it or anything like that. You know how I know that? Because of what you can put that you're interested in. Because none of those say fucking the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pause, 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 pause real quick. Pause real quick. Pause real quick. Yeah, I, I'll give you the stats right now. Uh, women find over like ninety percent of the men is unattractive on dating apps, yep. like on uh, Tinder studies. Yeah, they are. Yeah, yes, they are. yeah. It's a yeah. picture. And most most people on the dating apps are actually men too. So are you at something? Oh no, I say it's just a picture. Oh you? oh, well. It, well, yeah, but then the reason why I say that is because most women find most guys as unattractive, whereas most men find most women attractive. Mm-hmm. So it's, it's just, it. yeah, it's completely different. So, like, women are super selective on dating apps. But, yeah, Daquan, you're right. You're on, choosers, you're on target we here. We are the prize. What was that? They post a we fucking... are the choosers so wait, and we are the prize. So, guys, so you should still keep I lying. Mean... Lying is what needs to be happening We, we could right definitely now. talk about that right after. Yeah, okay. but okay. I respectfully disagree. I don't, I think... It, all right, so women are the prize at a certain level, but the higher and higher you go up, the more rare the man that you're getting, then the less leverage you have, and then the more it shifts back in the man's favor. So it's really up to the girl, but let's be honest. Women want the best, right? If you get the best, no. that's what happens. Well, you no longer become the prize, and women hate hearing that, but that's that's why, like men, can be in a section full of chicks, but you can't necessarily, but a chick ain't gonna be in a section full of dudes. It doesn't work that way. Yeah, Does I that think, make sense? I think the worst part is that, that women want the best guy, but they don't know what it comes with. They don't yeah. understand the consequences. And when they find out what comes with it, it's like, oh, I don't want to tolerate this, but guess what? Yeah. That's what you chose. Yeah. It, it, you, it, there's two, you basically have two options. You can get with a more average guy who's going to pedestalize you and make you a queen, make you like, you know, the priority, et cetera, but you're going to lose respect for him and lose attraction for him eventually because women don't like to be pedestalized. Let's be honest here. Mm-mm. Or you could go ahead and get with a guy that is top tier, but you're not going to be the prize anymore. You're going to basically have to be on his program and understand that, He's the commodity now, and you no longer have that. And a lot of women don't but, like that because y'all want to feel special all the time. But that's like that's a woman true. that I feel like that's a woman Merch. that's not up there as well. You want to hear something that sucks? Okay, tell me. You being up there financially has no bearing on you being more attractive. No, I know, I know that. Okay, I know that. We're what saying I'm, up there what, from what stat? From what, what I'm point? saying is, oh, okay, I'm sorry. What I'm what I'm saying is, we are the prize. Beyonce, let's let's say Jay Z. Uh, Jay, let's just say Jay Z. Let's say Jay Z. Let's say Jay Z. Hold on, let's say Jay Z. Jay Z is top. Every woman wants him. (laughs) Who just said that? Me, girl. Every woman (laughs) wants Jay Z. Okay. Every man, every woman, (laughs) everybody (laughs) wants Beyonce. Wrong. If he's you think every guy wants Beyonce? Yes. You think everyone wants Jay Z? Yeah. Yes. Man. I'm giving I'm giving examples of right, top ahead. tier right. people. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I'm giving examples of top tier people. Jay Z, no. He got to stick with Beyonce. She's the prize. Okay. So um. So here here's uh. Was that your point? I, I just want to make sure. Okay. And Rihanna ASAP. Who's the prize? Rihanna. Okay. Like you know what I'm saying? So here's a, here's these the women can get anyone they want. Here's... They know. Here's the unfortunate reality. They know. I don't know if you know this because women always love to bring up Jay Z and Beyonce. <laughs> Jay Z actually cheated on Beyonce, and she didn't go anywhere. Mm-hmm. But and she the did too. Why, and he said that in a in a thing. He, and she, he, she cheated on him. And he had to he had to get himself together to get his woman back. He said it. And he the, said that album. shit. I gotta I gotta double check that. He album. said that he shit. But it. but the point is this. Jay-Z can replace her, but she can't necessarily replace him. Yes, she, she can. can replace no. him. She's no. Beyonce. Yes, she no. can. She's Beyonce. No. Yes, because there is a million billionaires in Dubai. Can I finish my point? Yes, go ahead. Can I finish my point? So the thing is this. Beyonce is at a point now where she's extremely successful. She's famous. She's at a, a very high social status. She will not deal with anyone below her level. It is what it is. Jay-Z mm-hmm. is pretty much at that same level, if not a little bit higher, but he can easily date down. So who has more options, realistically speaking? Jay-Z. Jay-Z, Jay-Z. not her. Yeah. Because J- Beyonce is basically, her success has ostracized her for most of the dating market. Yeah. Her own, I always say it, when women, the more money and status a woman has, the more doors close. The more money and status a man has, the more doors open. 
So she is not capable of replacing him with the same ability that he's able to replace her. Because here's the reality. If she becomes single again, yeah, people want her, but they're not going to take her seriously. She She's kids, older. And she, she has kids. kids. Exactly. Her value has deteriorated. I know it sounds awful to say that, right. but a woman that's in her, what, 50s now almost? You're right. Yeah. Is not going to be the same as a man in, in his 50s. Halle and Berry. she has kids, etc. cetera. Halle Berry had to go lesbian. Yep. When a woman gets older, I hate to say it, her value starts to diminish. But when a man gets older, his value increases increase. if he does the work. So he can easily replace her, but she can't replace him. If he went back on a dating market, he could find another girlfriend like that. Yeah. If she went back on a dating market, she's not going to find a man to take her seriously. Men will want her to have sex with her, but they're not going to take her serious and actually marry her or give her some kind of relationship. Look at Kim Kardashian right now. Struggling. But Kanye says she she's getting she's smashed, struggling. Bro. She can't, yeah, but no, but that's what I'm trying to say is that she even knew it when she broke up with Kanye. She said, I fucked up. I can't keep a relationship. Yeah. And she was going from dude to dude to dude because mm -hmm. she knows she's older. She came, became famous <laughs> from a sex tape, etc. Mm -hmm. She doesn't have the same leverage that she thinks she does. This dude that's dating right now, he's probably going to have his fun and then he's eventually going to move Gone, on. Yeah. She ain't going to get married again that's it. or get a serious relationship. So that's all I'm saying is that we, we need to let women know the uncomfortable truth that as you get older, your leverage starts to decline with it. Your money and status doesn't have the same power as a man's money and status. Yeah. Right. And Beyonce is a terrible example. Beyonce is right. right. a terrible shooting. example. And now look at J-Lo. J-Lo is with somebody else again. And she's keep her relationship either. Yeah. Yeah. J-Lo's been, been with a lot of dudes. with a lot of dudes. But what I'm saying is, yeah, she can't keep it. Oh, all right, all right. She's a bad example. Gotta get right. this one. Gotta get this one. She's a bad example. I can't right. Right. But what I'm saying one. is, what I'm saying is there are men, like there are men that will come in. There, there'll be older men, mm -hmm. but there are men that will come in and take Beyonce serious. You cannot. Oh, say, wait, hold on. You can't say somebody not going to. But I guess King French says. You also didn't cheat your cap in. I just fact checked. You can't <laughs> fact check cheating. Where? Cheating Where? happens. Where did you fact you check? Because he said it. He what said, song did he say it on? He said the shit. I heard the shit. I what, heard the what shit. Song? Okay. <laughs> no, it wasn't a song. It was a documentary. She said it was, he said it on a song. No, it was like, it was, it was a documentary. He was speaking. What was he was the speaking. I'm going to look this up. I don't know because I was at someone's <laughs> house watching <laughs> it. it. I was at somebody's house hey, watching man. it, but I heard it with my ears. Yeah. Either so, way, you use, Beyonce, you, you use Beyonce and Jay-Z. Mm -hmm. To be honest, celebrities are always terrible, but yeah. in, even in that example, mm -hmm. it still holds true that Jay-Z has the leverage because she didn't leave him. But yeah. And, he, then, right. and he can't, she can't replace him. He can go to someone younger and not on her level where she will date up no if, if she I dates no. again i think i think it's yeah, there's I, I, feel, I mean higher than jay-z though like there's a lot higher than jay-z this is a lot just rihanna dated famous? higher than jay-z what are you yeah. saying what just man higher than jay-z wants a woman with kids that's 50 years old tell me if she's she beyonce another, another young chick 21 why does she want 50 years because old and because kids? beyonce is beyonce and her name holds that weight we don't care about i mean her name does hold weight her name holds that weight you want to hear another uncomfortable truth a man's status and clout gets him girls. A yes. woman's status and clout repulses mm -hmm. men. Yep, yep. I'm going to say that one more time for you guys. For a man's status and clout gets him girls. A woman's status and clout repulses other men. Mm -hmm. Every yes. famous guy that we brought in here or someone that's a, a somebody in the music industry, whatever, you know what they say they want in girls? I want to be able to bring her to a party and nobody knows who the fuck she yes. is. Yes. That's yep. what men want. Yep. You guys want a nigga that's lit, that's on IG with a blue exactly. chick, etc. We don't want that. And I, I think that's a big mine. mistake women make is that they think Men and women are the same. Everything you guys look for, typically, we look for the opposite. Mm -hmm. You want a masculine, strong man. We want a dainty, feminine woman that's going to be submissive. You want a guy that's going to be assertive and dominant. We want a woman that's going to follow our program and be compliant. We are opposites. You want a man that has money and be able to provide security. We want a woman that's going to follow our lead and not fuck up our ability to continue providing the security. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's like saying, oh, well, Beyonce is lit. Her name. Her name doesn't hold shit when, the, when it comes to marriage and relationships with men. And a man that meets, matches her level of status and income is not looking for her. Dudes that make that kind of money are trying to be around a bunch of 21-year-old baddies on a right. boat. So They're not trying absolutely. to be with old chicks. Yeah, absolutely. Her career is going to get in the way. She's not going to be able to be a, a dutiful girlfriend and or boy, uh, wife. Like, not hell no. They're going to go with the younger, more attractive girls. You're in the music industry. You see it every time. Right. How many music execs, successful guys, etc., do you see with broke bum bitches? A lot. Right, all the time. That's what they a love. Lot. They now love the broke it. bum bitches. Now, now let's reverse it. How many successful female artists you see with broke bum niggas? 
None. None. But we can't. What? Nick, Nick, Nick Minaj. Okay, an exception to the rule. <laughs> so, I'm sorry, Nick. But did he have like a business or something? Ooh. Wasn't he like a? He was a big time drug dealer. So he was a big time. And a rapist. Yeah, yeah. But but the point is, is that it, that's an exception to the rule. But if a woman is established in the music industry, she's gonna want to date either her equal or someone above, typically. Yeah. So, but uh, men aren't the same. The, that's um, all. the question was um hypothetical, by the way. Um, if you know she cheated on him, so it wasn't wasn't real according to what I'm seeing right now. Okay, hold on. Jay's, Chris, Beyonce loved Beyonce. Beyonce. Yeah, Beyonce. Loved, I don't think Beyonce cheated um, on him. She loved him. I don't think so. Sengoku, I think that's she loved she him. He said it out of his mouth. He says, uh, Jay-Z was asked in an interview if he would ever forgive Beyonce if she was in the one I cheated. He said, I hope so. Yeah. So. And that's a fucking no. No, yeah, that's yeah. a big yeah, that's time a big no. no. It was and yo, real quick, guys, we're going to kill the Twitch stream and the Twitter stream. Uh, so, guys, if you guys want to check us out, throw the throw the uh, YouTube on, on uh, Twitch. We're going to go over to YouTube only, guys. So, check us out over there on YouTube. Shout out to all our Twitch ninjas out there. Um, so check us out on YouTube, okay? Um, going back to what we're saying, um, we're talking about Jay Z, yeah, not cheat. Yeah, I mean, he's not gonna, bro. I tell guys all the time, if a girl cheats on you, she's effectively dead to you. You need to get rid of her immediately because she had to get to a certain place in her mindset to be able to bring herself to do it. Yeah, yeah. you know yes. what I'm saying? A That's man true. cheating is not the same as a woman cheating. Yeah, big time. So it's it's the worst form of betrayal because I let's be know, honest, I cheated and niggas always take me back. Oh well, they're simps. So, uh, <laughs> and that's true. Yeah, that's, yeah, but, I mean, no, yeah. no well, guy that has are. options that respects himself is gonna take a girl that cheat on him, man. Like they're just not because not. the the thing is, is that men don't really ask for much from women. We really don't. We're very simple. Mm -hmm. we want you to be compliant, not give us a headache, give us peace, and not fuck other guys. You guys, however, want a man that's tall, ambitious, confident, good conversationalist, funny cute, et cetera, but, all these uh, things. I just want, so uh, men don't really acquire much of women. So the things we do ask for have a lot of weight. Since we don't ask mm -hmm. for much, each thing has more weight. And I would put at the top of the list is to not embarrass me with your promiscuity in the past. Yeah, and, loyalty. Yeah, pretty much. That's that right there. That This is how girls that aren't that attractive land billionaires. Look at Jeff Bezos' wife. Look at Bill Gates' wife, et cetera. A lot of these guys that are very wealthy, their main, main chick or their wife, she's the not basic. that attractive. But why? She ain't embarrassing them and she's loyal. Yeah, my men prioritize, dude. I will take a loyal, yeah, hundred percent. I'll take a loyal chick that's a seven over a ten that has a bunch of bodies and has fucking been around. That's, you know what's the hardest yeah, to that's date? How girls want I think the hardest guys to date is the guys that been through girls that actually dog the shit out of them, and then they, you know, then it's time for you to date them, and it's like they almost carry what has happened to them into the new person they're dating. And that's the same thing we do that they see and they're like, oh, she's toxic or she damaged. She needs time for herself. That like, The same way we see it. We all like kind of see it. That's why it's really good to hear. That heal. does happen. Yeah. Uh, I would just say like, if that's the scenario, think about this, right? If you meet somebody for the first time and you had a bad experience with somebody else in the past, if you're bringing that baggage to that new person, that's really kind of going to mess up that future endeavor. Yeah. But you're right. It happens to men and women. So I get what you're saying. Yeah. Did you have anything else you want to say? I I, know, I, I made my point about Jay-Z. Oh, to yeah. But I had a question about something else. Y'all keep saying Frank Castle. Oh, uh, uh, oh no, no, don't worry about yeah, that. That's rapper, that. That, that has nothing right? to do with y'all. Huh? Yeah. That's a rapper. Oh, and, oh and she's thinking about, yeah, that, it's about Kodak's guy. guy. Yeah, yeah, Frank Castle, the you're big talking guy, about? right? Big guy, yeah, right? Yeah, no, that, yeah. no, yeah. no, no, that's, that that's when we kick girls out. That, that's a whole other. It's yeah. a little thing. But yeah, y'all are cool. Uh, like, kinda, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, nah. Okay. Um, oh, I'm like, like I guess I thought you were talking about the rapper. I'm like, no, 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 no. That's Frank, Frank, that's good. Frank Castle the Punisher. So like, when we kick girls out, it's like, oh, yeah. Punisher. Uh, yeah. Okay. So, okay. Like exile. Like, but, but huh? Was it? It's like you exile from the show or something. No, because he punishes bad behavior. So, oh, yeah. oh went, okay, okay. I went viral on TikTok for for saying punish bad behavior for him, from women, and they're like, "Oh, what the fuck? That's misogynist." I'm like, "Bro, <laughs> if a girl flakes on a date, you got to punish the bad behavior. Like, you don't ask her back. If you take if she if she goes back out, which you got to make her buy the first round of drinks because girls be flaking all the time and they be on the fuckery. So you got to like punish bad behavior. And that went fucking crazy on the internet because allegedly having boundaries is is uh is in, is bad. So, so anyway, misogyny. Yeah, misog yeah. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Some chats here. Uh, did you have anything anything else or? All right, cool. Just want to make sure y'all get your points out before. But this, but do you see my point though? Kind yeah. of. I did. Uh, yeah, I saw, I saw your point. Yeah, I saw your point. Uh, see, this is great, man. Good discussion with people, man. <laughs> it's not wrong. See, see, guys, this is a good discussion, man. Yo, every time we bring up that Jay Z Beyonce thing, girls be getting their feelings, though, bro. No, I, I saw <laughs> your yeah, point. Man. I saw your point. But I feel like I'm the prize. I'm okay. yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm That's, the prize. I'm hey, playing. You, you can feel that way. Yeah. You can feel that way. Yeah. Uh, next, next, next. Should. Next, next, next. Uh, Joshua Scarangella. Question, I have a female friend that I've smashed before and the only reason it didn't progress is because of distance. Should I keep her in my life 
We're very close personally, and there's a possibility to smash. Uh, my friend, <laughs> you have a scarcity mindset. Smash. Smash. Well, Twice. If what she you, likes you that much, she will move to where you're at. What you should do, bro, is just keep no. your, um, like, virtually. So every, every now and then you can talk, but don't take it serious. And when she comes in, into town, then, hey, you know what? You're coming into town, hit me up. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't take her seriously, though. Yeah. Uh, Jay Martin, I didn't realize they award prizes for last place. <laughs> Bougie, Bougie, y'all are not the prize. The prize is that kitty cat meow meow. Okay. Wow. Uh, 20 bucks. Kenny, three stacks. L, L Alpha. 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 Yeah, alpha. alpha. Talks with such confidence, yet doesn't know what the fuck she's talking about. Shout out to Little, little Rascals, by the way. Alpha. Little Rascals. I'm confused. Yeah, it's right. that that movie Little Rat. No, 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 artists, yeah. no, the movie, the movie Little Rascals, one of the main characters. Oh, Alpha. Alpha. oh, oh yeah. Yeah. Spike him in here. Oh, you okay. are so beautiful. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I'm, yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. showing my age. Yeah. 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 Um, Venom, twenty bucks. Y'all better listen to Myra, and you can have all the success in the world. But one day you'll be thirty plus and single, waking up in Manhattan building and decide to jump off. <laughs> no, the fuck? Oh um, no! Well, I will say this: uh, we talked about this on Timcast. Uh, there was a uh, article that came out where, like, they said that women are finding more and more men as economically unattractive. Yeah. Uh, in other words, too many broke niggas. As they make more money, <laughs> uh, men make less. Too many. Yeah, yeah. So. And, and here's the thing: women are earning men in a lot of major cities in the U.S., bro. So I foresee which is why I'm investing in Chewy, that there's going to be way more single women in the next 10 to 15 years. Seriously. Yeah. They, they estimate they, uh, really? they estimate that um over 50% of women are going to be single by the year 2030. Why is that? And by the way, this is Capcom, why, by the way. Why do you think that's going to yeah. happen? Yeah. Yeah. Because, like because we're becoming more successful. I think I think there's, three, to th there's two main reasons. Um, Number one is women are earning more money and becoming more successful. Yeah. So yeah. I think that's number one, right? Mm -hmm. Because as a woman earns more money, her socioeconomic status increases and her, her status increases she wants a man to be of at least the same that's level. That's why I'm feeling the right. way I'm feeling. Yeah. So, so that's, I'm a, that's number one. for a while. Uh -huh. And then number two is the advent of the internet, online dating, and Instagram. What that has done is it's made the world small and globalized. So mm -hmm. a woman that yeah. lives in, let's say, fucking Iowa, that's attractive, now has access to a guy that's in L.A., New York City, etc. Mm. And that guy, I mean, we have a whole flyout culture nowadays. So it's like, it, you know, so women have more options than they've ever had before, and they make more money. So they're not going to necessarily sit there and accept an average guy. Mm -hmm. And 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 then also, like, I'll be honest as well, we've brought on well over a thousand women on the podcast. And every time we ask a girl, what kind of guy do you want? They almost always describe a man that's in the top 1%. Mm. And unfortunately, there's not enough of these guys to go around. Hence why you get the cheating. Yes. And the, them fucking other girls. So, yeah, I mean, it's a, we're in a unique position because we talk to girls every day, but we also talk to men. And we're able to kind of see this in the middle. So what I see in the next 10 to 15 years is way more girls are going to be single. Guys are going to continue to struggle having sex. You guys know that like 30% of men are virgins under the age of 30? Yeah. No, I did not. I did not. Can you say that, that. that yeah, one more time? Think about it. Yeah, see, they're like, what the fuck? OnlyFans, porn. These are they're just jacking off. The they're not because even. Guys aren't getting laid. And then sex dolls, there's a new uh, intervention here that's going to be yeah. popular because guys are going to use sex dolls. What, what I said was so. about one third of men that are under the age of 30 and below are virgins. But how are they virgins if like girls these days are like throwing it? They throwing no, it. The top, the top, I was going to say. Top, so and, guys, I mean, I know girls right? they're throwing, throwing it with the guys that <laughs> Wait, they I want. Wanted, I want to hear what So he if to. you get hit up by a lot of guys, right? How many of you, you actually talk to out of, let's say 100 guys hit you up? Like you're asking me truly? Yeah, truly. Like yeah. I don't even talk to people like that. Exactly. <laughs> so like, so, I, so I, think about I hold one and then that's it. Like The one or two guys that you talk to are either tall, successful, or on some part of ambitious yeah, yeah, yeah. path, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. The other guys are invisible to you. So those guys are not getting laid. So think about this. All the girls here in this room, right? You get hit on every day, Instagram, in person, when you go out. But most guys, you curve. Mm -hmm. Those guys that are getting curves all the time. Who are they fucking? Probably nobody. So yeah. they go home, whack off, and that's yeah. all they do. Only fans, porn. That's Winner it. takes all. But I think those guys always get married first. I always think no. those guys. Yes. The good guys always get married first. Want to, hold on. What are you talking guy? about? You want to? You want I to know guy? off my experience. Uh -huh. Well, your experience does not necessarily the refer good guys reality. go. Are the you, good guys always lock in first. Are, they always get are you married, married. And no, I was supposed to be, but no. And why'd you leave him? Wait, why'd you leave him? Because I allowed fear and negativity and other people's thoughts. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Stop the show real quick. Oh, no, no, no. Stop. 
Yeah. 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 We already knew yeah. that she left him and not the other way around. No, but it, I was young. I was no, super no. young, it, like number you're one. Missing the point. You're missing matter. the point. You're missing the point. Women are the selectors and women are the ones that dictate who has sex and who does not. Yeah. So, but I regret it now. I regret it because he was a genuine sweet, sweetheart. Of course you do. Yeah. You know, well, you're older and have more But yeah, I was I was young. I'm young. I was like, what, 16 when I met this guy and I my whole life was going to change in a matter of like a year. He was 20. You now, know, here's a little thing. bit older and you know family was not because he was a different race so family wasn't supporting us the way that he they, we needed to so he was willing to like cut off his whole family and I was looking like why would I allow the love of my life to do that when I know how much he cared about his family so I technically like sacrificed my own love for him to just like do his Coping. own thing and now, and now he's Coping. married and he has kids yeah. and he's living a happy life and Listen, I wish him the best him. if wow. you felt like he was surprised oh. you just said wow. you know what family yeah. I love you but I'm going to this nigga yeah because you right now Girls that have parents that, that, that would like tarnish him or yeah. ex- exile them, which was a guy over over family. I day. know, but I, so, I wasn't yes. like that. And I probably should. But, but now I learn. Like now when you have love, you hold on to it mm-hmm. and you just try never let anybody affect your love because well, that, now, do you yeah. regret it? I mean, I, I don't regret it. It had to happen for me to learn. Oh, so yeah. I'm just happy Bam. that I learn now. So I know when I'm ready. God will bless me. What's your age? That's right. I'm 25. That's okay. right. Yeah, five more years. Figure it out. Uh, <laughs> five more years. Yeah. 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 Um. <laughs> God gonna bless me. Uh, yeah, my yeah. Girl. <laughs> well, here's the thing. Yeah. Here's the thing. I don't know if you know this, but what you just said just now illustrated what we what we've been saying. For, it proves our point even more. Yeah. I'm telling you that it's not difficult for men to get girls. So what happens is a small minority of men are fucking all the girls. Mm-hmm. Let me say that again. Mm-hmm. A small minority of men are fucking a majority of the girls. Mm-hmm. So in other words, the girls are all fucking the same guys. You're in the music industry. You probably see this at you know an even what? higher level. I'm so on a college campus, you were with the athlete, but he was smashing all the other girls. Right. This is how the world works in general. 10 to 20 percent of men are smashing most of the girls. Since the beginning of time, only 40 percent of men have procreated. Think about that. Mm. Only 40 percent of men since the beginning of time have procreated. That means 60 percent of dudes didn't have no sexual access. In other words, have no chicks because the kings and the sultans and the, you know, the guys that won the wars, etc. The ca- captains and generals, they had all the girls. They had the harems of women. Women want guys that have other women. That's just how it is. Yeah. Go to a I VIP learned, section. You know, see Future and Drake. How many girls are there? You know what I Hundreds. learned? Hundreds. Young girls. I learned like that's... Well, I mean, I had to get to know myself first. Mm-hmm. And then, so I went back to God. Okay. And then I had to learn what I, what, I, what I want in a man. And I had to divide what is worldly and what is of God. Mm-hmm. There's a difference. <laughs> There's two differences. You, that's how you really eliminate what you don't want to interfere with and what you should at least pursue. After all the bad boys. Yep. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you, I mean, you have to go through it to learn, hun. You uh, have to. You have to. I mean, it's called fortunate. And it's unfortunate, mm-hmm. but that's the world we live in. And yeah. I was sheltered, so I had to learn the hard way. I had no choice. Saying, you know, so, so so now you want the good guy to come mm-hmm. save you from all yeah. the. I don't need a good guy to come Captain save me. Sam. I just need the person that's meant for me and you the person said, that I'm meant for. Yeah. Yeah. I want a teammate. I want someone yeah. that we can build together, grow yeah. together, and I just want to relax and have but a here's family. The thing, though. Now, Follow here's here's the thing. That's what you want. But what does a man necessarily want? He's going to want a younger girl that's going to follow his, have less mileage on her, potentially be younger, more fertile, um, more attractive. Of course, and less baggage. Yeah. That's a of man course. that that's, don't that's got. Can make baggage I mean, it's vice versa. A whole guy want a toxic girl that can't, you know, be positive and bring peace into his life. You know, well, like you just said earlier, you have to go through a process. Yeah, to, to learn yourself. to learn that. But those guys were like waiting. They're like, "Yo, like I'm here. Look, look at me." No, no, <laughs> this, it doesn't work that way. Oh my god, it, it doesn't like... work that way. What? I'm... I'm reading the stuff, and the stuff I'm no. reading is just so funny. No, no, I can't it, stop don't, don't, laughing. You don't look at that's uh, why they say don't look at the yes. comments, yes. so we can Back focus on the show. Back well, I mean, so sorry. <laughs> the, the reason why it's it's just funny is because a lot of girls go through this. They kind of have fun in their twenties, right? They do their thing, hot girl summer. Mm-hmm. Then they get older, and they realize, damn, all these fuck boys didn't do nothing for me. Let yeah. me find a nice guy. And by then, the nice guys are fucking gone, or right, like, or, or, or you got to settle on a guy that you don't really like, like that, and. That's kind of the, the negative spiral that women go through in the West in general. Is they, they think there's always something better on the other side or they just say, hey, I'm going to have my fun now and then wait until I find a nice guy to save me at the end. And what I'm saying That's... is that that nice guy might not come. Yeah, right. It's better to I have think two I miss my nice guy. You <laughs> girl. Said two yeah. guys. Bro, I when you I girl. tell you you need a dude to support your career, okay. to boost you up Stop and playing. you need somebody to beat your shit up. 
don't think so. I think you, you don't that. got both. You got madness. Oh, okay. okay. That causes problems. You got, okay, you, remember, you got to move in the frame. They can't even see you. Okay. Yeah, you Get your bad ass in the frame. Yeah. Yeah. You remember, plan. Darian Saint. Hey, shout out to you. Uh, you got to have to. But, uh, but anyway, yeah. So almost one third of guys under 30 are virgins. Is basically, And that explains why that most of the guys are smashing. Sorry. Most of the girls are smashing a small percentage. Yeah. Mm. I mean, and that makes sense. Do I mean, you, do you prefer the women out here having sex like this? Like, Popping they is girl. Do, do, they do you guys pop, like they, that? They That's what you prefer, pussy. right? Yeah, these we, young girls, we pop, these eighteen-year-olds, is popping pussy. It, uh-huh. But do we like it? I mean, hey, if we're getting some pussy, cool. But yeah. then it's like, okay, for your future, like. What guy's gonna take it serious after exactly. you've been on the street? Right. Exactly. And if you're known as a hoe, it's like, bro, I'm not about to wife a hoe. Yeah, but then you don't mm-hmm. want to date no girl that you're not gonna get pussy from. Not my, not here in Miami. So, not pussy. It's queen. Like you're not gonna give me pussy, then quick. bye. Right. Yeah, if you give it a quick. It's, it's, it's he a double edged sword because it. yes, right. on one hand we do want to get laid, of mm-hmm. course, but on the other hand it's like, okay, if we're getting laid from these girls and they're doing their thing, multiple guys is like, okay, is she wife material? Probably not. Yeah. So I would just say as a girl. You got to choose a guy that's actually going to be invested in, in you. Yes. But at the same time, if he's there, don't make him wait. Like, don't mm. play games. Like, how long? What do you mean? What, what's the longest? Like, example, right? no, let's, no. Say, let's say you're going to date with a guy, right? Yeah. He got his shit together. He's successful. He's on some level. You got, you got connection with him, right? Yeah. Don't make him wait like three, four dates. Three don't? hours. Don't? No, because think about it, right? Think about it, right? If you make him wait like all this time, it, now you're playing games because one, the connection is there to already. To have sex? Yeah. Some guys what? don't like that. Sometimes you, that's what you would tell your sister. Have three guys, days. Have sex with this dude you that you're dating. <laughs> I'm saying don't play games. Because a lot of women... So, oh, oh, at least make your decision and know what you want. I want to feel like yeah, I'm the one. So I'm going to make them wait. Yeah. It's like, nah, nigga. Like, I work, I work for myself as a high as a high value man, so to yeah. speak. So like, why am I going to have to sit around and wait yeah. when I work for myself already? So it's like, yo, if you find that guy, don't make him wait. Understand that that kind of change there. Mm-hmm. Understand that it's real, and then from there move forward. But don't, but don't. I feel like I feel like merch, women merch. have done that before and jump too quick and they get in themselves in situations that you know. Now yes. they maybe you should have never had sex. It, it is. True. I learned hold, dating without hold, sex hold helps on. better. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. To hold make on. a decision and be clear minded of what you're really looking for, because when you have sex involved, then you're you're allowing dick to yes. take over, especially for a woman. There's a chemical that See, we release yeah, that it's not make us per se. It's cling to a man. I didn't value, though. So, for example, right? I can't be with a girl mm-hmm. first night, second night, right? But connection is there. And she said, you know what? All right, you're into this type of business. Yeah. It's here so I can help you move forward. And guess what? Her doing that, I'm going to help her in the, in the long run as well because that connection is there and the value is there. Okay. Versus, okay, I get sex one night and then, oh, that's it. I'm just going to show her every day after that I have sex with you. That's no value being added to me. Yeah. So it's like, okay, cool. At that point, I'm just gonna keep smashing you, and that's it. But if you're adding value with the sex and the connections there, yeah, you, you're like, good to go. so I what's, what's like the value knows... part with the sex? So it depends, if, it depends, you know, it depends on the guy because let's say, for example, right? Like, uh, this is like a simple example. You come over, my room is a little bit messy, so to speak. And so, you know what? All right, bet we just, we just did our thing, but I'm gonna clean up after this dude because I feel like, you know, he needs okay. his help. And as an example, if he's genuinely into you, he's like, you know what? Damn. Like, sure, you did this for me. Like, out, out of respect, all yeah. right, cool, bet. Yeah. I want to see her again. Oh, shit. Uh, that's dope. That's dope. Like that. that just be yeah, okay. a genuine, just real person. Look out for your man, kind of show him that you're gonna support him. Like, I mean, like, every like, how you're supposed to be. No, not every guy's gonna, uh, I want to say <sighs> reciprocate that, but the ones that are genuinely are into you, they will. Can I, can I yeah. say something? Oh, yeah, can, I, can I say something? Please. First off, when you're dating a man, it doesn't matter if you fuck him on the first day. You let him invest in you. And I'm not saying with money. I'm saying make him do something for you. Make him invest his time into you or his money. And then he will want to date you. And that's where I this get what confused. What do you mean you by that? Don't like, don't say, oh, what does that, that man want? That it's money, not what listen, I did that before where I say, hey, okay, let me go and ask we know what dude he for wants. some money. Like... All right, you're, it, it, I'm not saying no money. Saying, what, I didn't what say am I money. Do I with said that? make him do something for you. <laughs> for instance, when I when I start dating someone, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go to the grocery store. You know, I don't necessarily tell them I'm, I have a child, but they know I, I live by myself. I drive a nice vehicle. I'm going to the grocery store. Uh, give <laughs> you ask them. You ask them, or if, you you if, expect if, them to be like, okay, if, let me help you. So, out. No, no, they're they're not. Sometimes they're they'll offer. Sometimes they won't. But hey, I'm going to the grocery store. I need this. Or hey, I'm driving somewhere. I need some get something. That's it's not part. it's not about begging or anything. It's about seeing where his head is at. Seeing, if he's like, invested if he's gonna, in is you, he gonna if he care enough for you, you to be like, you know, let me so, help you out right exactly. here. Exactly. From then, you know if you want to continue to date this person or not. So you want him to simp on you? 
from the very beginning. Yeah, I like tricks. <laughs> I like, I like oh, tricks. Oh, there we go. Nah, bro. I like no, 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 tricks. No, no, that's good. What, what, I like what other, tricks. I like what, a guy you know knows. what? This is good. This is good. What other tactics do you use? Uh, we need the, the guys can learn something here. What other tactics do you use? <laughs> no, no, for real, for real, no, no, real talk. Like that, you ask them uh, those because I've seen girls do that. You know, yeah. I mean? women do this. They guys, you should don't get mad. You should be listening and taking notes. Because a lot of girls will do this. They'll say, they'll drop little hints like, well, yeah. I haven't eaten yet, you know, or hey, uh, I'm, uh, um, it's really far. Uh, I gotta get gas. Or they'll say, yeah, yeah I'm going yeah, to grocery store. These are kind of things. What else do you? What yeah. else do you? Do I you mean, think just you can do things like that. I mean, I just want to see. I a lot of guy. A lot of time, guys are they do things to see where a girl's head is at, right? Yeah. So we have to do the same thing. Where's mm -hmm. your head at? Because right. you know what you want. You know what you like, right? Mm -hmm. So say what you want. Say what you like, and see if they're willing to do that. Yeah. If they're not, they're That's not the one for you. Problem. Yeah. But here's the thing, though. Too, <laughs> I see what you're doing, uh, which is fantastic. You know, you're going in there. You see if you can exploit the guy, which is fine. You like tricks. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. uh, the only thing that sucks about that is. What he's going to do is he's going to be like, all right, this chick is using me as an ATM. Cool. I'm going to use her as just a sex object. No. Yeah. That's that's yes. how they're going to. Because here's the thing. Uh, yeah. um, as Once a man starts spending money like that up front, like without really even getting to know you or whatever, what's going to happen is he's going to want to collect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's going to want he's going to want that sex. And I, yeah. I, the whole trick mm -hmm. game, if, assuming you're not going to want to have sex, it has an expiration date. You can play that game for a period of time if you don't want to fuck him. And then at some point. He's going to yes, want the yeah. box and cut you off. Or so you can either decide to. Or you to, cut him off. Or exactly. So yeah. or all of that so, is going to stop. Yeah. So, but, so, but, so, but, in, but in. Let, let her finish her thing and then y'all yeah. and then y'all can jo join in. Go but ahead, in the meantime, with those guys that you do those things with, you find the ones that you like and you find the ones that you invest a little bit of time in and you invest a little bit of something in and you, you know what I'm show saying? Show your appreciation. And you show your appreciation. And that's where, you know, it becomes dating and no longer oh this is my my trick but i'm not gonna i like tricks that's what i like you know what i'm saying um and i decide whether it's gonna go somewhere or if, it, or if it's not so here's the thing i'm not even gonna ar uh, um argue with your tactic because a lot of women do and i think this is really important for the guys to learn that a lot of women kind of come from this angle of you know what can this guy provide to me off I, I would argue most girls do some girls are <laughs> a little bit they don't give a fuck they'll, they'll be more overt about it like you and then some girls try to sneak it in but yeah, the guys, this is what you need to know is that a lot of girls are going to kind of come in with this mindset of what can you do for me? And they're going to want to see if they, they'll test you. Hey, mm -hmm. are you going to spend money? But here's the thing. Girls have tried that on me and I'm like, uh, no, you, you you got it. And then they'll still yeah. fuck with me after. But you you need to because here's the thing. When you spend money up front like a guy like a, and start tricking, she's gonna be like, all right, bam. Now you're in the customer frame. I need you to spend a, a certain amount of money on me before I take you serious. Mm -hmm. And then she's going to. And I would argue that once a guy starts tricking. It's in the girl's best interest to continue tri to co to continue not fucking you. Yeah. Because as soon as she smashes you, the money's gonna stop. stop. Let's, mm -hmm. So is it really saying? not all the, time. all the time? Sometimes but... not all the time. Yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. Sometimes not all the time. Yeah. Depends on the guy. Depends on the guy, and that's where questions come in. You ask or you ask certain questions, and you she see. Finesse, and I like this. You see what kind of guy that I'm you're dealing with. Here. You know, <laughs> you <laughs> know what kind of guy you're dealing with when you ask certain questions, mm -hmm. and you see yeah. what happens. But see, but see, this way important. She was engaged. But so that, con that connection to be there because if the connection is there, he's gonna want to do it already, uh, already, right? right? Automatically. But if you just exactly. ask for it indirectly, it's like, nah. Right, it's like, is that what you're here for? Is that why you want me? Like, but he's against you. It's a double edged sword. Yeah, I see where sword. she's going because she's man, getting hers first. She's when a man first. sees yeah, value in you, he will not think like that. If he doesn't see value in you, then of course he thinks like right. that. Yeah. But if he sees value in you, he sees you're a but, high value woman, yeah. a high value woman, he's not gonna think Shraggy? Like that. Yeah, that's what I was gonna with, say. With all due respect, I don't think a high value woman exists without a high value man to co sign Incorrect. her as a high value woman. Well, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Because yeah. because uh, you know, like you can't call yourself no offense to Queen here. But you can't call yourself a queen unless you have a king to designate you as a queen. Yeah. So mm -hmm. you know, I my thing is I think gotcha, that, you know bitch. you got regular guys, <laughs> you got you got regular guys, and you got high value guys, right? And then uh, high value guys rare, which is less than top ten, uh, ten percent of the population. So he's got to be able to co-sign you as a high value woman. And the reason yeah. why I say that is because a high value man is dictated by the market. And what is the market? Well, the market is your peers, uh, like other people that respect you. What value do you bring to the world? Like, mm -hmm. like men, we're evaluated on how much money we earn, but the money we earn. Is typically provided by shown by the value that we provide, whether we're a musician, a doctor, a lawyer, whatever it is. Um, what you do for the world, what you bring out to the world is where your value is determined. So the market mm, decides your value. Exactly. Now, let's be honest here. What is a woman's main marketability? Her looks. looks. Fantastic. Her looks. Okay. Who's a consumer of female beauty? Men. Men. Therefore, men are the market. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So a woman, in my opinion, can't call herself 
a high value woman without a high value man to co-sign her as said high value woman because now you've been able to attract and more importantly retain me as your man so now you are a high value woman by as a byproduct of me being a high value man because a high value man isn't hard to come by e either so there the fact that you're able to bag him and that's your man even if he fucks with these other bitches you're a high value woman right but you know but that's what i'm saying you're still yeah. a high value woman yes I, and yes. a man will be able, yeah. a high value man will be able to recognize that if he if he if he if he cuffs you up yeah. yeah, but if you make him trick, he might not do that. So if a successful it's a, I see woman, doing, it's, a, it's a it's a game. Know, like it's, it's sometimes it wins, sometimes you yeah. lose. There's sometimes been girls that gamble. Yeah. Here's it the thing. Gamble. Gamble. And that's why I'm not even. I, I really like this conversation because there's a lot of girls that use that strategy successfully, where they're able to get a a simp to trick on them, and then they're eventually a, they, they become a girlfriend or a main chick. You know, well, but girlfriend. it's it, you know it, it could happen. It's but a, a it happens slope. a lot in Miami, but it's a slippery slope. All right, you had a point. No. Points over with. Somebody said, what a strange no, go, woman. Go ahead, man. You can say it. Go. I think there's there's a lot of high value women, a lot of successful women who've done a lot of great things in this, you know, this world. For so sure. I feel like, you know what I'm March. saying? You can't say that there ain't no high value women. I'll tell you why. Because unfortunately, and I've said this on a podcast many times. Oh, unfortunately, Oprah. women are not. Huh? Oprah. Nobody thinks she's fucking attractive. And she's, she's single, right? Value. Isn't she single? No, no, no. Like, she's single. been Here, riding. The thing. That's yeah. a problem. Is but she that's single? Uh, let me just finish my point. <laughs> Oprah is a fantastic example. Yeah. She's successful financially. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's doing well, billionaire. Mm -hmm. But guess what? She's no. single and no one cares yeah. about that. Mm -hmm. A woman's success, mm -hmm. unfortunately, women are not respected for their success like men are. A man's value is determined by what do you bring to the world. A woman's value is determined what can you create and bring to the world yourself, your children and your family. When women meet and they shake hands, well, not shake hands, they hug each other and kiss each other, whatever. Oh, my God, do you have a family or do you have a boyfriend? Whatever. When two men meet, what do you do for work? Yeah. Men talk about things. Women talk about people. This yeah. so specific. so specific. Huh? It's too specific. To too even specific? Gen you generalizing too much. I mean, this is how the world works on to. generalities. Yeah. I mean, if you how want to use cool. exceptions to the rule, you want to use Oprah. Oprah, in, in, in the eyes of biology, is a failure. Yeah. She does not have yeah. a man by her side. She does not have children. She's successful, but unfortunately, she's using the male metric of success. Yeah. Not yeah. the female metric of success. Not, yeah. and How does that define her success if she's already successful? Money can't save you. Ma yeah. Remember, what? Success, money, money, isn't by money is a yeah. metric of success for men. It is not a metric of success for women. Providing. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. Because It depends what, what you get, what makes you happy. Okay, well, I will tell you this. We know that a large predicator on female happiness is a family and children. Yes. yes. Not success and money. It's yes. true. Yes. I, think yes. it's, I think everybody just wants to be free. I think it's I mean, freedom. You, you, you know, when you, when you have money, right. you, so, you have, you have a lot stuff? of freedom. That's, yeah, that's I true. think that's what it is. I think everything else is just... <laughs> but see, well, you're 20. On. When you get older, <laughs> yeah, just when they say that's going to change. Because right yeah. now you're 20, you're having fun, you're, you're lit. When you get older, you know what? This is cool and all, but like real talk, Oh, family that's my own I family yeah. I think yeah. imagine it's it. not that you have to get older it's that you have to get more experience yeah to talk it, about some stuff yeah it, it, the thing is we've brought and the only reason I tell you guys this is we've brought women on this panel that are in their 30s and they literally cry on air saying I yeah. fucked up yeah and they're wow. successful when they have money and and, they, yeah. and, the and reason, nobody there but they like, don't have anyone there so it's like yeah it, it, like because here's the thing that sucks for women when you make money and you're successful as a woman and you're 40 years old you're not going to have the same sexual market value as a guy that's 40 that has money. Right. And he's not checking for you at 40 years old with money, but a woman that's 20 years old can be checking for him with money. But a guy that's 40 years old is going to be looking at those other girls. Yeah. So I'm not saying that a woman that makes money is useless. I'm not saying that. But what I am saying is that she's not accomplishing her biological reason for being here, getting the best man that she can get and having a family. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Whereas a man that becomes successful is different because he has the options to be able to go ahead and create a family anytime. Mm -hmm. You guys have a finite period of time to be able to have a family. We don't. True. So mm -hmm. that's why I'm saying that. So Oprah, in the eyes of biology, is a failure. Yeah. Yeah. She has, she has, Oprah doesn't have kids, about right? Money. Yes, yeah. she does. Oh, Oprah has kids. Okay. Okay. got money. Okay. Shorty can pop her shit if she wants to. You know Who's gonna saying? pop her? Everybody. Many, many. A lot of motherfuckers. She's too old for that, man. I, I, I don't think oh, you understand. Call it what you are. Y'all generalizing too much. The, the These general, boys. The generalization because... is how the world works, though. Yep. Yeah. We can't yeah. use gross exceptions to the rule. I mean, some of the world works like that. 
Yeah. No, it's true, man. My mom worked with old ladies, and she told me all a lot of these old ladies are saying that they wish you they got, actually you got old women out here seriously. paying thousands of dollars for sex because yeah. now here. they got yep. strangers wiping their ass. Mama, they got a career, they got a house, they got a car. Yeah, guess what? All they got is dogs and cat food, and yep. nobody to go home That's to. That's they it. pay more than that. Men. You a lot of men that like that. Hurt. Hurt. Like for you right now, you don't see it yet because you're still young and you have a lot of attention from men. So you look yeah. at it like, ah, this is an expendable commodity. Niggas hit me up all the time. I can lock anybody down. I don't give a fuck. I'm about my money. No, 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 no. But as you get that's older, that's why I told you. You gotta have two. If you can't have one and one, you gotta have two. Two what? what? Two, two men. So if, even two if it's, wait, even two if men it's, for what? <laughs> even if it's like sexually, say you bisexual. For me, for example, I like to have a female and a man. Okay. You know what I mean? To for be now. to to feel, to feel complete. like complete. You know what I'm saying? Because a lot of men can't please women sexually, but you need a man to help you feel your life in general. You know what I'm saying? So it just depends on what you need by somebody. Okay. That's that might be you, but most normal girls want a family and children. <laughs> yeah. I, I mean, you, might, you I, might be... I want a man and some kids. Yeah, so... so like, you know, that might be she, you, but, she's, but most but, women... But, but, you know, yeah, for them of happiness is a children and family. You might be a, an exception to the rule where you right. want a dude and a girl and that will make you happy. I, I have a feeling that you're young, you're attractive, people are hitting you up right now, so you kind of, like... You have an abundance mindset, which is great. Like, hey, the world's my oyster. I could do whatever I want to do right now. But as you get older, I promise you, your mindset's going to change. Yeah. I'm like, this is what I'm not hearing. I know. You know, you sure. out here on TikTok getting clout, yeah. you know, chat. Yeah. 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 Hey, so I don't like you. Know? Hey, hey, what? Right yeah. now. But, 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 but things are going to change, man, as you get older. I'm yeah, telling you. You're thinking about press, press. You're beautiful. So, women, you're going to start dividing what's of the world. When you get when you get a little bit older, you got old women. When you're young, you're beautiful. You're hot. One mic at a time. There's a lot of people girls give each other terrible advice. You said something? All I said was, I know where you're coming from with the old women stuff because you got old women out here that's paying more than men out here for sex and getting dick and all that good stuff and people don't even know that like they're paying more than the guys out here like, listen we had a woman on the panel yesterday 31 years old not that bad looking um pretty pretty i would say attractive she's paying a uh, guys because she's a sh sugar mama yeah and it's like what the What's going on? Yeah, here? She's it's a sugar hard, mama, or she's the young getting boys. No, she's a sugar she, mama. Yeah. she's paying them for dick. Yeah, yeah. it's harder for. Like, how old is she? The young boy, how, she's the thirty-one. Young boy's doing yeah. it now. She yeah. probably got a husband. How she? Yeah. She's single. She, she, no, she on a scale of one to ten, how does she look? So I can have a better visual. I think that was kept though fresh. It's nah, a transaction. That's a transaction. Yeah. Well, she, she, she not pay them, but she, she was saying she bought some stuff. Mm -hmm. not Shoes, clothes, yeah. all that shit. So it's like, bro. Yeah. yeah. Just I mean, company. Because it's hard for an older woman out here to get dick. I ain't going to lie. Not, not really. It's not that's hard what to what get dick. It's hard to get commitment. Not. Commitment, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. what it is. I always think when those stuff's like, I always think that if you have money, you can do whatever the fuck you want. You can do it. If you want to be a sugar mommy, you can do it. That's yeah. fact. But it's it's not the same. It's not. Because women need that real emotional connection. And yeah. they like, don't yes. Like uh, men, men men we yes. can just like fuck and be all right whatever and like you can kind of do without the emotional connection. Mm -hmm. But like with women it's like y'all y'all need that, bro. That's why I'm saying like yo, when you're young and attractive, lock a guy down when you're at the best cuz as you get older, your wiggle your wiggle room But to what do you mean like lock down, down like don't settle or like just like whatever you find if he's good just lock him in. You uh, yeah. what I'm saying is that <laughs> basically when you're you have the most negotiating power as a woman when you're young and attractive between 20 to like 25 you yeah. have the most negotiating power that's when you're at your best and your peak mm -hmm. so mm -hmm. you can wait beyond that but what you got to understand is that as you get older and older your chances of finding a better and better man go down along with each year that you get older mm -hmm. because as you get older and i hate to say it like this your value goes down this is the craziest part because so, I'm 25 now. Yep. The whole time I was 19, 18, 20, 21, 22, 23, I was dating these guys and they're like, you're so young. Like, oh, you got to wait a couple of years because you're super young. Like, there's some guys that can't settle with younger girls. Like, they need 25, 26, maybe 27, 28. They feel like, okay, now let's get serious. Yeah, let's right settle guys. down. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And, but that's the thing. You long just so they could keep smashing. Yeah, yeah. They, yeah. that yeah. was the guys. Yeah, and long. just so you know, those are the guys from in the past. Not right. now, not the future. Right. Different different whole, you feel Yeah, they're selling you that so that you can just keep yeah. you there. Yeah, yeah. no. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. not look, good. Look at any successful dude that, that has dough, man, he's going to be with a chick that's like between five to 10 years younger than him. Yeah. That's what it is. Like even if they're in their 30s, right? Yeah. They could be yeah. the thirty year old guys I'll act like right they now. don't go younger I and they turned, do go younger. I just turned thirty two. I don't yeah. want to fuck with no chick that's thirty two. That's wow. stupid. Really? <laughs> Hell no. no. My <laughs> brother is about your age, and he would. He yeah, would. I mean, he would just... mess around with the young girls, like play around with them, get what he want. Because but he won't take is them serious. Successful? 
Is he? Is yeah, he, he's he a Marine from eight years. Like he's a retired Marine Corps. Here's for the eight thing: years. if you leave a man to, he's gonna, he's man, yo, if you leave a man to his own devices, he's always gonna go with younger, better, firmer. That's just how it is, man. Oh, actually, shout out to my brother. He actually loved this show and loves you too. Oh, as well. so that, that, that he's captain. He's a divorce. Trying to look out for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He had a divorced dad, and he loves you guys like like crazy. No, that's awesome. But yeah, no, I wouldn't fuck with a thirty-two-year-old girl. That's that's dumb. That's that that me. Fuck with a okay as a man, right? If you're like a 40 year old dude, right, and you deal with a girl that's 40 years old, that's like that's dumb, number one. And then number two, that's like a girl that's like 21 or at her peak, 24, dealing with like an 18 year old guy. Mm-hmm. Or same age. What's the benefit? What's the benefit? Right. You're with a guy either. that's that's not developed, young, yeah, lives with his like, mom, no yeah. money, no Bro. security, whatever. Why am yeah. I gonna deal with a girl that's 40 years old? Old. It probably mm-hmm. stuck in her ways. Not stuck in her ways. I've heard, ways I've heard a lot of guys that actually really. like because older, older women. Hurt. Like I would hear like sex old, 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 old for sex because women for older sex. women know what they for want sex. and you know guys like older for women for the experience sex. in bed, but that's it. Okay. For to, sex to marry and wife up? Hell no. Unless he's broke and he wants to use her for money. For sex or for money. I got a cramp. Older women are recreational use only. People can get mad at me. But that's the truth. Like, they're recreational use only. Just I, like I see why people be cussing your ass out. Nah, I'm mad at you because yeah. I feel the same way. Yeah. But, yeah. Like, like, I need to shut up, you're, though. Because I don't want nobody to curse me Well, hear me out. Hear me out. Are you going to fuck with a dude that's 19 that lives with his mom? No. no. Exactly. Because he can't provide you utility, right? No. The, of what you need. Yeah. Same thing with me. An mm-hmm. older woman, I don't care how much money she makes. She can't provide me the utility. She old, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, what the fuck? Yeah. Like, she's old. She's stuck in her ways. But what if she's sexy and not stuck in her ways? Yeah. Well, here's then someone would have picked her up. That's a fact. Someone would have someone would have picked her up. If she allowed it. Thirty plus. That's single. With single. Bro, I'm like your red flag. Yeah. 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 Red flag. Red Thirty flag. plus. Yeah. 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 You really so you're really red going flag. around saying what is wrong? Like yeah. we don't know what yeah. yeah. society flag. right now. Why you? Why you? Why you, why so you not married? Red flag. It's no surprise. Unless you just divorced. Shorty might be red flag. Right? She had a dude maybe. For three years, broke up. Four years, broke up. Five years, broke up. No, she's 30 plus, right? Yeah. And maybe she even had kids. She had a kid by each dude. She might be a perfect girl. But that baggage, I'm not dealing with that yeah, shit. Yeah, hell no. Hell no. <laughs> so yeah. that's what it is. You're right. You're right. All right, I'll make it simple for you. Let's say uh, we meet, right, on a day. I'm 32 years old and you find out I'm a virgin. What are you going to think? I'm like, okay, Come I got to marry this guy. <laughs> Wait, no, thirty-two years old. You're yeah, 32 years old think, I'm a virgin. I would think that you're a good guy, and I'll yeah. think, okay, like this is this can go something serious because he's not corrupted by the sexual women of the world. If, if right. I don't say I, that, but you're, you're no, I would be I, super happy I, because I, don't know. Men, I would yes, be like are, something no, is. I would range. think you're stupid. <laughs> I would think <laughs> something is off. No, because uh, you no. Uh-uh. Yeah. Because clearly other women don't find me attractive. That's why I'm stuck and I'm a virgin. Uh, even though, because here's the other thing too. A guy that's a virgin is going to have certain weird habits. Like they, they, 32 years old, being a virgin, your son's going to be off. Yeah. You know I mean, what I'm saying? Her same argument but, against her. You said earlier, right? I like weird people. need experience to understand yeah. what life and sex is really about, right? Yeah. Same thing with a guy. 32, virgin, he has no experience. Yeah. I was going to understand you and what you really want, what you're yeah. really about. He can't so understand. Tell his ass. Well, I was going to spin it back around. Okay. Just like you guys meet a guy that's a virgin, like, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? If I meet a girl that's third in her 40s and single, I'm going to be like, what the fuck is wrong with this chick? I think me yeah. because, oh, let me just finish. Because a guy that can't get sex clearly is not attractive to some degree. And a woman that has been able to get a guy to take her serious for a period of time, something wrong with her. She's mm-hmm. not wifey. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Same thing. Yeah. A guy that can't get sex is the equivalent to a woman that can't keep a relationship. Both of them failed in their job. Bam. See me? Yeah, they don't like you because you speak the truth sometimes. Yeah. That's the problem. Sometimes. Yeah, Cause, cause, yo, sometimes. Cause, sometimes. Cause, sometimes. Cause, sometimes. Because, yo, real talk. <laughs> We don't like to tell women that they're losers. I love to tell women they're losers. Mm-hmm. If you can't Can we say something around, else besides losers? I don't like, like, I don't like, like that word. I don't, I don't like, like that, like that hey, word. Hey, there's oh. winners and there's losers, okay? Yeah. As a man, if you're out here fucking these chicks that you want to fuck and you're able to pick any girl you want, you're winning, okay? Really? Now, as a woman, if you're out here and you can't keep a guy th- to take you serious, can you retain the guy? You lose. There's no participation trophies. Yeah. It's simple. As a man, your job is to fuck as many girls as you can because that's what guys want to do. They want to have the baddest chicks and get the most of them. We want quantity. As a woman, your job is to find the best guy and get him to re- to take you serious. Our job is to attain the girl. Your job is to retain the guy. If a girl can't retain a guy, she is a fucking loser. Then everybody Simple. losers. 
because you can't hold on your man. And it's like, uh-uh. There's, like, there's, a, there's okay. always a winner and loser, but okay. we don't like to tell women that they failed or they're a loser. We want to give them participation trophies. It's okay, girl. Manifest it. That, that guy's going to come. Women be lying to each you other all day. You a queen no matter what. <laughs> No, no, mess a queen, no, mess a queen. We're not lying. But, 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 a there's winners and losers, bro. There's yeah. winners and losers. So right. keeping a man, like, okay, keeping a man, you mean like y'all still fuck with each other or are you not getting cheated on? Keep no. him as in like, is he here's the metric. Like if he, someone he, broke he, into the house, is he willing to die for you to protect you? He better. He better. He better. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. listen, I had to step I, up. I, mean, gonna cheat. I had Shoot, to step I got up. A we gonna have I'm a whole the type of girl out. where if <laughs> I if I I'm a person where I would step and protect my family because I'm an older sister of like seven brothers. So if I have that instinct to protect and I'm with a man that can't do the same. What the hell am I doing with him? Okay, but and what all my brothers that are gonna look at me and say, "What the hell are you doing with this guy?" I have something okay. to say. Well, that, but that's what I'm trying to say because you said, "How do you know if a guy takes you serious?" I'm saying, if if he's one to protect, if he ain't you. gonna protect you, Laquanda, you really have some nice titties. I don't know if that's a push up bra. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know if that's a push up bra or not. I'm just saying, like your cleavage is popping, boo. Like I'm looking. You look Whoa. good. Okay. Them titties look good. Are you? Are you? Are you uh, bye. I love women. Women are so beautiful. Okay. Right, so um, afterwards, there you go. No, I'm just saying she got some nice titties. That's it. I'm looking at them. I see them. Speaking they of my nice. titties, uh, uh, you know. But yeah, so that that's that's what it is. Because like I, I call out both people. I, I, if a man's a loser, I call him a loser. If a woman's a loser, I call her a loser too. There's it's just that women don't like to winners, take L's man. and don't like to be called to be reminded that they can take L's too. Yeah. And so, when when I lose, I'm like, fuck, I lost. I gotta win. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Gotta get. Gotta come so back. So if a man protects, I need another victim. If a man protects text me that means you're not losing is that in my eyes if you got if you got a guy that calls you his main chick and he's willing to die and uh die for you protect you and you're actually you love admire and respect him you won but if, right. if the guy is but, is not a high value man if he makes you happy that's fine but i just know that most you. women Want a guy that has a shit together to some degree? They like yeah, I, you could be like, an average guy. Yeah, I'm not much together. together. Yeah, like what, what I've realized about women is like for y'all, you guys are attracted way different than we are. For you guys, respect's got to come first. Oh yeah, and yes, unfortunately, for me. that respect needs to be done exactly. through the man being accomplished to some degree. He's got to yeah. have competence. So he's got to have a couple things. He's got to have the competence to have accomplishments, which leads to confidence. And then from that confidence comes the respect from the woman. Yeah, it's yeah. a right. perfect trajectory. Yes, yes. Right? right. So. So for women, they need okay, that respect man. first. And then once that respect is there, then you can love him. Yeah. And then from there, mm -hmm. okay, now I'm going to follow this guy's lead. And yeah, and, yeah then, absolutely. And, then, and then my thing is, if you love that man, now that we have all these things together, you respect him and you love him. Now, is he willing to die and protect you? Bam, you won. Yeah. Because you, you have a man that you actually like for real. He's not just some trick that pays you that you see on Saturday nights or whatever. It's a man that you actually love and my respect. And he's one to die to protect you. You won. Yeah. Okay, Bye. Bye. Yep. Look Fact. at you. Yeah. I'm in it. Yeah. I'll tell you this. I'm learning. I'm learning. <laughs> I'll tell you this. Man. After, after yesterday, my 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 hair is gone. So I, I'm uh I'm barely alive here. I'm on life support after yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. We're also on cameo as well, guys. So shout out to you, cameo for the partnership. Yeah, check us out on cameo. So if you need a birthday shout out, if you need a roast of your girlfriend or your friend right. to get in shape or get fit or get life on track, hit us up on cameo. We got y'all. And, and all of you guys at the panel can easily grab someone. You guys are all uh, attractive women. So oh, you can find you. somebody. Bow, bow, yeah. bow. Don't yeah. lie to them. No, it's hard, man. Nice. Nice. I'm going to be honest. Attractive is relative. Bow, bow, bow. Hard. Hard. So I said that word. Bow. I mean, the, the, all six aren't bad. It's not about getting anybody. It's getting the right person. That's the hard, hard part. Yeah. Man, get everybody to choose the right person. <laughs> get everybody to choose. Uh, get everybody to choose. Uh, they right, yeah, can so. you read this first? Bannon 50 Bucks says, he also never cheated on Jay-Z. Banjos asked him if she cheated on him. Would he forgive her? Jiggy Man replied, I hope so. Stop the cap. <laughs> All right. Yeah, Frosty 20 bucks says, Why can't short dudes get a chance when they're ambitious and make good money? <laughs> they're short. Because okay. you're not the answer. Right, 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 exactly. Why can't they get a chance? You short. Right, right. I mean, I, I never said a shortcut guys couldn't get a chance. She you did. can get a chance with me. Yeah. I don't care. Like, <laughs> really? What's up? But short. short. Tall. I told you. <laughs> I'm like five five. You like, sure? Yeah, you're what sure. What if you five three? She tall. What if you five three? Okay, well that that thing better stand up right too. Ah, <laughs> what about wow. you? <laughs> Me, sir. So the question is, what can a short dude get a chance when he's ambitious and has money? He can get a chance. I mean, like I think it depends on the person, man. You have to be a good person. How tall are you? I'm five six and a half, five seven. Five three. He's five three. What you gonna say now? 
I can't. I, I gotta get to know him. Not for me. I, I did date one guy that was not my type, and I end up actually growing feelings for him, yeah. and it taught me like yeah. it, I, I'm, I connect off like vibes. communication. Like I have to feel safe to be vulnerable because I'm a super like tough person. So if I feel vulnerable with you, then you, you got it. But I mean, mm-hmm. but to get that, because to get me there, so that's enough. It's oh, impossible. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, got you, fam. <laughs> You stupid. <laughs> oh my so god, they better stop. <laughs> These buttons be killing Yo, me. They better stop. Is, if a guy is uh short, but he has ambition and money, you would give him a chance. You say short, shorter or yeah. short? <laughs> shorter you. Oh, hell no. How tall are you? Five foot. Because right. you don't know why? Because oh my, my children finna be five foot if he be shorter than yeah, me. Yeah, but you're okay. happy though. That's fair. No, we ain't. That's fair. <laughs> she said we ain't. What about you? Um, personally, you know, he said ambitious and what else? Yeah, so money? basically, he's and ambitious and he makes good money, but he's short. Okay. Shorter my preference is my preference. I right. won't speak for every woman on this panel because I'm not, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not going to sit here and put myself in everybody's shoes. I personally do not date men that are, you know, really shorter than me. Like, I've dated some short guy, you know, same height, almost a little shorter but yeah. i personally cannot date a man that's five three i'm not attracted to a man that is five three yes you can have you know money you can have ambition and all that but i'm just i don't think that i will really be attracted to you like okay. mm-hmm. you know i've had guys that were you know really funny you know five three we talked we had conversations but it's just something about me being with that type of guy i'm just like you know i i can't but uh he uh you're, looks up to you, you're not though. attracted Look, Wait, he said what? He looked up. He looked. I mean, yeah, like I want to look. I want to be able to look up to him. I don't need you looking up. I just died. I just died. So hold on, hold on. I'm five eleven, y'all. What about Kevin? Like, Damn, about six two in heels. You said Kevin Hart? Yeah. 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 I'm not gonna lie, he's a nice guy. He's he funny. Is a I like he's, he looked real good. I love it's chocolate, funny, so. but he's short. But good. he's short, you and unfortunately. Unfortunately, oh. I cannot give Kevin Hart a chance. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Now that don't mean I can't mess with him though. Yeah. I was. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Pause. Because I asked you earlier in the show. Oh. I said, "Hey, what do you fuck younger guys?" And you said, "What?" I, mean, I said, I'm sure "What?" No, no. Nah, nah, what? What I said? I said what do you fuck shorter guys? And you said. No, but it's Kevin Hart though. Okay, yeah, it's Kevin, it's Kevin Hart, Chris. It's Kevin. Hart. I was I was so, thinking so about Kevin Hart before you said, it, yeah. and I was like, copycat. <laughs> I will smash him, but I will definitely not have a relationship with him. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Jungle fever, chocolate. Okay. Mm-hmm. I don't believe yeah. that. He has a lot chocolate. of money. You would have a relationship with him. Come on. Fact. No, for real. He's short. He, I cannot feel as secure with him. He's yeah, short. but he got money. You gotta be secure, bro. You get I'm security. Fact. 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 What about you? You got security. I can learn to love a person. If, okay, if the money's right. <laughs> when the money's right. The money's right. Shut up. You me all day, huh? Sure, learn that bag of Oh, my gosh. And I also want to say, you have the most perfect nose. Oh, my God. Oh, you and these compliments. I love it. I just, yeah. I'm just like, damn. Yeah, I'm you pretty, too. You're pretty, too. Yeah, you're you're sipping too. on the girls now. Your girls, your braces she might trick on y'all. <laughs> she might trick on you guys. Listen, man. All right, what about you? You've been quiet the whole show. Um, yeah. Right. I'm Listen, sorry. You see your facial question. I'm going to say no. No. Yeah, even though I'm sure if you're shorter than me, then I'm sorry, no. Okay. So you better yeah. learn to love these people. <laughs> I love them. I really do. I love them. I love you. <laughs> so we got uh, Joshua, I'm not gonna bend Scott down. Gallup. Okay. Uh, but good question. Good question. Uh where we at? Okay. Twenty bucks. Uh he goes, uh, she has told me she would <laughs> move person. down to move. It's just that she having to figure out family stuff. We've talked about her moving and being a poly couple, poly on my side, and she would be with girls, no guys except me. <laughs> I mean, right. hey, bro, if she's want to move to you, then then y'all could make something happen. Yeah. Uh, can I say something? Yeah, uh, sure. Go you ahead. have to be the one to put your foot down. Sometimes girls are super nervous and they just like a man that knows what he wants. So mm-hmm. if you just know what you want mm-hmm. and show her that, like, listen, babe, if you want, come see, like, just take control, you know, make her feel like, you know what? I got somebody on my side. Sometimes girls just need a guy that knows what he wants. That's right. Exactly. I'll make it simple. Women yeah. don't even know what the fuck they want to eat for lunch, bro. Yeah. Like, you yeah. Gotta, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yo, plan it out. Yeah. T- tell her what's going to happen step by step. And say, yo, I got it. Boom. Yeah. That's at least it. act like you do. Yeah. <laughs> lie, right? You got to lie? Uh, Trade the gem. Trade the gem. Saying you're the prize is good for your self-confidence. But if you're in the dating world trying to date men, 
then it's the men that determine if you're the prize or not. Okay. Amen. That's correct. That's correct. That's correct. The men, okay. men choose the who, who is in that relationship That's an with. opinion. Uh, J. Martin, 20 bucks. <laughs> Manifest the man you want, ladies. You beautiful Capricorn queens on a totally unrelated <laughs> <note>. asteroid. <Okay. laughs> uh, Brooklyn Kings, I love my black women. I'll die for y'all, but y'all are the most cringy guests on the history of FNF show. Okay. Really? What? Really? No, I mean, you're okay. cool, man. Cool. Nah, I don't think cool, so. I man. think we've been cool the whole show. Nah, they just want me to suffer debating feminists, bro. Yeah. That's what they want. Yeah, you that's what it that. is. Nah, man, we've been I'm cool. Uh, Montclair Bandit. Uh, <laughs> this guy's hilarious. FNF Simpin, A Pimpin, fellas act right, SMH. Yo, this dude made that account because, you know, K Flock shot and killed that guy wearing a Montclair jacket. Wow. And he said, <laughs> he called himself Montclair Bandit, bro. Y'all are hilarious wow. with these names. Because <laughs> he did it when I was doing the breakdown. Oh. Uh, TSK 907, self exposure is hilarious. Keep it going, unicorn, okay? 20 bucks IMZ. Fresh, is it your fault for the reason Myron Elbows is so ashy? Boy, look like he's ashy Tyrone Bigums from uh, Chappelle Show. Bless up, manifest it. Listen, that's man. Am I, am I ashy? God damn. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> am I? Okay. Uh, I was cold, bro. Uh, hello, gentlemen, and 304s. Happy Black History Month. Let's all meet at Pill Cosby's for some celebratory drinks. No, thanks. <laughs> no, thank you. No, and thank then, you. Uh, I mean, Daniel, see, guys, they roast us, too. Where does it come from? Uh, this you got to learn from purposely making mistakes. Wasn't it smarter not to be used up so many times for the man you'll eventually settle down with? That's from well, Jamaica. Yeah. But so um, when I say that, I mean, I wasn't having sex. I'm not popping pussy out here in Florida or wherever the hell. Stop I, you guys, I'm serious. Like I was, you know, I lost my virginity at 18 and then I tried, I was in a relationship and then literally I just focused on myself. Like literally I work and go home. I don't pop pussy. Sorry. Find girl, those. You ain't gotta explain you'll find those girls. I'm only trying to say mm -hmm. shit. I know. I know. I know. Wait, but no pussy ever. No, I haven't. I'm still a bit. I have. I'm literally no, trying to do the. No, listen, you have to know yourself. And I know that I don't want a guy that's going to be you, of the you world. You said you have to go through a lot, though. Yeah, go do it at the date. I don't have to pop pussy. Like I'm dating and I'm not having sex with any guy that I'm dating. Like I'm getting to know people and getting to know myself, <laughs> learning and understanding. <laughs> and it's even better. Women try it. I promise you. Okay. It's even better. She's it, guys. She's it is. Uh, it's like better. It. And men love it too. All right. Yeah, of course you love it. <laughs> For your Wait, yeah, if, uh, well, yeah, because you out there saying they're popping pussy. Do you think they really love that? Yeah. I just, no. I just no, want to say something. I just, yeah, they really do. They do actually. Yeah, they. I have like really like I don't know. Things might happen in the future, but you, I think right so. Now, if they're talk to your dudes, it's much other girls just not. You. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, but I know that. I they, know that, and that's will, why I'm trying to understand. Like, is this something well, we just have them, to accept? Well, they they know if she's yeah. popping it or right. not. Okay, okay. If you're already you having care. it somewhere else, I'm not gonna do something I know I don't want to do just because you're doing it with somebody. That's like a peer pressure. Like, no, yeah. I want to do it because I'm in love and I'm. I want to feel. That's a connection. When you have sex, people treat that shit like so normal. And that's the problem with modern mm -hmm. civilization of today. Like we treat sex so normal. Like that is serious. It's a soul right. tie. And yeah. then we have all this crazy chaos of people shooting up people, killing up people, all this stuff. And it all comes out. from... <laughs> <laughs> No, no it all comes from it comes from like sex and just not knowing what you want. I feel like if you get to know yourself better, like I'm shocked. I shockingly learned I can't date a man that goes to strip clubs. I can't get, date a guy that goes to clubs because those guys for me personally, that's not what is that's Fresh not how not I was qualified. raised. Yo, we, that's not how I look that. at life. So, like but night. I was dating those guys and I was getting dogged the fuck out of because I had to learn what the hell you doing with you those people. That's not, not you. Them. What do you expect? That's not you. Yeah. But I had to learn. And but now I'm church. learning yeah, that see, there's certain yeah. ways. There's certain now ways you, being, you just have to move. Now you're being unrealistic because you want him to wait on you, right? Wait, what? Like, Nigga, you're not smashing dudes, right? So oh, but he, what do you mean, wait? Like, when you meet someone, bruh. I can't be just meeting people and having sex with them. That doesn't make any sense. And you don't even respect yeah, women like that. So why would I do that? Why would I go I and meet someone? They will never respect. know if you're doing that or not. Time. Unless you tell yeah. them. Get they will brush. never but, know. But that's the thing. I'm not going to live in a lie. I live in my truth. Know. I told brush. you from day one, I'm always 100% honest. So I'm not going to fake lie. But here's the problem, I'm going to tell the truth. The guy is obviously into you. You're into the guy, right? You know, for a matter of fact, he's not gonna sit there and wait on you just to, to smash. Yeah, so he can go do his thing. If you want a guy, why does sex have to be the first thing? We skipped everything. We supposed to worry about growing as God a foundation and figuring out is this somebody you want to be with before you open your legs? What to are these they people? Like? Then you open up your legs to these people and these people because leave you so quick. Because they get what they want. <laughs> I agree with you. Why would I do I that to myself? It's a double-edged sword. The I'm just talk. saying. Look, if you want to connect with somebody, right? Mm -hmm. That's real here. <laughs> if you don't do it. 
someone else will. Exactly. And so then that person was meant for them and not meant for me. So that's me understanding hey, hey, what's hey, of the hey, world. Hey, 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 listen. Let Fresh finish his thoughts, then you can talk, okay? Go no, ahead, no. I get what you're saying. But the problem is, what if, right, that person said, you know what, damn, I like her, but she's, I feel like she's playing games with me. Mm -hmm. And you know you're not playing games, but in his head, he's like, you know what? I want her. She wants me. But she's holding back on me. Communication. How do you think he feels? I think it's communication. Like, we got to talk about it. I think a lot of guys, y'all play, like, guys play games and then the girls play the games back and then we're in a the whole game. I don't like the game. Like, be honest. If you feel in your heart, like, you know what? I feel like you're not opening up to me and I need you to, like, be honest with me. Like, at least let me know. First off, not knowing me, I'm not experienced. Talk to me. Let me know what's going on, at least so I can understand a little bit. Sometimes guys believe automatically, oh, she's pretty. So she probably got somebody else she's talking to. So I can't, uh, let me do my game and play a game, you know? And it's like, stop assuming, take charge, ask for what you want, and you're going to get the right girl. They're going to come. They're going to come. The right girl is going to come for you, period. You can't just go around and assume. I can't right. assume. I was assuming I was going in clubs thinking I could find a husband in a club. What? No. What the hell Never. am I doing? Like, You're I thought stupid. I could find a relationship <laughs> or date somebody in a club. Like, come on. You can't do that. But to know that, you got to know yourself. Period. Yeah. I've been searching for this girl. I couldn't find her. It's been tough. Uh, <laughs> all right. I feel you. I feel you. I'm just saying. I hope you guys wrote notes. I feel you. No hey, but I'll be going you in the club. I know. And I'll just try, baby. I'm not going to sit there and wait. I'm, I'm just saying that. I know. And that's the sad thing about the world. Like, I like. let's say someone like me is so sad. I have to try to. You're sad or they're, they're sad? I think it's sad for a lot of girls like me. I have okay. to, like, make up for a lot of. Lost what time. a lot of women have exposed men to, like men, you guys are now spoiled to what you guys it's receive true. from women, yeah. and it fucked the girls like me that actually genuinely just want to meet a but, genuine one person, not ten, not no, two, you know, just what, what, one person what, problem, that's though. a good person. And his problem, you can't reverse it, huh? You can't reverse it now. It's too late. What do you mean reverse? In terms of like, let's say you want to wait and see how things go. Other girls are not going to wait. Yeah. So guess what? Mm. They got your guy now. Yeah. Mm. Unfortunately, that guy's gone. It's like competition. This yeah. I'm trying and to that's the thing. Like, you I'm super go old flow, school. Man. Like, you can't make niggas that are genuinely into you wait. I know. Go you with do, the flow. Yeah. But then I don't, I don't on the first think night and you win as a woman. You don't good. win when you give in like that. I'm not saying yes, that way. Bum. I'm just saying the nigga is genuinely into you and putting effort, and you can see that. Why make that nigga wait? Yeah. Why? What's the point? Just yeah. because I feel like Jesus? I feel like no, no, yes. no, God like that. I'm just saying. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. I, I think it's just like a, a woman. I feel like they feel it. They know. They know when a man is truly there oh, to protect them. Like you can use. I could be like, okay, I know this man really not fuck with me, but let me have sex with him to see if he's gonna fuck with me. And you go have sex with me, and leave your ass, and you're gonna be hurt. You gonna be hurt. Are you adding or, value? You're going to be hurt because he's going to leave you. Like, why would you open your leg to find out that? Usually, you don't have to find out what the man really wants from you to. Let me you don't have to open your me, leg to know me, what a man wants from let me, you. That's let what me, I learned. Listen, yeah, you don't. don't. Yeah, you don't. No, no, no. You, you don't. really don't, man. Okay, you don't. Problem, you, but you can don't. have sex with somebody on the first night and you can be in a marriage for 30 fucking years. Yeah, exactly. but when the hell does that exactly. really happen? You, I've never heard that one time in my life. It happens one day. It happens. Just so you know, right? It happens. You are. The first night we had sex. It she became my wife. Yeah. Now, that being said, does that happen all the time? No. But I felt the connection there. Yeah. We bonded in that moment. I, you know what? I want to see you again. And it continued. Right. Yes. Versus, oh, you know yes. what? I like you, but I'm going to wait because you know what? I Just because see I want to wait. No. no. That to me, okay, Leave, cool. Then get yeah. out my face. Of time, maybe three, four days. What are we for? After that, yo, you playing games now. Yeah, yeah you're playing yeah, games. Yeah. You, yeah. you can tell the first day yeah. if you're fucking somebody or not. You already exactly. know. Exactly. You already know what time I it is. I made somebody wait before, and this was when I was younger. Yeah. I was younger. I made somebody wait just because I'm like, I'm going to wait. And I was doing the wait game thing. <laughs> and when I finally had sex with him after four months of dating, Damn. he stopped talking to me. Yeah. See? You know, but, I know. See? But then I had Because that's with what somebody. he wanted you for. No, 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 no. It's not. No, Why? it's I not. Got no, 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 it's you know, not. Can we let her finish? Can we let her finish? It's not. Her finish? Yeah, it's not. I had sex with somebody on the first day and they're still in my life to this day Damn. and it's years later. And what I'm trying to tell you is you go with flow. Stop with the, oh, I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait. No, go you're fucking flow. yourself up. Facts. Go with the flow. See it's if hard. the guy likes you. Like I was saying, 
put him to the test, but yeah. stop with that waiting shit. There's gonna if be you a lot have of failures. Sex, have sex. It's for you. It makes you feel better. It's good for you. Mm-hmm. It's sex. Sex is good for sex you with someone. I agree. That you like. Here. That you have a connection with. Yeah. And if you go with the flow, baby, <laughs> and you be yourself, and 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 that's it. Shit gonna work out, man. Stop! Stop with that. The sex one. Maybe sex is not important to you. Maybe sex is not not, important, man, because it's deep. It's too deep. Yeah. Yeah. So to be popping pussy three days in, like you got me all the way fucked up. You know what I mean? Mm. Like, nah, man. I need more. I need to see a deeper foundation, something stronger. Because I'm looking for serious shit, not bullshit. I'm looking for three days popping pussy. That's not logical for me. I'm looking for serious shit too, right? And if like I was dating you or whatever, and you had me waiting for a long time, I'd be like. Uh, I'm gonna go to the next girl that I find serious. But and at least, listen, if she thing. let me fuck her. She got some good pussy. This one, you can't. That's with. the thing. Don't assume it. Just ask. Be like, where are we going with this? Sometimes that's all it is. Is just the where ask. are we like, going with? I'm this? a little nervous. I don't know where your head is at. Where, Sometimes it's where are we really going not knowing where, where, where they're going. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> niggas are, n- are never gonna ask you. I, I want to. And fuck. that's what I. I rather. I need a man you. that's real. I need a man that's gonna know what he's want, what he wants, and say it. You know what they're gonna do? They're gonna play in the category. Are cool? She playing games? Are bad? I'm a no games. You see? No, no, no. See? It's a, but it's, they're gonna but, assume our perception is everything. They're gonna say it's no. A, cool. It's she's a game. Games? She's in a box. I'm gonna play, play along until I get what I want, and I'm done. Yeah, hey, that's, you know what? that's what they start to do when you be, when you do that yeah. weight game Real thing. Talk. Oh, or you also want to hold the pussy? Yeah, okay, and then let me fuck let me just get it and talk to you. That's, yes, that's they stupid. will fuck you and stop talking to you. And that's why that's why we have women here popping pussy, not having no marriage because they're popping pussy, so they got no feelings. They can't even hold a man because they got no emotion. As a woman should have emotion because they they're so here every goddamn person in the world. Wrong. Here's where you're wrong, guys. Like, you don't work. But here's what you wrong. guys you can don't do. We can't do the same thing. But, we can't have sex get, so much the way you guys you know can do happened? that. That's Women not the same. We did. We did. So yeah, we okay. did. So now, now, and that's now, now, what now. I told you. We have to you pay for. It. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It. it sucks. So, your argument it sucks. Are you, you trying to make fun of me? No. I know. That's what I'm saying. No, like, no, no. no I just, I just I was come and stop and buy it from Nemec. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. But this, but this is what I have to say. This way, you're wrong though, because you don't have a man, and yeah. you're doing the waiting game, and it's yeah. not working. So, so, just, pop so, pussy, so, pop pussy. What are you no, telling me? No, 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 no. I'm not no. a logical answer. I am what do you not want me telling to you to pop pussy. I'm telling you to go with the flow. I say, like, be in the moment. Be in the moment. Live in the moment. Go with the flow. Not pop. Pussy. Whatever no. it is, if the go guy with can... the flow, if you see, you can always tell. Our intuition is everything. Our feelings, uh, what yeah. we know, is everything. You can tell when a man likes you. You can tell Use when a man is best... Yes, like you said, but you I can right? tell you right now. To tell you off rip. Yeah. Okay, you know he's playing games or he's being serious. Yeah, yeah. You can tell. Yeah, off rip. Yeah, so why wait? Make him wait and play games. Yeah, because after, after, no, after no. you know you like him, why are you gonna wait? Exactly. Yeah, he has that thing. Wait, wait, you guys are question. you guys are second around waiting. Where did we? All right, y'all go from sex, right? Y'all skip a whole lot of shit before y'all even talking so yeah. hardly about sex. That's not what like yeah. we're going so hard about sex. No, as if sex are the reason why relationship lasts. Sex yes. is not the reason why relationships One of last. The big part of the main though. reason. It's a big part. Sex, like, I'm gone. But is, that, is it the only? Is it the only? If it's gone, if, if it's bad, correct, I'm gone. It's gonna fall apart. Let's, let, let's if be it's bad, it. I'm gone. So that's very important. One thousand percent. If they don't got God. Test driving it right. Same thing with a girl or house. Hey, if it's trash. Sorry. So I you can be in a go. relationship with someone that just give you good ass sex and no, they're no. horrible and everything else that's personality saying, wise. They know. Hold on, hold on. We're saying it's an important yeah. point important of the part. puzzle. But is at it... the same time, mm-hmm. there's other things involved. We're yes. just saying if that part isn't even there, niggas gonna be like, "Yo, you know what? It's cool. That I'm out. That part yeah, first. Yeah. That doesn't need to be the first thing that well, a person needs don't to need feel. To be the first no, thing. You don't no. need to feel inside a woman's vagina to know if that woman's the hold right on, one on, for on. you. What do they say first? The connection has yeah, to be there. It has and to. When you're there and you feel you know? it, and you know it's real. <laughs> kind of in the moment, I do. Right? Make niggas wait. I can date point. you. That's what I'm saying. It ain't good. I'm going. If the connection's there after five dates, why make him wait? Don't wait too long. Why not? Cause, no, Cause now you lose. Yeah, he wins. Yeah, I see. It. I, don't I, see, see, I see. I feel like move on. After the fact, after y'all it's get, it's, after y'all have a, you know, understanding. Like, okay, we both like each other. Mm-hmm. He asking, why are you gonna wait though? 
if y'all both have an understanding that y'all like each other, y'all fucking fuck with each other. other. It's just fear. It's fear of like, like, like being you, vulnerable. But that's, that's what I'm saying. You traumatized. You traumatized. Yeah, and I, it's I'm, fucking you I'm, up. I'm scared Wait, of being question, vulnerable. Please? Has there been an instance um in the past where you have given it up too soon and it didn't work out? I've dated because that's what it's when I used to looking like. When I used to date and have sex, I used to go out and have sex with dudes and then think that I was going to get a relationship just because I'm having sex with them. That's not how shit works. That's not how life works. And men see that. So how they like it. Listen, 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 listen. listen. men time, like time, it time. and men accept it. But in the end, when they're truly looking for a real woman, I talk to these guys. These guys are looking, they peep. They peep when you're having sex super early. They Oh, she gave it to me super quick. Like, I talk to these dudes. They prefer a dude, a girl that, okay, like, she she holding herself. Like, no. she respect herself. Like, but is it really her? But because let's say if you've been in a, t a toxic like relationship where a girl says she's being you know nice and then she really wasn't she was actually out there cheating now you're thinking every girl's the can, same can way. I say now something? you have that mentality where if you hear a girl saying like no it's just only one person you can't even believe it because you're traumatized and you're not healed no. enough to understand that everybody's not the same can I say something I think when you're getting into what back then, mm -hmm. when you were having sex with these people thinking you can get a relationship, you were talking about a relationship. After like it was sex. the same thing that you were talking but, about where you say, oh, you're feeling the vibe uh, and you're just going with the vibe. No, that's what you I was doing. You were being emotional. I was doing that. Wait, wait, wait. No, Let's, because that's what were, I am. You were right. an emotional, emotional person. Right. Right. Yeah, but now, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. but that's what I'm saying. You were being emotional. Men don't like that from jump. If you're having sex and you're going with the flow and you're vibing, you're going with the flow and you're vibing. You're relaxed. It's not so, I, I had sex with you. Now we got to be in a relationship. And yeah. I would run problem. off and I would get scared. Wait, wait, wait. I would wait. be like, you want a relationship just because we had sex? Facts. I thought we were just vibing. Facts. You're right. I thought we were just chilling. Yeah, and that's the right. problem. We think I, sex is vibing. Sex is not vibing. Sex is for a marriage. Sex yep. is for real. Yes. Souls to collide yes. and worship each yes. other yes. and know one no. another. And that's, 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 that's where us as women, we lose. I we lose every time. No, no. So, so look. She's been engaged before. You lose. You lose. You need to be. You know, no, no, Women are losing. I'm winning. No, you know what you need? Therapy. No. To marriage. All right, moving on. God. Moving on. Moving yeah, on. this is so Let's go. 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 All right, next. I love you, man. And <laughs> I, I want too. greatness, <laughs> baby. And I would love to. Oh, I love you too, did you, man. Did you rob it a bank? <laughs> I, I mean, I, I thought I'd be able to get one over, but yeah, yeah. She, 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 you know, she uh, dated thugs in, in the club back in the days, you know. Here in a second, but uh, you oh, guys, Lord. Um, allegedly you guys ended a conversation i was gonna rob somebody yeah allegedly yeah, yes allegedly uh, all right i'm right though. have we got all a good show number 20 bucks what the fuck I, is mcdonald's ice cream cone i love you, cream I love I you know, all my no, heart it's just so hard greatness, ladies, 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 and you ladies, deserve some ladies, greatness ladies, ladies, ladies. uh people don't <laughs> thank you because you're winning until, until marriage um, yeah. is she a or is she saying she's searching for a high value man in a sea of blue pill dudes? Ah. Huh? huh? Not I'm me. That's not me. Uh, I don't know who that's for. They're they talking to me. Yeah, yeah, I, don't, uh, I don't understand. I don't understand. He means like, answer, like not your type. I don't uh, understand. Trader Jam Twenty Bucks says, "Ladies, if you want to be married and are going to take dating advice from women, take it from a married woman because yes, that woman's actually winning. Okay. Yes, and she knows I've been proposed to two times, and that's what Just I do. Saying. I live that off that taking that? my advice off um, married women. Trader Jam." Okay, thank I've you. I've been Trader proposed Jane to, too, and that's what two times. We got married uh, women. Dania here. Uh, she says, Oprah isn't single. She's been her male partner for over 20 years. Uh, well, we don't know. Uh, Jay Mark Twitterbug <laughs> says, To a 20 year old that was like having a double digit IQ and a triple digit body count, too late to reverse that ish. Don't listen can to I that. Say, can I say on. something? What? He said that you got a, a double digit IQ and a triple digit body count. <laughs> Is that true? No, what she's saying is not true. Right, she cool. said, "Fuck you, bro." Uh, Respectfully. Then, what else? What else do we got here? Um, we got, um, one second, refresh. I was having too much fun with those fucking hats. <laughs> uh, Jacob Rich, <laughs> Oprah is a biological failure. She's been with the same dude since the '80s, though obviously she's an exception to the rule and married down, which uh, none of these girls on the panel are willing to do. Can I get a haram? Yes. How do you know yes, that? Again, uh, sir. How do you yeah, she has. Yeah, she don't have she family, bro. Kids, uh, but hey, man, hey, you know, hey, she got a guy. That's fine. Uh, cry, if I'm not mistaken, I think I know who it is. Actually, it's like an old. Uh, never mind. All right, cry more, bro. Thirty bucks. Rula says it the best of all time. A lot of women conflate their personal value with their sexual market value. These concepts are two different things, ladies. Yeah, that's true. That's why I say you cannot use that. You can't. Mm. We uh, do though, but you uh, can't. KB to Don. Twenty bucks says men and women are playing two different games. If you play football at a basketball game, you'll lose no matter how good you played. 
Women who put chasing a bag over family lose because they're playing a man's game. That's a good said, point. That was from earlier. I like tricks. You just baiting imps and suckers. <laughs> no man that assures himself will take you seriously. Learn from Mercedes Moore and Lauren Smithfield. Eventually, that trick going to want more. The world is watching. Not uh, all men trick. Shut mm. up. You have anything back? Shut up. <laughs> 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 I'm winning. Game. I'm winning, bro. Uh, I'm winning. Man, we're winning over here. Oddly, Noel, also a Marine vet of eight years. The money doesn't flow in the service like that or by the rank of time and service. He's settling. But if he had the options, best believe he'd be smashing and and or settling with a younger girl. Go. I think he watches our show, so yeah. I think he was just I think he was just telling her the right and the nice he thing to say. He's just trying to look yeah, out. trying to he, not make his sister trying feel to get bad. On. <laughs> but that's uh, the thing, man. Tell the women right. what you need to tell your sisters, what you're gonna tell your mothers. Your your you know. Yeah, I, I, you no know different. what? Um, and that's a fantastic point because I told my sister this shit. She's in med school right now. She's about to be, uh, man. She's thirty. She just hit thirty. Yeah, I was telling Wait, her back when she 30? was like twenty-seven. Yeah, she old, bro. Exactly. <laughs> and I told her, yo, you need to find a guy because she's trying to be a doctor. You need to find a guy while you're still young mm -hmm. and attractive because you're about to make a lot of money, and most guys are not going to qualify for you. You need to find a guy right now. And I don't know if she has, but. That's you know? literally what my brother tells me now. Yeah. Like, he's like, don't be, <laughs> you're done. For don't it. wait, bro. Don't wait. Like, if, uh, I hate to say it like that, but like for a woman, like, it's like scary. Y'all have a finite amount scary. of time. <laughs> Sorry to hear that. Wow. <laughs> it's a scary feeling, guys. Yeah, it's like I mean, a clicking if time you, If you're 40, 50, 60 years old and you're fine, you're all right. So man, not, it's no all right, man. Right you got to lock it in now. You, you, you can lock it in now, but if you don't, it's not. If you find, you straight. Just listen to her. Mm -hmm. It's fine. <laughs> you, know, I mean, <laughs> yeah, you, know, you are right. sabotaging, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the, the plumbing don't work You're getting the worst of <laughs> You were a bit earlier, but I don't know about that. I'll be in my 50s. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, you're 40 and you look like you like 15, 16, 20. No, Bruh, 15, but 16, yeah, the dudes, dudes 20, once they find your age, they're like, oh, okay, I know what time it is. I'm just going to fuck this chick. And then, yeah. AKA, for your relationship <laughs> ability. Is he in here? No, no. I'm just oh, shout out to Daquan. Uh, Venom, the game. if you didn't realize, my last super chat was about Chelsea Christ. She recently turned 30 and was single with no kids, but is a lawyer. An extra correspondent, and she jumped off a Manhattan building recently. Oh yeah, shit! That is true. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. She was. Do you a think that's because she money. was single? I think yeah. there's secret well, I mean, stuff. Unhappy. People, people got other shit going sure, on. In there. We don't know what happened. But that's if we were not to assume it could be. Here, here's what we can say. We know that you know, as feminism has gotten stronger and stronger, women have earned more money, and become more successful. The approval ratings of life have gone down with it. Whereas, mm. like, you go back to like the 70s and 80s, 70s and 50s, when women were, you know, at home or whatever, more traditional, yeah. they had higher reportings of happiness. And then on top of that, we know around 25% of women is on some type of anti depression, an anti anxiety medication, yep. which is, you know, much higher than it used to be. So, are women deriving the same? And here's the thing women make more money and they're more independent and strong and single than ever before. Yeah. Why are their approval ratings going down? Well, I, I mean, you could speculate, but I think a big part of it is because. Uh, traditional relationships are gone. Women aren't having yeah. children. The birth yeah. rates are at the lowest. And, you know, yeah. I've always said it like a woman can. There's a reason why it's called a hot girl summer and not a hot girl year. The reason yeah. why is because you can do the one to two months of mm -hmm. being single and doing the thotty thing. And yeah, yeah, it's lit. But at some point, you're like, man, fuck this shit. I want something more stable because you know? girls yeah. can't run around and sport fuck long term. They Come can't. On. Men can. Women can't, Men though. Can. But yes. if they do, what happens to them? They become like. Like yeah, what hurts happens? their value. Yeah, it does. They're a mess. Yeah. They're, they're like cold hearted men like out there in these streets. Yeah. <laughs> it's true. Right, Lion King, 20 bucks says, oh, my God, shit, I'm not going to like black women, black queens clapping for Myron. Big W. Oh, yeah. They're going to hate me for that. But uh, it is what it is, man. Wait, uh, what did you say? What happened what did you to you? not going to like black queens. What does that mean? Myron. Don't worry. Don't worry about it. But, no, I, uh, mean, we, I mean, we, if a person... Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I saw the clip. I mean, oh, you say, I don't I like black women. You said me and my friend Fresh don't like black women. I seen that. No, oh, I, no. I seen it. I seen it. We said we don't like... Blackies. Ratchet. Blackies. Ratchet. And Shaniqua was like... That's, what, that's <laughs> what they said? I didn't hear that. Oh, Lord. <laughs> he said blackie darkies. That's what he said? No, no, no. He did not say that. I didn't hear that. I didn't say that. I didn't hear that. He said that? No, I said we were... No. It's Man, that's a whole other. If you damn. said that now, oh, we don't have to get this. Do we gotta bring it up? Today, yeah, 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 we do because I was gonna not. bring it up. No, no, no. Man, it's alright. That's we fine. Because we fight with black girls. We don't girls. listen anyways. No. Yeah, we we fight with black girls. It's just that we have a we have preferences, but yeah, yeah. Everybody, everybody got, got preferences. Literally, everybody, everybody got has preferences. a preference. Just like I got a preference, and I don't date short men. So moving on. Yeah, everybody got preferences. That's a fact. Yeah. Uh, Jovan Pajovic. Okay. 
you guys make my working days. Thanks for all the laughs. Keep it up, guys. Aww. And big love from Sweden. Yay! Wow. Yay! We love you, love you, it is amazing to me. I look through here, man. It's a blessing to see. I see U.S. currency, Canada, Australia. Europe, Australia, yes. Sweden. Like, y'all all over the world. What fuck with us, bro. Thank you guys so much. Where's Chris, Sweden? forget pictures. It's in Europe. Oh. Yeah. Stupid. Anyway, uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I was waiting on it. Uh, Chris, forget pictures. We need SAT scores from now on. Oh, what? No, it's good. Uh, Montclair Bandit. <laughs> oh, Montclair Bandit. Scores. Oh, okay. Yeah. The Latina with the braids got yams. I see her in there. I heard Memphis. That ass, fat as fuck. Boop, boop, all that ass, bad dub. Boop, boop, all that ass, bad dub. Are you a Spanish? Love it. Oh, okay. But what, what's your? Because he said the Latina. What, what's your full? What's your background? Just because I know they go ask. It's a lot of shit. Mm -hmm. So you're a mutt. You're a mutt. Mix, very mixed. So you're a mutt. Mutt. Cool. Yeah. Magic <laughs> Martin. You just became a night rider again. <laughs> Montclair Bandit. Uh, Sukhoi. Uh, just tuned in late. Girl in pink glasses looks like she can stab someone by putting her head down and charging. <laughs> <Yeah>! <laughs> what the fuck, bro? Also, happy late B-Day, Meyer. Gonna get you Wait. a gift of buying myself Ethereum. I know that's what you want, fam. Yes, guys. Invest oh, in Ethereum. Girls that pick as a unicorn. Happy belated. Sure. Yeah, I'm, I'm old. <laughs> just me. 20 bucks. Chick in black just wants to present a certain image. She's a 304 in denial. Can't even control her mouth. The energy is so obvious. F and F, thank you for providing real example. Searching. You have anything you want to say back what to What is him? a 304? He called you a hoe. Oh, wow. Okay. What? It's because uh, if you put it in a calculator, it's and ups upside down, it says hoe. Mm. <laughs> so you want to say anything back to him? Like maybe fuck hey, him or something? <coughs> I didn't know that. Me? Me? Yeah, yeah you want to say oh, something sorry, back? Oh, sorry, listen. No, no, no. Um, I wish you blessings and hope, you know, greatness happens in your life. That's all. Damn. Showing yeah. love. Okay, yeah. showing love. What she really meant by that For was... Now. Shut up, bitch! Yeah. Right. <laughs> hint, hint, <laughs> wink, wink. Myron, the girl next to you is feeling you hard, bro. It's because I did that awesome magic <laughs> trick. Yeah. Yeah. Out, of her, out of her headphone. Y'all saw that? Uh, uh, no. Awakened Samurai, 50 bucks. Let's get those likes up. Back hey, to man. Fam. Yeah, yeah. What are the likes at right now? Uh, we have 4.3. Yo, and we got, what, 7,000 plus in here? 7K. Yes, sir. Guys, like the goddamn like video. It's 2 o'clock in the morning. We're in here entertaining right y'all. Are you not entertained? Like the they video. Know what they, and they then we're going to turn it to ladies to ask a question and or topic. And then last thoughts. And then last thoughts. All right, so ladies, think of something that you might want to discuss. Or, or last thoughts. Or, or last thoughts, whatever. Fresh one that needs to go to the club. <laughs> no, uh, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But uh, if, if not, then we'll just close it. All right, here's the thing. We know your value as soon as we meet you. Mm -hmm. Prove to a man your worth, and he'll take you seriously. Making him wait is stupid. Exactly. All right. Exactly. Okay. Can the second girl down from Fresh say, I'm watching you, Mike Wazowski, always watching? <laughs> what? Uh, what does that mean? Because she... Uh... Uh, Mo's like a monster. What does that Pixar. mean, Mo? Yeah, Mo, can oh, you? The the old monster lady from Monster Zinc. <laughs> oh, somebody yeah. said something about me. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I missed it. I missed it. That's the perfect one. Oh, I ain't gonna lie. The best one. Right, I, I really missed you on the show, but that is the that one. Is the that one. is the Which one. The I one it. off of Monster's <laughs> Inc. <laughs> You probably oh, see yeah. Monsters Inc. You gotta bring the Mio yeah. with the oh, glasses. <laughs> with the glasses. Stop playing. Nah. What? Stop playing. No. 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 Like the fucking video, guys. <laughs> oh my That's god. That's for real. That's that deserves two K likes right there. Yeah. yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Stop playing. Shout out to you for being a good sport. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, 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 they roast us too. Yeah. Yo, uh, KB the Don, she's right for not wanting to uh, be ran through, but you're gonna have to compromise with something. Google tantric massage, FY uh, engagements don't count, and neither do marriages. If you filed for divorce, that's not winning. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Ace Boogie ninety six gonna try and make it to the one mil party all the way from Alaska. We support y'all and shout out to the ladies tonight. They've been polite and respectful. Yes, we've had a. Aww. This is a fantastic panel this compared to yesterday. Yeah. Yeah. Um, actually, yeah. real quick, Chris, can you bring up the flyer real quick, yeah, if you sure. don't mind? So, guys, we're gonna have a party. Yes, we Saturday. Are. We're gonna have a yacht party during the day. Okay. And we're gonna have a party at Vendome at nighttime. Ooh. So, if you're here in Miami, pull up. All ladies are gonna be there. It's gonna be crazy. We got celebs coming as well. So, shout out to Consider. He should be there as well with us partying. So, Saturday, February fifth, is gonna be a party at Vendome. So check it out, guys. And I will be there as well. And he will be there. Yeah, 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 yeah. He will be there. there yeah. yep. he'll I, be there. Will, I will be there, unfortunately, yes. Okay. <laughs> and I'll be there, guys. There you go. I'll be there. I won't be drinking, though, but I will be Myron there. Myron with his little thing, just... You have to take a note. Writing shit. Yeah, yeah, I'll be writing shit. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Maren write those on yachts. Bro, he was, yeah. You'll get this right. We're on a yacht getting lit, having fun. 
This nigga's downstairs writing notes. I'm like, bro, what are you doing? He's like, yo, man. Yeah. I'm to- hey, man. <laughs> it's a, two- a three-hour yacht trip, bro. Enjoy the trip. So here's the thing, man. I had to do that YNW Melly case breakdown. Yeah. And I think he's going to get the death penalty, honestly, guys. <gasps> you think so? You don't yeah. think he's going to get out? Nah, man. Who's no. going to get death? No. It's really bad. Uh, I went through, I read uh, the entire case, and I actually broke down the case on, on air, and I read through the entire uh, complaint. And the detectives have him dead to rights. What? It, but what exact? What evidence do they have on him that he keeping him that there? Boy. So, what you talking about? So, so, no, but I'm saying like I'll summarize it for you real quick. So, okay. what ha- so just so people real, real fast. So we because I don't know. No, I seriously we're don't gonna, know. We're gonna switch the law order real Florida. quick. Death All right, so this is what happened. Nine. All right, death penalty. In Florida, Basically, for some of you guys that don't know, YNW Melly, very uh, famous rapper, came out with the hit song uh, "Murder on My Mind." Mm-hmm. I like him. He's a good artist. Blue Balenciaga is, is his biggest hit. Virtual. No. It is. Is, it, is it bigger than Murder on My Mind? No. Yeah. yeah. No, I don't, nah, I don't think. Maybe, no, in, the I hood, hood. maybe in the hood. Maybe Blue in the hood. Yeah. Blue Blue maybe in the hood. Because yeah. Murder on My Mind is what made him blow up. Yeah. Okay. But in Blue the hood. Blue 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 yeah. And then obviously what personality with Kanye West. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, so mm-hmm. now that we know who he is, this is what happened. Basically, <laughs> back in like 2018, him and his friends were in a car and uh, they uh, he got out the car and then his friend, YNW Bortland, took him to the hospital. This is up in Broward County, right here in Miami, in Florida. And there are two, there are two dead passengers in there. And they told the police, we got hit with a drive-by shooting. And there were bullet holes on the side of the car. So the detectives went and basically did a bunch of ballistics tests, looked at this evidence in the car. And long story short, there was no drive-by shooting. Because the way that the, the the injuries came in, it could have only been fired from a, a firearm inside the vehicle. Mm. And the way the bullets came was from where Melly was sitting. Oh, And then not on top of that, they have phone data that puts him at the scene, even though he said that he wasn't there. Yeah. And uh, his friends lied for him. They were able to find contradicting uh, statements and all the stuff using phone evidence that is irrefutable that he was there with location data. And then uh, the bullets, the way they hit and the injury and path wounds all show that you could have only been shot from that direction in the vehicle. Wow. And then uh, what else do they have? Um, and then, uh, damn. Oh, and they found the bullet in the car. <laughs> yeah. Oh, what else? They found, wow. a, they found oh, a spent shell casing in the vehicle that matched a firearm uh, that he has. So and, and there's oh, no way if you were getting hit with a drive-by shooting, there would be a bullet in the vehicle. You know what I'm saying? He tried to say that they returned. And I don't think he even said they returned fire. They just said they got hit with a drive-by shooting. And then it was very mm-hmm. obvious the way they bullets hit from the drive-by shooting is not does not match up with the way the guys were wounded that got yeah. killed. Okay, so if he fights it, what will happen? So if Florida has a death penalty and if he takes it to trial and he loses, they're going to push for the death penalty. Wow. So he's going to die. I, I think if he fights it. And the trial set for March. Ooh. So we'll see. So I, here's the thing. I, I think he needs to plead or something. Come, come, and, if he and, has uh, a really good lawyer and he pays for a really good lawyer, he'll be fine. Is he black? No, but he does have, he does have lawyers. They're, they're, they're not going to win. He's pushing for witnesses to be ex- excluded from the uh, trial, right? Because I think academics posted a video. They don't, they don't, here's the thing. The case is built 100% pretty much on circumstantial evidence. Yeah. Which for no those of you matter. guys that are wondering, circumstantial evidence... Like standing on its own, it's it like if I tell you, oh, well, YNW Melly was here at this time l- l- with phone data, but I'm able to also paint a, b- a picture with, you know, statements that don't match up, etc. Each piece of circumstantial evidence makes the overall uh, case stronger. More true. Yeah. So so mm-hmm. basically the way the detectives have it showing is there's no other way it could have happened. And then their story does not match up whatsoever. Yeah. Damn. So well, and he's is- black, too. I mean, that doesn't so, have anything really to do with it that much. No, nah, it's, 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 it's money. It's but, money. But Yo, yeah, I mean, black. I mean, his, the, the thing is, is that, and oh, and they, they just took his DNA too. And they took his wingspan. So they're going to be able to recreate the shooting when they go to trial. Wow. They're going to do all that. Oh yeah, my man. God. They're, yeah, just, they, they gotta, they're just trying to, if he's black, they're just trying to make sure he takes this death penalty. I think they want to aim not for that. that. It's because it was premeditated. Because look at all there. the killings that's happening and they don't even push well, that well, hard. There, though. No, well, ladies, you got to understand. The, the bullet was in the car, there. man. Look, look, look yeah. guys, guys, this is not a race thing. It's a premeditated yeah. murder one. That's why. Because yeah. it was, a, it, not only did they kill them, but then they lied about it. So what they're what the state is charging them with is premeditated murder, murder one, which is carries a, a penalty of the uh, of, of death, potential yeah. death. Yeah. And he's going to go to trial. So if you go to trial and you lose, this, they're always going to come at you with the hardest penalty now he could appeal it if he gets put on death row which a lot of times happens you know what i'm saying but i think uh, if he fights it he's not gonna win yeah the yeah. evidence is overwhelming and if you guys want to go check out the video i broke it down for like an hour and a half and i re- went through the entire uh there's way more evidence than what i just told y'all too but that's just the summary but yeah y'all, y'all can see it but yeah it was not it was not i good. gotta look at that yeah, yeah. yeah. anyway channels fed it okay check it out uh there you go but uh any uh, does that answer it kind of no that summary? that cleared it up yeah that's just like a summary 
Uh, because yeah, I know a lot of people are saying, "Oh, he's gonna get out." No, nah, he ain't get out. I assumed he, he ain't get out. He said, "Ty, Tran- I mean, he's trying Tantric to stay positive, which massage? is great, but he's not. He's not gonna do it." Damn. Somebody said, "What? Tantric that's, massage? What is that?" Uh, that's something to do with. I think it's a sexual massage. Yeah, I do that. Go. That's what I do. Wait, what? <laughs> This just changed the oh, whole. But se- the massages, oh, so. massages are nothing. Uh, yeah, I'm sure oh, they are. Okay. That's a nice way to be like, okay, I'm not gonna have sex with you, but you're gonna get a nice massage, oh, you're gonna fall asleep and feel nice. What? Wake up, wake up for work in the morning. They'd be happy. Real games. They'd be happy as shit. They'd no, be happy as hell. I see These are hard workers. <laughs> I see why you're saying no. Nigga, you thank this. you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate that. No, guys, we'll take it seriously. Um, this just changed the you. whole. If I he literally if just I told go me to, to a use... guy's house and just you... do massage to him, he's gonna kick me this out. This dude literally say, said, like, "Google try... get the fuck out of Wait, here." That's for you. That's for you. Massage that's for, for you, babe. Him or a massage for you. Are you massaging I'm him? I'm massaging or... him. Like Are I like, I like to massage okay. my man. Like I mean, kind of. Okay, I was confused. Yeah, you're All right. Yeah. So yeah, and no, but the guy is literally telling me, you know, Google it. You know, okay. I'll, I'll okay. check it out. I'll check All right. It's gonna try and make it to the one. Oh, read that one. Shout out to y'all from Alaska. Um, I mean, I'm sorry, y'all. I shouldn't have started all that. It's all good, man. And that's from Amin mm-hmm. Dania. Uh, get the likes up question. Uh, do the ladies like guys who have a lot of selfies on IG trying to prove a point to my blue pill brother? Twenty bucks. That's from. No. 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 There no, you go, no. Friend. Tell your brother. That you know what's more attractive? A guy without an Instagram. Nope, not a picture. That's more attractive, well, honestly. Yeah. I'm that not gonna say that, sucks. but yeah. that's so true. A man with against kind of like, Ugh, what are yeah. you going on there for? You Girl, know? you'll know what you want, man. Oh, yeah. facts. But a guy right. that only have like one picture and have like two followers, it's like, <laughs> what? Do you really exist? <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> Keeping it real. Uh, my co and I pulling up to the party. Bandit, Yuck Mouth, Brother Darkness, Mo 400, and Mr. Misaji himself finna turn up. Y'all 304 is invited too, and that's from Montclair Bandit. All right, thank you, bro. Uh, all right, ladies, so we'll turn it to you. Any uh, comments, questions, uh, disagreements, whatever else, uh, we'll start uh, right here. And that's already got two more if you want to read it afterwards. I'll read after. Yeah, that's fine. No. I, I enjoyed None. the show. You know, I enjoyed our discussion. We all have our points and opinions. Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. Cool. You know what I'm saying? Everybody's entitled to their own opinion. So, you know, it's no right or wrong thing here. You know, we're mm-hmm. all just talking and having a good conversation. I liked it. Thank, thanks for coming, Loved by the way. It, I bring Loved your friends, it. too. Thank you. Well, small friends. Yeah, so sweet. Shout out to the queen, by the way, in the chat. <laughs> She's like a ship, apparently. Megan McQueen in the chat. Hey, shout out ah! to the queen. Ah! What about you? What about you? Uh, what, sorry, what was the question? Yeah, got you. <laughs> comments. <laughs> yeah, any any li- uh, any questions, comments, uh, d- disagreements? Uh, no, nah, uh, man, I think you guys are doing amazing. Um, yeah. congratulations! I love seeing black men out here really working hard. You guys are doing really good. Allegedly, we're not black though. Mara's black. What? Nah, oh, I, I'm not Arab. black. He's Arabic. My parents. Are I from mean, Sudan, so apparently so. we're not black. Mm. Allegedly, we're not black. Yeah, Don't listen to that. It's a joke. But I'm no, I'm part of you guys. You guys are doing it, doing good. You're killing it. Keep it up, man. I'm proud of you guys. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. The argument you had with Fresh was hilarious. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that wasn't an argument. I actually learned from you. I, I'm a, I appreciate it. I got you. But if you hate us, just tell us you hate us. Too. No, no, no. I love you guys. <laughs> okay, cool. I love you guys. All right. I have uh, nothing else to say, but it's nice to see everyone else's perspective. Because she learned now, for sure. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, she's like, fuck you guys. I love you. I oh, my God. Like, I don't want to hear people film where I'm coming from. So, you know Want to show a, chat, a, a little twerk or something? No? On the pole? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. 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 Oh, oh, that oh, oh, oh shit. Okay. 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 Stop playing. I know what she's about. Stop playing. You got all that ass, girl. Stop playing. All right. Chat. So, uh, you're going to be thicker than a motherfucker when you get old. Got you. Nigga yeah. said profound. Give me some of that ass. Thick ass, girl. All right. Thick shit. Did you, you want to like talk about something else or what was that? I'm sick. good. That's a good. That yeah, is, that okay. is so understand that, I All right, so I don't have no final words, but I just want to say thank you, you know, you guys and all the ladies on the show for being respectful today because today was a really, really dope show. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, everybody in their perspectives, you know, y'all came with it, y'all brought the fire and all that. So I just want to say I really appreciate y'all. Also, um, and hit you us know, with a freestyle or hit us with. She's been trying to get me to rap this whole yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, freestyle, Stop freestyle. Go ahead. Stop playing. You want, you want Kill that shit. Because she's the artist. Kill that shit. You know, the And the show on the bang. Wow. Oh. Kill that shit, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Rap. Stop yeah, playing yeah. with him. Kill that right. shit. Ready? Go ahead, go ahead. No beat. I don't right. get a beat. Give her a beat. Ready? No, I don't need a beat. All right, all right. <laughs> okay. Three, uh. two, one. Uh.
Oh man, I wasn't expecting this. Kid okay. that shit real quick. All right. Don't do a beat. Don't do a beat. Mm-hmm. I'm running, I'm running my city. Old town, yeah, they with me. Took a break, but now I'm back running full speed and now they can't get me. Can't reach me. Can't see me. Yeah, they talk, but they mad because they can't beat me. I'm a lot of Oh shit. But she wore though. No, she wore though. On some real shit. Yeah. Yeah. She's wrong. Yeah. Like, go, 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 Go ahead. Go, go, go. Stack your money up like it's the first of the year. See me in public, it's like a world premiere. Money stay climbing, that's why I'm shining in diamonds. Hustle stay with the time, I know you'll be hearing the sirens. Like, whoop, whoop, just gotta get it and go. I said F a nine to five, I had to get it on my own. Yeah, the queen that set the tone, that's why I'm sitting on the throne. Yeah, that's just cause I'm grown. Black Ferrari, let them know. Think it's a game, she about to end up missing. Playing with my coins, baby girl, you better listen. About this paper, it's a mission. Bring a lot, then that's commission. More money, more money, that's the definition. Arrogant just like a politician. Got Donald Trump trying to listen. Pay me what you owe me, don't you? Act like you don't know me. You say switching up your story. If you ain't got my inventory, stay on my territory. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. But make sure y'all follow me on Instagram Woo. at official underscore the queen. Please spell queen it. with a V. Stop and me. support my lingerie and sleepwear business. That is royaltyxvixen.com. Please. Yeah. You should have worn some lingerie today, baby. I should have. I should have yeah. brought the girls out. But you, yeah, you, you, know, you respect me. Okay. Should have worn the day, baby. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Thank you. Talk to you. Um, <laughs> the backup oh. vocals for you. <laughs> I really like to be here every time that I'm here, but I have a question okay. about my dating life, my personal dating life. Um, why every time that I date a guy, they start treating me like I'm their girlfriend, but we are really not like in a relationship. Because you don't why they want to play me like that. <laughs> so well, they want, they want you, you to be playing you because they yeah. want to be in a relationship with you. Is that what I'm guys. getting? Because she don't want. Or is that them. for everybody? Is it for yeah, everybody? Or I mean, us? I mean, I, I think the guys. Though, but... All right, we'll let Mr. Make an answer first, and we'll go after. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. said <laughs> the guys that you're dating are trying to be your boyfriend, girlfriend, yeah. and you're looking at them as why? No, no, they're treating me like they want me to be their girlfriends, but. They're really not trying, you know? So they're like fake they pretending. Want me, they're pretending, yeah. but they they're not really. They want me to really. text them all the time. Hey. They want all that coming in. I'll tell you something. But only Nigga, for my control. control. This is my best advice. Okay, there we go. Divide what is of the world and what is of God. Yes, that's Bruh. perfect. Simple. That's perfect. No, don't do no, uh-uh. Simple. It's perfect. Thank you. It's perfect. It sounds complicated, no. but I promise you it's the easiest thing in the world. And that's what's gonna help you. What does that mean to her though? I mean I have Divide. no idea. What, you're what do you? What do you? What do you? Sorry. What do you Sorry. It, it's who got, she is. Got, look, look at this young lady. You have something? You're very pretty. I would say if he if he act like he you know what I'm saying, he just wants you to have that at pussy be exclusive. That's all it is. Yeah, and that's all dudes want. But they gonna trick on you. Period. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Yup, yup, be the bitch. Very straightforward, but I mean, yeah. yup, yup, be the bitch. You have to literally take the game as it is and move accordingly, period. And you, you go, so like, true. you know what I'm saying? You might find a couple people who are going to be loyal to you maybe for the rest of your life, but the majority going to cheat. You either going to go with the flow, you either going to leave the ass, or you going to take it as it is. I mean, I'm not talking about the cheating part. I'm talking about more like they want me to text them all the time. Yeah. They want me to be with them all the time. They want you to be exclusive. Yeah. They want you to play a girlfriend role without actually being a girlfriend. Yeah. Wow. Why? 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 Wow. Why? That's, Why? That's, That's the question. Wow. That's like, what is wow. pussy? That's all I heard it was all this hallelujah from this Christian. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, is that a real you guys sword? know. Uh, no, it's plastic. But it doesn't oh. matter. I can still do some damage with this thing. Oh. That's what's up. So the Honor Killings yep, will commence yep, after the show. So, <laughs> allegedly. So uh, Yes, allegedly. Yes, the Honor Killings will commence allegedly after the show. Oh, wow. <laughs> to the, the Christian, and then you said something about sucking dick or something. So you <laughs> also need to be hit with the Honor Killing. And then, uh, well, and then you be tricking. Killing, so you got to go down as well. <laughs> and then who else was committing Haram acts? That was just them three, right? Me, yeah. me too. Probably all of them. Yeah, all, yeah, 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 yeah. You too, you too. Yeah. I ain't do nothing. Me? Yeah. Who you? Wait, what? I, 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 I was nothing. lost. I said I ain't do nothing. <laughs> I, was, I, 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 really, I was in my You own gave world. that terrible rap earlier. That's what I'm too. Oh! So you gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. All right, who's up next? Uh, oh, oh, Somebody so, said oh, say oh, bow again. I, uh, I so, missed so, it. so the question was, I have no answer. Why do guys give her 
uh, boyfriend energy yeah. when she knows that, that they don't really want her. And she said she wanted the guy to answer. So just for example, they're selling you a dream. And, mm-hmm. <laughs> and you're laughing. It's unfortunate. Shut up. <laughs> yeah. Listen, man. So, so with the dream selling, right? Okay. They want you to be for them only. So they'll play the part to get you in the door mm-hmm. and keep you there in that little like bubble. Yeah. Exactly. However, you already know up front that they don't want you like that. So you know what time it is. Just play along if you want to, or cut mm-hmm. it off from there and say, yeah. "Yo, this 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 not what I'm yeah. about." That's it. Yeah, Pretty that's much. how you gotta take. Don't be afraid, guys. In general, you don't know be saying? afraid to cut people off when you need to. Yeah, yeah. don't be. It's I mean, life. I, I wish I knew some it. more facts, but just from what you're the face value you're telling me is what it sounds like. He's trying to keep you on the string to continue to get sex from you. Yeah, and he knows that mm-hmm. a promise of a relationship will do that because guys know deep down that that's if they're only the giving you sex and nothing else, it's only gonna go for a period of time. Girls don't normally do that. Like, like. Girls are always going to want something more yeah. when it comes to like a relationship. They're not going to just continuously That's have insane. indiscriminate sex with you for a long period of time. They're going to want something, whether it's a, it's like a situation shift, some kind of form of commitment. So him knowing that that's going to come down the road, he's trying to already kind of pivot and put himself in like, oh, yeah, okay, I, you, could, I could potentially make you my girl. So he can continue to extract sex from you. So, so continue. Yeah. Bow, I mean, bow, unless, bow, is he doing bow. anything else for you? Like, is he actually like doing anything for you? No. Like, are y'all going out doing anything? Yeah, we always go out. We just eat. He okay. buy me whatever I yeah. want. He always like, oh, are you How often you guys and hanging out? It's been like on and off, you know. Like One once month, a week at least. Yeah. <laughs> not even. Not even. Not even. Not even. Okay, then no. yeah, he's just yeah, then it's captain. Bow, 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 <laughs> bow, bow. You see, you guys say it. You guys are saying it. <laughs> bow. No, it's <laughs> true, <laughs> but it's true, but it's true. All right, moving on. All right. <laughs> <laughs> bow, bow. <laughs> All right. What was the question, y'all? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> any thoughts? Any last, questions? Last comment. Uh, comments, okay. questions. I will have to disagreements. say. Icy told me when I came on here I was gonna be talking about my oh, you music. You came through Icy, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's my dog. Plug Shout out to Icy. Plug your music. Yeah, plug your music. Plug your music. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, um, I want to stream. We can stream my music because I'm an artist. I came in character. Next time I come, I'll be Ashley. I'll be my regular self. But today I'm Spike. Um, I came in character. Um, so yeah, I'm an artist, and Icy told me I was gonna be streaming my music. So what's up? What's, no, no, what's going no, no, no. on? Listen, well, listen, listen. You can tell them where to uh, find it. Yeah, tell them where to find we, it. My music on YouTube for us is gonna be kind of like come often. Uh, yeah, uh, and then maybe. Yeah, because yeah. yeah, streaming music on air is, is uh, yeah. problematic. On even YouTube. Yeah. even our Copy- voice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we don't have to play music. Yeah. All right, so y'all want me to freestyle? Y'all want something? Y'all want something that's like? That's why I asked you earlier if you're a rapper or singer, and you just said musician. You wouldn't tell me. Cause I'm everything, baby. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. So, and I can perform my motherfucking ass off. Stop playing with me. So, um, do you guys want some conscious stuff, or do you guys want to hear the regular? We want to hear the girls. real deal. City girls. Want to hear everything. City girls. City girls. The best. City, City girls. Girls. Your, your, your best one. Your best one. Yeah, I don't. I don't have a best one. I have a lot of good ones. Okay. Okay. But go ahead. I have go so ahead. Different shit. So I'm gonna just taking plates like we dined in, get in line then. I'm the hottest on the grind, make them niggas bow in. You see me, I'm a shine, I got on VVs, watch me like Spike TV, he wanna see in 3D. He put some diamonds on my neck, so when I throw them, he say, burr. I'ma ask for money for I fuck, I know my worth. If we beefing on the grand, bet I pull up to your curb. If he pass me the blick, I bet I put that bit to work. And matter than all of them. If I fuck, I want to follow a friend. And I'm thinking about bucking him, Lord knows I'm ready for the consequence. The fakers be the ones that call you friend. Pussy bitch right now, 12 and no. And the paint bitch, I'ma let them go. South shit, you better let them know. Yeah. <laughs> And then, uh, and uh, yeah, guys, you can find we'll, we'll have our IG down there. All your music's on your Instagram, right? They can find your, all your stuff. Uh, I have all my highlights. You can go to the Spotify Perfect. and all that stuff there. Yeah, Spike Perfect. Lil Slim. You got all my links or something like that. Thank you for coming, right? And I got a link tree. Yeah. Cool. Perfect. Shout Perfect. to Icy, too. Yeah, shout yeah, out to Icy. Shout out to Icy. How about you? Um, I don't really have nothing to oh, say. Oh, you're here. Oh, never mind. I thought what we were finished. Yeah. Oh, shit. oh, oh that's rude. <laughs> nah. <laughs> but, but yeah, I think everything went very well. Just I think everybody needs some God in their life. You know, not everything is about lust. You know yes. what I'm saying? And that's yeah. where. Yeah. So that's yes, thank you very much. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes. All right. All right. I think uh, the Myron Muhammad is gonna honor kill her as well. I was talking about allegedly. It's, it's, it's Allah or is a God. I say God. Oh, then yeah, you got yeah. to kill. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I do agree with Hell what you're yeah. saying. I think the world could be that way, but it's not. You know? I know. Yeah, because we live in a world of sin. That's we what do, it is. Do. Come we on, yeah. I know you ain't talking. Hard. You just smashed three weeks it's ago. So hard. Um, all right, three weeks ago. It's not but today. We can go. We can go. So, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> but we can go. They said dark skin needs therapy. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, dark skin needs therapy. She's going to let 
fear lead her to b- buying a cat and dog and dying alone. You don't have a lot of time. Stop wasting yours I know. and others. I'm going to grow balls. I'll grow balls, guys. I'll do it for you guys. All right. Oh, no, we don't want to see your balls. <laughs> no, I want to see your balls. <laughs> All right. And then 20 bucks. Please stop with the race card. I ain't even black. And I find the girl in pink next to Myron as an attractive black woman. That's a compliment. Okay. Wait, uh, what happened? 50, 50 bucks. I think they were talking about when we were talking about the YNW Melly thing. Uh, 50 bucks. You have trash. Had to mute the stream. Oh, man. Montclair, Montclair Bandit. Bandit. Because if I cap, you'll throw that ass back. No. <laughs> <laughs> that was fire not gonna lie Myron happy belated okay, hey, okay. Hey. all right and that black wolf ink 20 bucks thank you fresh fit for once again proving these three three true facts death taxes and females cannot rap worth a damn <laughs> <laughs> just look at Meg the male horse her career is man dead oh. mad dead oh shit uh, <laughs> all right oh, uh, literally everybody in here. why do I talk out of everybody well, why, why Meg don't want to be a rapper everybody so guys, out of everybody <laughs> once again party's gonna be Saturday pull up to Vendome we're gonna be there it's gonna be lit and then, yeah, man, uh, we got a show tomorrow. I'll be late. Michaela Peterson? Yes. Yes. We, we have yeah. a show with Michaela Peterson tomorrow, guys. And then we got a late night show. And uh, yeah, we'll catch you guys um, tomorrow. Mariana. Tomorrow, uh, today. About Bye. 7 30 p.m. Ciao. Technically today. Yeah. Peace, guys. Peace. Bye. All the night is my world. City light.